Thanks for tuning in to a stream on the internet. Um, 
If you're uh, just here for a few minutes before the Superb Owl, thanks for stopping by. If you're going to watch the big game, hope you have fun. Um, are we going to watch the play ball? No. I'm going to play some goddamn Zelda. I didn't go to a bunch of Super Bowl parties as a kid and put in the put in my time just to have to watch football when I don't feel like it as an adult. I'm going to play video games. I do quite enjoy watching football, but I, I, I don't follow any teams in any sports. So I'm just kind of like, who's playing? What? I, I, I enjoy watching sports with a group of people who are all into it. And when I can be like, who am I rooting for? Great, got it. But that's side I'm just kind of like, eh. I ain't paying for that. Anyway, hi. Hello. Da -da -ba -ba. Welcome back. Uh, today nice. we're going to um, play more of this video game. We got dropped into the dark world. And now the world is our oyster. If oysters were big areas you could run around on and had secrets. So uh, I'm excited to dive into the real game, which begins now. Um, the Chiefs, because I live in KC, let's go. I hope if they win that people don't explode your city. That's what I wish for you. I had this game sitting on my 3DS home screen for months, and you motivated me to finally give it a shot. Maybe or not, I've already finished it. Oops. It's good, right? How'd, how'd you like it? Dark World is reductive. It's low roll. You're right. My mistake. We're in low roll. We're going to check it out. Um, did the... Hello? Okay. I was like, I looked over the capture. I'm like, why is it just... Is it frozen? No? We're good. Everything's fine. Hi. How are you? Um, God, my Super Bowl. I just hope the ref is fair. Hope the ref is fair. Thank you, Jim. Hello, Super Bowl. Watching Bear Stream and crocheting. Nice. I was reading SoCal. The NorCal team got me defensive, so go Chiefs. I know. It's like, ugh. How you doing? Hey, thanks for the bits and stuff. Appreciate it. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna, uh, hop into it. Uh, very quickly. Um, I thought it was important to update everyone. First of all, uh, it's not working on this chat, even though I uploaded it like an hour ago. Um, uh, uh, X Silver Sugar, who made thi this, this, they made... Uh, th hold on. Hold on. Hold on. They made this last time. Um, I was like, hey, you cool with me uploading this as a BTTV emote? And they're like, absolutely. Um, so it is up on BTTV. It's called Dudes. And live chat can see it, but VOD watchers, you just have to... Every time someone says Dudes, picture this in your brain. Wiggling around. I did... I did try... I was like, that's rad. I was already planning on trying to draw my own, like, Barvatar doodle guy. So even though Silver Sugar already did this, and it's fine. Um, I, I, I drew my own and went, no, I'm just gonna upload Silver Sugars to BTTV. Um, let me, let me find, hold on. Um, uh, here he is. Here he is. There he is. I, I, I... He, he's got a vibe to him I don't dislike. There he is. But in terms of like, does he look like he's drawn into a wall made out of scribbles? Nah, I don't. Hmm. Yeah. I shared this with my with my uh, private server, and, and and Shiv said he wants uppies. I was like, yeah, he does kind of. Looks like he's made out of a beanbag. I hate Discord. Sometimes I'm gonna take a nap again. Hi, Mithra. Hope you're doing good. What did Discord do? Are they exploding? Bot API integrations degraded. Let's go. Yeah, no, it's, it's fine, Mithra. Captain Hook's taking a nap. I hope you're doing well, Mithra. Have a fantastic night. You're great. We should hang soon. I've been saying that for a long time, but I do actually mean it. Things have just been kind of nuts. Hope you're good. Um. Also, I do, I do want to share, um, completely unrelated tangentially to all of this. Um, we were watching, uh, Lord of the Rings... The two towers, um, and and I, and I was I was banished. Um, I was ban I was banished to the street corner. Um, while we were watching it, and um, decided scared you share share that with the why I it's where I well I street corner the worst place to be yeah. You bring up this, not the other jokes. No, Gam. God, no. Why would? I? Oh, um, but yeah, I, I did. That happened, and and Virgil did make a. They know I'm straight with me in the corner at the party, uh, which is as effectively what was happening during the call. There's not really much context. 
other than like Aragorn and, and Arwen kissing. And I'm like, straight people, where are you at? And they're like, you're gone, banished. I was like, yeah, that's, that's fair. Um, and then also this was posted in, in the Discord. <laughs> the LGBT community has accepted Barry with the crunchiest thumbs up ever. Uh, which, if they have, thank you. Um, I don't deserve this honor, but I, I, I'll, I'll try to live up to it. Um, I'll hang with you, thanks. <laughs> no, but it's no, I can be in a corner. It's chill. It's, it's kind of comfy in the corner. I accept you. Thank you. Why is heterophobia cool? Let's not get into that. This is funny to me. Let's just focus on that. I can't be blamed for yelling kiss already every time Aragorn and Legos talk. There's so much. Every scene of Lord of the Rings is just is bromance on top of bromance. Hi, Dan! How you doing? No corners, thank you. Thanks for the hydrate. Appreciate it. Time me out. Uh-oh. Okay. Have a timeout. Anyway. Am I pointing or fist pumping? Neither. That's me giving a thumbs up during Vampire Survivors. If you missed when I was streaming Vampire Survivors, let me switch back over to... Oh, wide chat. You're back. A lot of room to stretch out chat. Um... I was streaming uh, Vampire Survivors, and, and that murders the bitrate and turns everything into crunch. And so I gave a thumbs up, everything turned to crunch. Someone screenshot that. I replaced my webcam with that. So so the, the, the bar rate emote is like two or three layers of crunch. Of me being like, yeah, thumbs up. Yeah, there, yeah, there's a thought. If you, you can kind of squint and kind of, it's, it's, it kind of deleted everything. So it's good. Yeah. Anyway, uh, let me get caught up on stuff so we can hop back into the game. I adore this game. I'm having fun. I did actually, we'll probably get into it as we get into it. Um, but, uh, someone left a, a comment on the VOD of the first part of this, which came out, uh, today. Um, they raised a very interesting point, which is as we get into this part of the stream, um, into this part of the game in the stream, this is when the game opens up and basically says, hey, there's a bunch of dungeons. Which one do you want to do? Uh, as opposed to Link to the Past, which is like, oh, you do Crystal number one. You get Crystal Maiden number two. There's an order to them. This game goes, here's like six or seven dungeons. Where do you want to go? Go back to Ravio's item shop and buy what you need to go to a new dungeon, which is rad. There are some restrictions, a couple. Uh, there's like one or two you have to do first before you can unlock some other ones. For example, we don't have the Sand Rod to go to that dungeon. So you can't do all of them, but... Um, I adore it because it just makes it really open and and uh, uh, it, it's got a feeling of, of player driven agency that a lot of Zeldas don't outside of obviously this is before Breath of the Wild. Um, but uh, it was great. Uh, this, this person raised a very good point, which is that because the developers don't really know which dungeon you're doing when, the difficulty in general for the game is lower. It's not the hardest Zelda game, which I largely agree with. I think mean, there's definitely parts of it that are optional, that are tricky. A lot of the mini games in this game are kind of brutal. Um, not in a way I find interesting though. Um, certainly the combat's not the most involved. It's a top-down 2D Zelda. It's, it's, it, there's never been super intense gameplay mechanics for those. Uh, therefore it's zero 10, absolutely. Um, but ultimately it, I, 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 I'm curious to see how I land on it as we venture in, because my memories of this game are 10 years old. But I feel like for a lot of Zelda, I don't, I'm not looking for difficulty in terms of, oh man, I'm getting stomped by a boss. Zelda games are usually at their most interesting to me when that's puzzly than combat -y. The combat is like a means to, the, to an end for me, as well as it's a soft difficulty of, have you been exploring and getting pieces of heart? Okay, well now you can afford to get bodied by a lot of stuff and it's not a big deal. Um, I'm not expecting a FromSoft game when I play Zelda. Um, combat's an important pillar of a lot of Zelda games. I'm not trying to discount it, but it, I, it's lower on the totem pole for me. Um, and so in this game, I think it's 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 a plus side and, a, and a, it's a, a positive and a downside. The positive is that you have all this player agency and because, they, because you enter each dungeon with the key item already, they can build out experience about it. It's almost more like a modern Mario game. Like, like the Game Maker's Toolkit video about the four-step Mario level design, where they introduce an idea in a safe uh, I I encounter, and then they level up, they like take away the floor, and then they give you enemies on top of having to deal with this new obstacle. So, I feel like they're able to kind of do that a bit in this game, where they can go, okay, you're going in with the fire rod, so we're going to do a bunch of stuff with the fire rod, and just iterate on that for kind of the whole dungeon, as opposed to... Even Link to the Past, there are a lot of Zeldas where the first half of the dungeon, you don't have the key item. You use your other stuff, though. That's the main failing of this, is they can't rely on 
you have bombs. They don't know if you have bombs or not, unless it's the bomb dungeon that you need bombs to get into. Um, so yeah, I, I think that there, there's a lot that they can do with that that I think they do. I I have to kind of see as we go how I feel. But um, so it's, a, it's like I agree that it is easier because they can't level up. They can't go, okay, we know you beat the boss in dungeon one so we can bring back that mechanic as an enemy in dungeon two. They can't really build up that over time. And I agree, there's cool stuff they've done with that in other Zelda games, but... Yeah, I hate Zelda games are bad. So... This hero mode is neat, no hearts drop, it really increases the value of potions. That's another thing, is they... Yeah, they have the, the, the monster drops and the potion seller, and I kind of never really deal with her, because on normal it's like, yeah. At the beginning of the game, yeah, enemies hit you and it's like, oh, there goes all my hearts, but... Yeah. What about Dungeon Meshi? Yeah, Dungeon Meshi, good. You want to talk about Dungeon Meshi? Hi! Let's uh, get into the video game. Thank you for all the, the hype train and the bits and the subs and the gifted and all that. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a good. Um, I'm going into battle. I don't look for crazy difficulty. I love this game. Yeah, I, 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 I definitely will concede, though, that out of the main... This is the bulk of the game where you have all these different dungeons and, and world exploration. At the end of all that, you have, like, the final bit of the game. I think they maybe could have... I don't know. For pacing, I feel like this game is really good. I think they, they could have done, like, extended the end bit of... If you consider chapter one of this game is high roll, chapter two is low rule, and then chapter three is the very end of the game once you've kind of finished low roll. Um, they could have maybe expanded that last bit, but at that point, it's like, okay, I have everything, I'm ready to go. I want to beat up the bad guys, so I don't know. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get caught on stuff. What about mid roll? That's where we live. This is mid roll. If this is where we want to be, if we want to show a swift football game, you're in the right place. They should have put her face on the football. Like, you know, like, hey, Arnold. But it's Taylor Swift. Uh, mid rolls. It's good. I left my dungeon in milk, and now it's all soggy. Dungeon mushy. That's what the anime is about. This game's 10 years old. Yeah. Sucks. Uh, let me, let me, uh, um, ba, 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 da, ba. Um, this song is very good. It's just, I'm like, I need something, like, mildly less um hit me with that n64 crunch okay hey in between streams there were some subs and resubs from unimaginative peanuts mint leaf mage big dupon and volaticus x and also divido giochi who subscribed for six months in advance which is a rad thing thank you um did you know that you can do multi-months and it's at, if you if you plan on subbing for a while you the, the we pass the savings on Amazon passes the savings. It's cheaper for you, uh, but I get paid the same amount. You just, it, you do pay it all at once. So, you know, everyone's situation is different, but you know, it's an option. It's game time. Enjoy your football. Um, yeah, da, 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 ba, 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 ba. Um, hmm, hmm, thank you. Uh, Gam, thanks for 74 months? Dude's Coke Splody. R.I.P. Coke Shaky. He shook too close to the sun. Numenatus, thanks for 10 months. Happy sports day. Finally caught up on the Forgotten City VODs after finishing it myself. How are you doing this fine weekend? I'm doing good. I, 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 Forgotten City, very good. And not just because it introduced me to the concept of a time heist. Uh, but I'm I, glad that, uh, people are still excited about the game. The game's great. It's good. Don't worry, someone will take it all away. They're gonna, we're gonna, they're gonna erode it. The enchantification will continue until morale continues to decline. Smash my extra armpits. I would love nothing more than to be with you guys. My family is all in on the superb owl. I'll let you know if I see any fun or dumb ads worth sharing. I mean, honestly, I don't, I don't, I don't care <laughs> about the ads. I'd, ra I'd rather not. I'm fine if you guys want to talk about the Super Bowl of it, but I don't, I don't want to talk about ads in the chat. It's, it's, it, it, it like they've tricked us and we've all fallen for it. But I'm like, we don't we don't have to talk about Super Bowl ads. We can all we can all exist in a space where we don't talk about that. But I hope you enjoy the Super Bowl. And if you want to enjoy those ads, I hope you enjoy those ads. I just don't. I'm not. I'm not like. Oh boy, tell me your favorites. I just I don't. What was that for my stream? I, I chat. I did pay ten million dollars to flash a single frame of my face in the middle of the Super Bowl. Um. It's not going to do be during halftime because that would be more expensive. But I, I definitely stay tuned. Don't blink. For, I don't know when it's going to show up. They didn't tell me. Um, but at, at some point, if you're watching, I think it's on like one of the channels or streamings. There's like I don't know how many different ways there are to watch Super Bowl. But uh, uh, it's gonna yeah, it's gonna yeah, it's the super wide emote that Mithra has. 
Taylor Swift is gonna wear a berry mask. She's gonna wear the berry Kigurumi that Reb designed. That was what that was a tease. That was what Reb was working on. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's only if you watch it live. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna go ah, in the middle of the playing field in the stadium, just uh, like appearing, like 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 Doctor Manhattan in Watchmen, just like suddenly appear and suddenly disappear. Be like that. Yeah, jump scare. Yeah, fading. Bah! The reverb on it. Anyway, uh, Chrissy Cake, thanks for 15 months. J Love the Dead, thanks for 59. Praise be to the superb owl. My dice roll ones, thanks for 15. Happy low roll to you and to you and yours. Enki Mono, thanks for 100 bits. Coke Shaky. Three Coke Shakies, none of them Coke Splody. J Love the Dead, thanks for gifting a sub to Fruit Gooshers. What a name. Nerd Queen, thanks for seven months. Let's go sports. May the superb owl win. I think I think a lot of a lot of people would. I mean, I, I feel like the superb bowl is is like kind of like waning in um in public relevance. You know, there's only like like eight or nine people who actually bought tickets for the Super Bowl. I think they're expecting maybe fifteen or twenty to actually watch it um, through cable or streaming. Um, it's not really a big deal anymore. I think something that could you know get those numbers back up would be if they had an owl in like a cage and then they release the owl and then there's just a guy watching the owl and then and then and then people play football but the cameras are just following the owls it kind of swoops around like hangs out i got a leak of the super bowl script taylor swift scores the final touchdown she's the ball right and they dunk her over the the touchdown um the kind of assholes though yeah but that's why it's fun to watch them and then three hours of commercials. Yeah. Uh, Trumbo Wings, thanks for soup. FB touchdown. I don't remember when Twitch did those FB football touch uh, emotes, but they are very good. I like them. Um, Digby's Art, thanks for 21 months. Spart Farkles, thanks for 35. Sarsum, thanks for 17. Insert funny text. Jake and Megan, thanks for 69 bits. Happy football to all who celebrate. Probably gonna have to drop for the game. Hope you have fun with Hilda. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna wave at her and be a little shy about it. Uh, Smash Bros. for hundred bits. The only big games I want to hear about are Nintendo games. Otherwise, I'm all about indies. Big games, big, large. Uh, like like I, I want to know about Skull and Bones, because Ubisoft recently said it's quadruple A. So that's that means it's really big. It's really really big. Be good. Not a big sports ball. I mean, I'm not a ball either. So I feel you. We have like one point two. Damn. The legendary, ah! I mean, you keep adding A's, <laughs> and it becomes more and more dire as you go, ah, with more A's. Anyway, uh, guess which one's the Coke Splody? It's a, it's a game. Um, objectively a massive downgrade for Black Flag. I never played Black Flag. I, 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 I finished AC3 and was like, I think I'm done. And then they made a pirate game. Everyone's like, the pirate game's fun. I was like, but I'm burnt out. I'm done. And I was like, maybe I'll look into Assassin's Creed again with this next one. And everyone's like, eh, it's okay. Uh, the one that just came out uh, last year. I was like, I might look into it, but... Because it... they're like, oh, it's a smaller game. It's kind of going back to the older game structure. And I was like, eh, it's okay. Mirage, that's the one. So, I was like, eh, I don't know. Love this track. Eh, no, it's stressful. Cinecure's all right. Page 3 felt tired. I want to check out 4.1. Eh, yeah, yeah. I don't doubt that it's good. I mean, I, I, I might check out Skull and Bones. In the same way that I might check out a lot of games that I end up... It's too many video games. Uh, owls are the slowest flyers, but agile and accurate. Their feathers mean when they fly, they're virtually silent. So that's why it'd be easier to track with the cameras they have for the for the big game. Uh, but it's been an open beta the past week and no one noticed. Ugh. Gah. Well, maybe it's good. Shane is playing. Thanks for four months. Kepora Gebora is the superb owl. There it is. They they, 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 the, the two teams gather for the coin toss to determine who goes first or whatever, and it's Kepora Gabora, and he's like, bah, 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 and he's explaining who's gonna go first, and then he's like, would you like me to repeat all that? And then they hit the wrong button, and he goes, bah, 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 and he keeps going, and then, uh, and then they have to stand there awkwardly in the field for like eight hours before they actually, actually say like, I don't know, I, I would like to just flip the coin now, thank you. Uh... Nintendo play. Thanks for 59 months, dudes. Well, it's shown. Thanks for 14. I have to catch up on the VOD. Still have a Coke Shaky. Just have a Coke Shaky for my favorite Zelda. This game good. It warms my heart that a lot of people are like this game rocks because it's neat. WTB Soul. Thanks for 52 months. Thanks for the Prime. Kitsuna Civ gifted a sub to Eternally Mortal for their ninth month. Enjoy your Ruby Key. Spivier. Thanks for a year and a half. Thanks for the Prime. Enjoy your very mild Curse Golden Key. 
Smash fix for 10 bits. Time I won the ads, you saw about minions. Gotcha. Case Mariah, thanks for 10 bits. Dudes, thank you. Primal Tanuki, thanks for gifting a sub. To Golan78. Welcome, mate. Uh, and Smash Brothers for 96 bits. I love the Hinox in this game. I wish they looked like this in Breath of the Wild instead of just one-eyed Moblins. I, that said, I do really like the, the, the Hinox designs in um, Breath of the Wild and, and Tears of Kingdom. I remember the first time I saw a, uh, a Stalnox standing in the distance in Breath of the Wild, and I was like, what the fuck is that? And that stuck with me. Uh, Little Rugetta, thanks for 32 months in Limestones. Thanks for soup. Thank you for soup on this superb day. My cup of soup runneth over. And Terra, thanks for gifting a sub to Mid Zenith for their fifth month. Welcome back. Should we play some game? Been too long. Rayman needs another game? Oh my god. I was like, what do you mean Legends? Yeah, Rayman Legends is very good. Rayman Legends is like S tier platformer. It's very good. Uh, definitely, if you're hankering for a sweet side scrolling platformer, definitely recommend Rayman Legends. It's good. We can play games or talk about Alice somewhere. We can do both. For the record, just because I start playing a Zelda and start talking about games and then running around in circles instead of playing the game doesn't mean you have to stop talking about birds. So there you go. The black Triforce pseudo reflection is really ugly. Yeah, I was yelling about that last time. I love this game. There's so many cool ideas in it, and I love the execution of a lot of it. I love the charm, the vibe. There's a couple things that I'm dreading having to do again, but the game's good. But A, Link's hair isn't pink, and B, the upside down black Triforce just kind of it's they just opened up Photoshop and then did a skew effect and just kind of dragged it over. And it just kind of done. What's the talking owl on Oot called? Kapora Gabora. Gabora Rorealis. Anyway. Have I seen the banner break? No, I haven't. This part, where it just kind of. Liter literally, if they just put a little sine wave action on it, or just was like kind of more dreamlike, I feel like that e just that on top would sell that effect more. There's so many different things they could have done. It just feels really cheap for some reason. Anyway, it doesn't help that, that like, Link to the Past has the 3D Triforce, which was like, why on the soup? Why it was 3D? It's like this amazing, and this one's like, <laughs> KO the Dragon, thanks for five years. Heck, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy uh, the key that you get for five years, which uh, is the one that I remember is uh, the Kiwi key. Is what that is. Thank you so much. Hope you're doing well. Far Cry 3 and 4 are fun. I played those and thought they were fun. Let's go back to dudes! Dudes, we got the, all three of the things. We're ready to go. A 4D slider. Don't worry about that. Yo! 5 was awkward. I didn't play 5. I think it was after 4 Primal, and that's when I was like, okay, I think I'm good. <laughs> you, you you took the franchise and went, what if, what if constant... Because I did play Blood Dragon, and it was like, Blood Dragon's so good, and I was like, it's okay. I wasn't, I was very whelmed by it. It was cute. Um, anyway, uh, we're in low rule. This man's being mean to me. Hi. Um, so uh, if you maybe didn't watch last stream or just only caught the beginning or something, um, we got the three MacGuffins, got the Master Sword, which I can fire beam. I can finally peam my beam in a Zelda, which is good. Um, and then, oh, what was that? A monster tail. Only Zelda game I revisited three times. It's that good. It's pretty good. I only played it the one time. Hey, he can run? Wow. Dude took out all my HP. Methinks I need to be careful in this low rule. Um, but yeah, we, we, we got all the things. We got the Master Sword. We're able to bust back into the castle. Chase down Yuga, who was like, haha. I've captured the princess in a painting, and now I'm uh, uh, absconding off to low rule. And where we meet Hilda, who's like Zelda, but a little bit sad, has black hair, and she's like, welcome to Low Rule, it sucks here, good luck. Um, and so we have these marks on our map over here, which are the uh, the seven sages who were turned into paintings. And there's also a line, if I flip through the thing, you can probably see it better. There's lines segmenting the map. She explained that basically the world is crumbling apart so, like, to the right of me over here, um, it, there's, like, these big ravines that we can't cross. So the overworld of Low Rule is broken up into islands, and we can't freely traverse them. Um, but that said, if we're smart about it, we can go to almost any 
a oh, goatsy tent. We can go to almost any of those dungeons right now, which is kind of neat. Uh, and so I don't know which one we're going to go to, but certainly the one that we're next to is an obvious starting choice. Okay. We don't have to. Irene Best Wife, she's good. Yeah, Hilda says, hey. Hello? I don't mean to boast about my spicy darling here, but why not? Not everyone's got a fellow like him. He's handsome and talented. Oh, come on, Mapes. You know I can't stand compliments. He calls her Mapes. Unless you say them right. Hmm. Yeah, you can link YouTube without permit. Also, again, shout-outs to Silver Sugar, who made uh, the emote that I uploaded as dudes, which, which five watchers can't see. I'm the most handsome and talented while I'm the foremost fortune teller in this world or any other. Of course you are, darling, and I'm the most fortunate witch around. Don't you dare nitpick my darling's fortunes. He's always right. Well, the one in Hyrule's always right, so why wouldn't he also be right? I am a reader of fortunes. I see your future. I'll tell you what's to come for 20 rupees. Hey, Alec. I only play good video games. Higgledy piggledy, porkity frockity, moppity schloppity plop. Oh, so much fortune to tell. It's like a buffet of fate. I see seven paths before you. Which path would you like to ask about? Um... Another path. Um, he's a, uh, another one. This is the last, uh, another one. Um, Dark Palace. Ugh. What do you see? A sign from on high. I see it. All right, I'll state it plainly. I see a place strewn with rocks east of Hyrule Castle, and I see something odd on a pillar there. I suggest that you investigate. He knows what Hyrule is? That concludes our session. Where were you able to see the path you'll take? That'd be 20 rupees. Yep. Thanks. I mean, that was probably a decent fortune, I guess. Who's gonna be best owl today? Who's gonna win the award? For coolest little guy. A monster horn. Watch how you don't hurt yourself on that thing. This is basically Breath of the Wild. If Breath of the Wild was good. Oh, I like Breath of the Wild a lot. It's one of my favorite Zelda's. Eh, eh, eh. Plus, look at some dumb fan art I drew for that previous Zelda stream. Yes! Let me throw a permit to ya. Yeah. This is my favorite Zelda, but I think it's the best one. I think I know what you mean, Alec. This is probably my favorite. No, definitely. I'm, I'm, put, I'm putting a line down. This is my favorite 2D, quote unquote, Zelda. Even though it's 3D. You know what I mean? It's not a Zelda game where the camera's behind Link. It's above him. Top-down Zelda game. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you got here, Tina? What are you doing? What are you doing? Thank you for those things. I made some dumb shit based on Barry and Bath's Ship of Harkinian stream. Oh my god. <laughs> we got the world's best to Dunkle. We got Weeb's Tots frozen in time. We got the Greg Rupee and them, them dumping Dampy's dumper. This, this is beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, he's going. Let me see you shake that. Zelda 2 getting snubbed again. I've, I, I've never played Zelda 2. Every time I tried to play it back in the day. Good thing I got that B badge. It's great. Um. I would get, like, outside of the first town and get harassed by monsters and be like, but I just want to... I'm just trying to explore. Is there a guy in here? Yeah, there is. It's kind of fun. I keep feeling like maybe one of these days I should play through Zelda 1 and Zelda 2 and just follow guides for them. Just to kind of check it off the gamer bucket list. Have a good vibe! Thanks, Tina! Thanks for the art and thanks for dropping by. Seems to be locked. Okay. Yeah, baby. Our hideout entrance. Knock or scram. I'm gonna knock. Who's there? Nobody gets past me unless you know all the words to the ultra secret thief password song. I'll start the lyrics. You finish them. That is, if you can. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> a smart thief bears the boss's wrath. I'd rather be on a cliff walking the precipice. 
Sometimes it hurts too much to care if they acknowledge this power, but it's really a bear. Every time I say I'm a leaving, this accursed life sets me back, right back to deceiving. Wait a second, you don't even know the song, do you? Get out of here before I call the boss. Oh. Damn. Uh. Wait, but the unofficial Zelda 2 remake or just the original? There's a Zelda 2 remake? I mean, like, yeah, like fan made, but I don't know. Follow guys for both of me if you do, you'll have a great time. Yeah, I. I. I think if I was playing Zelda 1 without a guide, I wouldn't stream it. Because I'd just be, like, running around and getting lost and drawing maps and stuff, which sounds fun, but. In the interest of actually playing the game. And probably just following that. <laughs> Another Metroid 2. Yeah, M2R. Hey, what do you got there? Many years ago, I felt so free that I chose the thief's life, but it really chose me. Every time I say I'm a leaving, this accursed life sets me right back to thieving. Oh, hey there, little guy. Sorry, I was just singing out loud. It's an old tune. You probably wouldn't know it. What do you think of this place? A little too rough for you, eh? I don't mind it so much. At least there's still a strong musical culture in this town. It's a tradition with us. I'm gonna steal your wall rupees. Ha ha. Whoa. -ho. Okay, bye. Why can't we only merge with walls? We should be able to merge with the floors, too. If you want to get stepped on, just say so. Whoa! Pigeon. Pigeon. Evil chicken. It always comes back to lane versus right. It's a circle. Hey, it's like a milk bar. But not. Oh, hey, think I look strong? Sure. You lying? Because your ears twitched real funny there. Mine do that when I lie. They twitch all the time. Anyway, I may not look it, but I'm a regular at the Treacherous Tower. What do you mean you've never heard of the Treacherous Tower? Well, you know, Death Mountain, it's right on top of that. It's where all the tough guys go for fun. I like being a tough guy. Here I am working for the royal family as if it weren't their fault things have fallen apart. Look around, kiddo. It's all thieves and creepy masked folks in this village. There's nothing royal about this place. Yeah, you bet. Evil Mario is Luigi? What do you want? Scram, brat. What's with all the monsters? What with all the monsters running around? More and more folks are taking refuge in here. Customers everywhere. It really gets my so goat. <laughs> oh, they were the bits. I'm, like, I'm glad that the milk bar owner hates customers. I just want to drink a little bit of milk in peace. Why can't everyone just leave me alone and scram? High row bar serves milk, low row bar serves raw eggs. Yeah, it'd be good. Poor little cuckoos. Their coop, their coop got all smashed up. All that's left is these eggs. Don't worry, little eggies. I'll make sure nothing happens to you. I think they should add cuckoos to smash. You play as just kind of like a group of like five or six cuckoos. And then you can't attack, you can peck the ground. But if anyone attacks you five times, you can just screen wipe. I think that'd be good. Met the boss of our little village here? <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't waste time on someone like you. He's busy stashing away that new painting he's got. Thing must be worth a fortune. If that thief girl knows where it is, she best keep her trap shut. Unless she wants to tell me where it is. <laughs> that whole thing kind of inspired me, actually. Want to hear my latest ditty? Little ditty. Oh, ho, ho, wrong place, wrong time. And the boss will be glad to put you back in line. A smart thief fears the boss's wrath. I'd rather be on a cliff walking a narrow path. Oh. He's good. <laughs> the Laurel Milk Bar serves death lemonade. There you go. There you go. That's good. Eh. Eh. Meh. What? No? There he is. You can't pull him off the wall. He's stuck on there tight. Oh. Have to imagine pub racing that. He's got a great voice. He's got some pipes. Yeah, I definitely, someone mentioned last time, I remember seeing the Mai Mai stuck to walls. And there's an animation where if you try to grab him, where Link, like, pulls on them. So it's like, oh, maybe I just need better gauntlets? Better gloves? But no, you just, you just merge. I think that purple's probably a like-like. Hello? Hello? Let me throw! Hey! 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 Stop it! There's chickens in here! What's wrong with you? 
quit it. Anyway. Hello, chickens. I need you. I need you out of the way. Oh, oh my God, he's out. He's out. Oh, that's actually a real rupee. A real porpy. He's trying. He's trying. Hey. Um, so, I don't know if Chad has any strong feelings. Do you guys want... Oh. Mm -hmm. Moblins are good. This effect is so weird. There's so many different ways they could have. Oops. I didn't mean to go back. Um... I don't know if anyone has any strong feelings about what dungeon I should do first. So Thieves Hideout is right here. I think they kind of intend you to do it first. But I'm kind of down to fuck off and do a different one if we want. Ma'am? Do you mind if I sneak into your house? Eee! Do the dungeon. Wind Temple? Which one's that? How in Hyrule did you get in here? My door is locked, dudes! Well, never mind. I'm actually glad you popped in. I was just admiring my new dress. What do you think of it? Glamorous, isn't it? Oh, you're too kind. Very sweet of you. So here, take this as thanks, dudes. Uh, she gave me a piece of heart. Is that where pieces of heart come from? I'll leave the door open, so you're welcome to pop in and out as you please. Oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah. Alright, uh, uh... He's looking good. He's rocking it. Uh, uh... An uninvited trespasser? Perfect. Thanks for complimenting me. Didn't say anything. Where's the... Where's... Is he in one of those pots? How do I get... How do I get... Let me get... Hey, how you doing? Wait, I can look at the... Okay, we'll, we'll get on the way back. Oh wait, it's, it's in the... Damn it, it's in here. I don't have the shovel. I could go buy another thing. No, those are like 800 pop. Never mind. Hi. Show me your... <laughs> oh, yeah, look at him. Oh, man. That's good. This game's very good. All right. Uh, I could go for a super bowl of ramen. Ooh. She's been smooching the wall. You gotta work on... Work on your stuff. Um, hold on. So there's this house here that was locked. There's a rock on the roof. Oh, a rock on the roof. So, I've had a hard time sleeping lately. I've been hearing the strangest little cries from my roof. I've never heard anything like it before. It's keeping me up all night. Everyone trying to 100% this game. Be like. How spoiled have you want chat to be? Missed the first stream. Um, I've already played the game before. Don't spoil, like, plot stuff. Or... Basically, like, yeah, don't talk about any plot or anything, but... I definitely don't mind if people are like, hey, you should... You know... Get this thing, I suppose. Eh. Ba 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 ba. Recommend your channel instead of checking out some clips and stuff. You seem pretty cool. Hey, thanks. Pretty underrated. Appreciate it, attack team. Thanks for saying hi. And, uh, I'm glad that Twitch thinks I'm neat. To throw me to other people. I got a whole channel of VODs, as well as, uh, monthly edited highlights, if you are so inclined to check that out as well. Pretty sure you say hi, though. Uh, I did, I did it. Remember those strange little cries I was hearing from my roof? Well, can you believe it? Those sounds stopped! What, you took some creature off it? Thanks, dudes. Now I can get a good night's rest again. Please take this reward. The ruby. Alright, let me just destroy her bed. There you go. Good as new. I make funny videos on YouTube sometimes. It's true. Like, once or twice a year. So far, I've made zero videos this year. And it's almost mid-February. I feel pretty good about that. Feeling pretty good about it. Uh, there's Bee Man. Do I have a bee? I have a fairy. Right. Any ideas? Oh, I got tons of ideas. It's more about every the other part of production that's difficult. Uh, wait, that's that guy. Okay, let's head back to... Dark. I mean, low rule. It's low rule. It's not the dark. Hi, ma'am. You came back. Here's a little token of my affection. Go on, take it. Don't be shy. She blew you a heart. How thoughtful. What if she gave you infinite pieces of heart? You could just come back here 
and wind up with 500 heart pieces. Be good. Waiting for another Kingdom Hearts to drop so he can get me to do another 7-hour stream. I mean, games were wanting to, to explain to me uh, the mobile games. But he's waiting for more stuff to happen, I think, first. I don't remember exactly. I just know there's shenanigans afoot. He's selling bees? Bosh went and hid my thief girl away where no one could hear what she had to say. Sometimes it hurts too much to care. You think knowledge is power, but it's really despair. What are you staring at? Look, I don't know nothing about that thief girl, okay? It's just a song. Bosh locked her up somewhere and threw away the key. Why you gotta go and do that? Why? Why? You buying or what? No, I'm good. I would never buy a bee. Bees are not to be exchanged for goods and services. Bees are free. Free bees. Let me grab this real quick. Hi. A new weather vane has been added to the map. Save. Sure. I don't know what dungeon I want to do first. I think I, I think I want to save the thieves den for later, because I remember it being one of my favorite dungeons. Or it's one of my favorite bosses. I don't know. Let's just do something else. It's fun when the game goes, this is an easy way to start. And I'm like, nah, let's do something else. Ice dungeon, good and great reward. Done. Let's do ice dungeon. Those statues at the north edge of town are entrances to some sort of hideout. It gives me the chills just looking at them. I once knocked on the door, but they told me to make like a piece of fruit and scoot. Oh, that's really good. Translate. I don't know if the scoot fruit's called the scoot fruit in the Japanese, but that... That makes me really happy. <laughs> I wish I had the strength to leave this terrible place entirely. Mumbo jumbo, mumbo jumbo. Umanaka. Though we have seen the world crumble before us, we must not give in to the corruption of thievery. Monsters can keep you strong. They are your only salvation, my son. Do you must don the mask. Don the mask! We are corrupt. Corrupt! Do not be deceived. M only monsters will save us now. Mumbo jumbo. Uh, mumbo. And a jumbo. And a jumbo mumbo. Oh boy, I've been in the in low roll for five minutes and I'm already being indoctrinated into a cult. Um Does anybody know? And by anybody I mean maybe um the people who seem to have knowledge of the game. Uh both where the ice palace is and what I need to get in there. Right, this is milk bar. Wear the mask. Oh I do have a mask. Wear Majora's mask. I should go get it. Hey! Hey! Fire Rod, it's on Death Mountain. Gotcha. Right, it is snowy up there. I was like, is it in the southeast? No, that was where it is in Link of the Past, right? Top right, Death Mountain. Rad. Thank you all. Oh, yeah. Oh, we can toggle it. I forgot about the little button. It's a satisfying little button. And also, a bunch more my mice. Um, check this out. Check this out. What do you think of this? Now I'm wearing a mask. Death Mountain's ice now? It's ice now? Might want to upgrade it first. Uh, how many Mayamais do we have to turn in? What do you think of my mask? Okay, fine. Well, let's, uh, well, we need more rupees regardless, so I'll just work my way around here. And, uh, we'll do some, some exploring as we go. And we'll need to get more Mayamais anyway. Whoop. Hello. Bomb flower store. Money-making game is funny. Make sure you get the hookshot too? Both of them? Wait, I think I rented the hookshot, didn't I? Yo, ho, ho, who is that? Who goes? Friend or foe? Who is it? Do I know? No. Wait, did he have a bob on painting? Hold on. Let me back in. Sure you like waiting to upgrade the fire rod before Ice Temple? That's fair. It's just a bomb. Thought it was a bob on specifically. Hello? For bombs, you seem to be searching. Well, then leave me to my researching. What I can sell you now... Is he rapping? What I can sell you now is nut 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 nutin Sorry, I ain't got more for your mutton. Buh, 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 buh. Me trying to remember the lyrics to Bob on Battlefield. Want the big bomb flower? Lucky you, I'm lending that power for a one-time fee. Use it for hours and hours. Oh yeah, the big bomb flower wanted to know, know about its power. Want it, faux show? The flower blooming in the garden is really a bomb, and it's a total bargain. Just go on and touch it, it'll be a following bloom. 
big bomb flower gonna make big boulders go boom. But be careful, you know. Just the slightest scratch will make it explode. This big flower is only found here. If you're interested, kid, you want to get near. Yeah, woo. Hi, hi, hi. This big flower is only found here. If you're interested, kid, you want to get near. 200 rupees. Barraro. Barra no, I'm good. We'll do that later. Don't tell me to change my clothes. Chucky Finster got barred. Yeah. 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 Come here. Come here. So if I... Do I have the hookshot? Uh, uh, the wrong button. Um, how do I... There, the thing. Um, I rented the hookshot, so we have that. Which is good. Um, but I will also need to, uh, purchase the fire rod before I can upgrade it. I... I... Hmm... Hmm... We can do it later. We can do it later. I don't... I remember hating this video game. I don't want to do it now. Welcome to Octoball Derby. Hit a crab to reset the pots. If you hit three pots in a row, a bird will fly across the field. Get at least 100 rupees during a healthy price. I don't... We'll do it. I'm live. Oh, Captain Hook woke up. He was napping. Best mini game. I... Yeah, well... I'll try it later. We'll try it later when I have more rupees to burn. Hey. That's nothing? Alright. Well. I like their little, like... Look like they, it looks like they wrapped up the tip of their spear with, like, cloth. Just kind of neat. Game good. Game good. Uh, let's go to Link's house. In low rule. Um, what's the opposite of a link? Like, like, like a link in a chain that's broken. Oh. Oh. Do they can make another sequel to this? I mean, maybe. A lonk? <laughs> I, sure. Oh. Us brothers will be taking this here treasure. Unless you be dashing, you may as well go home now. I mean, I'm dashing. You see how handsome I am? Hmm. A break? It's pretty good. Oops. This really needs the Gobi's Valley music. It's just this is just the tower in Banjo. Uh, pant, gasp, herk, I don't. How is it that I'm not being fast enough? I'm never not being fast enough. If you're never not being fast enough, then it sounds like you're always slow enough. Oops. Whoa, that was snug. Don't never not be. Any new bottles move? <laughs> Shit. No, I can. Okay. Boop. Damn it. No! Is these are with bombs to cheese? How do you cheese this with bombs? Oh! Because you can drop. Oh, well, I have bombs. I like the noise this makes. I don't know if I remember that making a noise. Uh, yeah. I thought you were like, gonna be like, oh, you can do like a bomb hover or something. I was like, huh? That's a huge time save. This one maybe more so. Yeah. Ooh. Still almost didn't. Um, I made it. Well, we can now afford the thing. That's a nice dash you got there. That's a nice dash you got there. Where? Any goodies? Oh. <gasps> Tetris! 
Nice stash got when you of the. With those wee little legs of yours, there's nowhere you couldn't go. Yeah, my legs are wee. What about it? You want to fight about it? I have 19. I need one more Maya Mai, and then we can upgrade another item. Let me grab the warp up here first. Hey, nice noises, though. I appreciate it. Link's house looks weird. No, it looks good. With your Wii legs, you can play many motion-controlled games. Oh, like a Kinect? <laughs> my legs Wii U? No. A separate tablet to look at my legs better? Oh. Oh. Let's go inside first. He's got like a Animal Crossing fossil on the roof. Hello? Hello? Lonk? Oh. Oh, they just straight up show you the blown up bit on the... Oh, so you can't see it unless you go up against the thing. Uh... I like when you freeze him where he got one foot sticking out. Makes me pretty happy. He got that stanky leg. All right. Mama's so sleepy. Have a sled. Take a nap and then fire the missiles. Oh, la, 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 la. Boom. Place these to sell giant bombs. Which place that what now? But I am like tired. Precisely. I got a bottle! Four bottle. Nice. Um. Four bottle. Put them like that. And then I got my my scoot fruit and my foul fruit, which I'll probably never use. There you go. Nice and organized. Beautiful. I really like that you get to. You can reorganize your items. Does reorganizing them change? Oops. You know what's great about that is I didn't actually waste any bombs doing that because we have infinite. Uh, if I do this, so it's like bomb and then wind thing. Um, is that actually the order here? Like if I put the wind over there? No. Okay. So there's a set order to these. It looks like. Because it also would be nice if you could customize that order, I guess. But that would be. Maybe Trixier. Hey, Alabritus. A uh, terrible Discord URL. I know. We just have to get used to it. <laughs> yeah. He's beautiful. It's a lovely shade on him. This game's good, actually. Uh, thank you for this. Mwah. This is my life now. Yeah, he really did say that, Pixel. You're right. Female Wobbuffet be like. Uh, I'm sorry, is that a rat chef looking at a mushroom? What is that? On the right. It's good. What? It's Remy! Something. Heavy monkey energy. It's art. There's three mushrooms inside you. Merp. It's a rat chef looking at a mushroom. It looks like it. You never seen Ratatouille? Anyway. Well, let's go. Blah, blah, blah. Xanarkans, thanks for the prime. Hello. Something, something to Xanarkan. Love rat chef admiring mushroom. My beloved. It's art, and all art has to feature at least one rant. That's why they're anagrams. Huh. You might be right. Ah-ha-ha-ha! Ha, ha. Pass Bruce. Sorry, not Titus. Titus! It's Mr. Euro. welcome! You've been using that quick equip technique I told you about a ways back. Nope. Oh! <gasps> Well, then maybe this tip will hook you on the whole quick equip thing. See the slider on the item selection screen? You guessed that you can slide the slider left and right. Mind taking a look at the lower screen? I forgot about this. This is good. See how the size of the blue frame is changing? That shows how many items you have ready for quick equip. 
For example, let's say you want only the items you use the most to show up and quick quick. This is a very smart idea. In that case, set the slider to the far right to highlight just four items and then put your fave four there. The fab four? Weezer! But if you want to have more than four items in quick equip, just move the slider towards the left. Be sure to try it out. See what works best for you. All right, that's all the information I've got for you today. Did that all make sense? Yeah. Good. It's tricky stuff, but it could make all the difference out there, so don't forget to give the slider a try. The slider? Uh, uh, uh. Nice. I did it. That's a really nice feature. I also somehow, like... I don't know what about... I think that because they, they dropped the stuff in on the right side first? That must be it. I don't think I remember this mechanic. But the fact that I already had all the items I actually like on the right side. And all the, like, less... More, more like, less common usage on the left. I'm like, okay, just drag it over. Boom. Now I have all my key items for quick equip. Ba -ba -ba -ba. All right. Um, hi. I would like the fire rod, please. This. Interested in the fire rod? The rental price is 100 rupees. You want to own it? It's 1,200. I need 120 more rupees. Right, it's close to the button. I'm slot seeing you. Okay, say quick equip three times fast, and I can barely say it one time slow. Quick equip, quick equip, quick equip. What's a quick way to earn rupees in this video game? Um Uh Well There's a there's a child. There you are. Get a job. Oh. I'm a streamer. Yeah. What did I say? Oh. Not wrong. Eh, eh. Rupee Rush is pretty good. There is a mini game called Rupee Rush. Isn't that over here? Like left of the blacksmith? And I literally never went over here. Baseball, no. No. He's spinning! <laughs> he did a little spin. Oh my god, the blade the 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 beam can cut grass? This game's good. That might have been the case in Link Between. Link to the Past for all I remember. Oh my god, it's Rupee Rush, gal, everyone's favorite character from Zelda. Welcome to Rupee Rush! You have 30 seconds from the start to grab as many rupees as you can. If your time exceeds 30 seconds, you forfeit all the rupees you collected, so speak to me before then, okay? Here's the twist. There's no timer! I say grabbing my phone. Let me just quickly... get pull up a timer. I'm just gonna cheat at the minigame real quick. Okay. Put a 30 second timer on there. All right, great. No cheating, great. Uh, there's no timer. Mm -hmm. Do you want to play Rupee Rush? 50 rupees for one go. Yeah. I mean, uh, no cheating. I would never. Just don't. Just don't listen to my phone going off. It's just unrelated. Talk to me within 30 seconds, or I'll take back all the rupees to pick up. Good luck rushing for rupees. There's a my mine here? That's really rude. I haven't picked up any yet. Ah, shit. Um, fuck, he's on the floor. Uh, does this not stop the time? It probably does. Shit. Well, now we're just... I don't know when time stops when I'm menuing and stuff. Uh, there goes the timer. Well, I'm gonna just go. Ma'am. How'd that go? Did I did I fuck it up? Sorry, you were over by five seconds! Got a little over eager there. Yeah, well, listen, I got a little yeah. Shit. Just assume it doesn't. Uh you can get a ton of rubies for street pass. Mm. I mean I have I own a 3DS. Could bring it to the office. Um, so I want that, and I want maybe the bombs, right? Yeah, try that. Uh, let's go again. Where is the super bell? He's in here somewhere. All right, 
I might end up spending all my rupees on this mini game, but eventually I'll turn a profit. Talk to me within 30 seconds, you take back all the rupees you pick up. <laughs> Am I just really unlucky that a lot of these aren't coming up with anything? Shit. Ten seconds. It's hard. Shit. Five. No! What's up? Results are in! Drum roll, please! Two seconds left. I lost money. <laughs> You're pretty good. Close to the end there. I'm giving you a bonus. Oh, that's how it works. Isn't that a new record? New record. Come back sometime. Be waiting. Close to the end of the month, over gives you a higher multiplier. Gotcha. Did you pick up a bunch of play coins when I captured Yes. No. Okay. So I actually want to try to time it to be. So it says, it says go, and then it fades away. And I'm like, I'm assuming that's when the timer starts. Have a good vibe. Thanks, the Anarchians. None! One! Uh, yeah. Yeah. 12. 10. 6. 5. 4. 3. 2. 1. Go. Hi. Splat slash them? Oh, you just hit them with your sword? 0. 0.92 seconds left. That's got to be a good bonus. And we got a lot of rupees. That was so ultra out there. That's the first time I've seen someone cut it that close. It was great watching you at work. So I got you a super special bonus. Yeah, baby. Let's go. Isn't that a new record? You got such a high score. Take this piece of heart as a prize. Just. 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 Nice. Come back sometime. How much money do I have now? Do I have enough? I am a couple rupees short. Okay, one more time. Yeah. Hammer should work for the boulder. Probably faster than wait for the bomb to go off. Gotcha. I will give that a go. Oh, I should have swapped it before I... Yep, okay. No external help at all. Nope, none. Um. Yep. Oh, bloopy. There you go. 18. 15. Yep. Not cheating. This is all legit. Oh, I could probably run into this, huh? Yeah. Eight. Four. Three. Two. One. Hi. How you doing? Good to see you. Drum roll. Hey. Hey, Lomao. That was so ultra. Thank you. Okay, this is a very... Easy way to learn a decent amount of rupees. Hi. Come back sometime. Thanks. I'm going to go buy some weaponry from a rabbit. Huh? Strange man. I agree. <laughs> There's a trick to baseball, but I never got it. I think the trick is to get lucky, so you don't have to do it more than necessary. Maybe it's not that bad. Maybe because I'm dreading it, it will be a nice chill time. And it'll be fun and relaxing. We'll just get to play a little baseball later. Oh, hi. Oh, my lad, you're alive! I thought that. No matter, I'm just glad to see you alive and well. Please tell me, is Princess Zelda safe? Uh, yeah, define safe. She could be placed inside of a safe? I see. So Yuga's become evil itself in a kingdom of shadow. Oh, yeah, also, if you missed the end of last stream, Yuga used the seven sage portraits to uh, summon Ganon, and he looked like Zelda 2 game over screen Ganon, and it was rad. And uh, he like did like a, a like a fusion dance with him. It was neat. Um, curse him for all eternity. Yeah, I agree. She's practically a work of art. His evil is spread even here. For just after you vanished into Hyrule Castle, a quake shook the kingdom. 
It left fissures like this all through Hyrule, and when and when there are cracks, can shattering be far behind? Oh, dudes! With Princess Zelda in our enemy's hands, Hyrule's on the brink of disaster. But you, you at least wield the sacred blade of legend, the Master Sword. Hope lives still as long as you hold that sword, and your courage will surely see us through. Yeah, uh, here, hold, pull through. Yeah, Link, go. Wicked wa. Wicked. Your fi the future of Hyrule Kingdom is in your hands, dudes. Why is your head like that? Like what? These cracks are all over Hyrule, even in the back of my house. Where can I go? Where will I sleep? I feel getting too close to such vicious fissures. Oh, here, an old man's please restore Hyrule Kingdom to what it was, dudes. All right. Where are you going? I'm gonna take a nap. Hi. A warm welcome to you, Mr. Hero. Thanks. I'm gonna buy this. Yep. Yeah. I wanna buy it. You gonna buy the fire rod? You buy it, done deal. Here. Yeah. Thank you for being such a great customer. Thanks. Um. I'm gonna steal one more rupee. Boop. Bye. How many Mai do I have? Do I still need one, or did I get... Did the one I get from the minigame count as my 20th? Uh, I have 21! Nice. <laughs> Let's upgrade it. You get a rupee from that? Yeah. Anywhere that there's a rupee painting on a wall, you can scooch behind it and steal a rupee every time you go in. It's good. It's really stealing if it's my rupee. Good question. Hello, ma'am. Looking dashing as always. It is very satisfying to turn in, like, a couple dozen of them at once, but... Yeah. I can make something of yours nicer. Please give it to Mother Mai Mai. Uh, take the fire rod. The fire rod? E. E. Uh. Whoa! I probably should have used it at least once before upgrading it to see before and after, but, you know. Neat. I remember being really satisfying uh, to turn on the stereoscopic 3D in this room. Because the pool down below, they're like really far down there. My babies are shy! Yeah, but they're loud as fuck! Bye. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, 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 bye. Uh. Fire. Fire rod. Oh, yowza. Yeah, that, that burns for That burns real good. Alright. Let's get the hell up to Death Mountain. Uh, up there, probably. Gotta find some kind of a fissure up here somewhere. It's like a honey wand thing, yep. Yeah. Or like, uh, molten glass. It's like all- you can get it all swirly. Hey! Um... So there's the treacherous tower, which maybe we can look at if we so choose, but... Probably better save that for later. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah! Ah! Hey! 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 Give me a sec! Bit more imposing. A little bit. Uh, yeah, bah, bah, uh, him with fire! Yeah! It's not doing anything! Jesus. Can y'all just... What's in here? I'm trying to save a baby! Oh, hi. Oh. Have you tried... Huh? Now, how's all this gonna work? Use the hookshot to fly at that wall. And then press A at the moment I reach it, right? That's it. Yeah, then that treasure will be mine! Hee hee hee! Hoo hoo ha hoo! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, I forgot about- This game's good. This game is good. I don't know if you guys knew this game was good. But you can face plant. And then while you're face planted, you can do that, which is just... Incredible. Uh, oh, shit. I'm too slow. 
Well, Sonic won't look me in the eye during Thanksgiving if I'm this slow. Uh, uh, come back. No! Baby, come back. Crap. Hmm. Nowhere near quick enough. Watch out, Link! You're gonna crash! Whoa! Uh, hmm. We'll platform there. Okay. Alright. Onward. With figuring out the room. Uh. Probably just scooch around all this, man. Or not. Damn it! Okay, let me let me a little peek. Oh, I just gotta go right from there. Or could I also go left from here? No. I mean, there is a rupee, but it's fine. All right. I now see. You can use the wind again, the great. That is so true, isn't that? Well, yeah, that that is. Thank you. That definitely saves time. Oh, oh. Eh, eh. Oh, eh, eh. Now I'm up here. Hey, Rusty Keys, how are you? Uh, is this on the same? This isn't the same level. Why is the? There's a. That would probably help. Okay. Ah, now this one's moving. But I need these green rupees. What would I do? Without? I want the red rupee. Okay, fine. Get the red rupee. Oh god, oh god, don't run out, don't run out, don't run out. Yay. Okay, uh, back over here. No, I can't do that. Yay, you're welcome. Didn't even get these green rupees up here as well. I want red rupee. I got you, red rupee. Don't tell me you already ate it. Uh, yeah, this way. They're required. Only green rupee percent. What do you mean they're required? Oh, the green one's over here. In, in getting to... I see. I see which... Oh, fuck you. Oh, <laughs> I'm okay. But uh, yeah, okay. A sloopy. I stole the treasure. There seem to be lots of empty chests around the kingdom. I'm starting to think I'm not the only treasure hunter here about. Need nothing to say about my prowess? He was looking at his watch, was he? Uh, eh, ow. Okay, ow. Um. So that's it for this spot. Looks like there's a spot down here. Maybe not. So never mind. You can merge in a wall as big whoop. Wanna fight about it? Yeah. So this is the whole, yeah. Dude, I gave him his milk and he's still here. I'm going to die. E e. Have you collected the monster parts? Yeah, I'm getting monster parts. What about it? You wanna fight 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 about it? Yay. Fire rod? Yeah, that might have done damage again. I mean, he breathes fire. So, surely, there's better ways to. Mm. Uh, uh hmm. what is here? Ah, right. A fairy fountain of some... Hold something. Have you got the heart piece here yet? No, there's one up on the mountaintop. Um, over uh, this way. But I gotta get that from... 
the Dark World somehow. Let's see. Yeah, it's pretty snowy. Maybe, maybe I'm supposed to be further down the mountain. It kind of makes sense that they wouldn't let you warp from the bottom of the mountain and just skip the entirety of it. There's one right here. Is there? And there's also one right here. No! Money down! Probably from painting onto the tiny ledge with the cave opening. Oh. Should I go back? Is it worth it? Or don't and teleport away. I mean, stream delay is a thing. No, no, a heart piece. Huh? Listen, we're just, we're, just, we're just gonna run around in the snow. It's fine. Um, I, I may decide to go hundo percento. But I'm not... If it's a thing I can just sort of grab as I'm running around like that, then absolutely I'll grab. Um, oh, snowmans! Got him! Hey! Um, but I imagine I'll probably wait till I... 60 FPS ray tracing. For stream delay? Correct. You put ray tracing in your browser? Um, I love the effect of the... Of that, like... It's like a layer. I don't know. Um, uh, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll probably, uh, uh, once I have all the items, then I can be like, okay, let's, let's loop through and I can even follow a guide if needed. Just grab all the stuff. Hey! Rude! God, the music in this game is so good. Uh, so this is the Treacherous Tower, which I think I should wait to do as well, to have more stuff. Put a pin in it so we don't for gore. I could also do a pin. I could also put a little pin. Can I put a little pin? I can put a little pin. Imperial March, mm-hmm. John Williams did the score for this game. You can end your game, I know. I can end you. There's a thing. Um, I can't put a pin in the world that I'm not in though. So I'll just eh, go there later, I guess. Uh, hi. Yeah, we'll, we'll deal with the treasure tower later. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Whoa! Oh, happy Halloween! Oh, he's coming for my bones! How delightful. Yeah. Smash it. Can't grab him. Well, I better put a pin then. There's a guy here. A lot of why not log off messages. Mm hmm. Yeah. You should stop playing our video game we spent a lot of time and effort making. Yeah, okay. Hmm. There's a bridge on the other side of this, as well as a bridge down below. Maybe we try the bridge down below? Hi. Oh, uh, whoa. Ho ho. Ho ho, look at you. Um, hold on. Hold on. Yeah. Oops. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Turn off the console, Link. The fucking... Colonel talking to Raiden and he's saying my nudes in bio. Got me good. Uh, let's drop down here. Mayhaps there's a... Uh, I'm going back. I'm going back. Since you get like 50 a pop, for what? Is there's exit for and rupees? Oh, yeah. That's why I was like, I'm not interested in sitting here and grinding rupees to buy all the items. Because this game throws rupees at you. That's part of what I was kind of half complaining about. Am I? Is this the right? Yeah. It's a bit smelly. Yay. Viewers, when they click on stream. Uh, eh, eh, eh. What I was talking about last time, where the game has this really interesting rental system, but because everything you do in this game gives you rupees, and it's an optional... Like... The, the Thieves' Dungeon I just did. 
the reward was rupees. There's nothing else. It's not like in a normal Zelda game or a normal, a different Zelda game, that might be like a piece of heart or something more substantial than just rupees. But this game's like, oh, you might be really bad at the game and in need of many rupees. So they just throw them on. But the end result is... There. Um, the end result is that I ended up just kind of buying each item outright. Because by the time I needed a new item... Shit! Ah, nuts! Um, there's a guy right there. Isn't that what you're talking about? Hmm... So where is this in the in the light world? Hmm. Hmm. I can probably drop down there, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, you. I thought I had a hook shot. I do. There's not a thing to hook shot. Jump it. I didn't see a thing to hook shot on the other side. It's probably fine. Um. Do a flip. Beep, 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 beep. It's like there's no coin purse upgrades, not wasting night time throwing a wall. Yep. There's no wallet upgrades. There's no dungeon maps. There's a lot of things in this game that just kind of were kind of neat a while ago, but now just kind of feel tedious in a lot of Zelda games. But I'm happy to be done with. You gotta go down to go up to the ice runes. Hey, neat. Uh, 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 yeah. Damn it. Yeah. I caught a fairy. Put it in a bottle. Shmish. I got some guts. Do, do, do you have it? Do you have it? Guts. Hi. And so when you're Iron Man, you hear Discord notifications? You talking about this one? Or this one? I guess the closing the quick equip menu? The select wheel thingy, yeah. There's a lot of other noise going on. When I close it, it kind of... Yeah, a little bit. Is it ethical? You know? Probably not. There's no ethical consumption of fairies under... Craptabilism. There's a guy up above somewhere. How... Where... Where am I? Uh, can I get out of here? I don't... Uh, I guess I can drop down from over there. The Probably the way you were telling me to before. They love it! It's comfy in there. They got their favorite shows. There's Wi-Fi. What more you need? Is that what it's going to be? That's the guy's chosen hero. I mean, yeah. Still quite self-centered approach to the world. Uh, it... So if I go over yonder and then drop down... Can I drop down here? I don't think I have a way to drop down. I Or, or I need it. Do I need to go through the whole... The whole goddamn thing again? I might need to go through the whole goddamn thing again. Um, I already got the guy, yes, but I didn't go the other routes from the big room. Because I didn't go left or right from the middle platform. I just kind of went down to get out of here. This part sucks. It doesn't suck. It's just a bit tedious. Um. Eh. Don't. Hi. Am I gonna know when to hit it? Yep. Go, 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 go. Thank you. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Yeah. Turn your 3D glasses on now. Trusting one that's one fairy's temporary freedom and the fate of the whole world. Uh, so, so the good of the, the few for the good of the when the many have fewer than a few. Oh God. Okay. 
What's all this about? Oh no. Shit. No! <laughs> all the way back? Uh, not all the way back. There was a soft checkpoint. Oh, actually, no, right here. Hey, second try. I mean, first try. We did it. Yeah! R.I.P. Bozo. Thank you. The good news is we got the optional thing in here. The bad news is this isn't the way we're actually supposed to go. So now I gotta go. I think it must be right. Oh, why are you so fast? Why are you so fast? <laughs> Later, Bozo. That's what that platform sounds like. Okay, and go. You'll have to do better than that to catch me. Thank you. But this area kind of hurts to look at, doesn't it? And yeah, easy. First try. Uh, uh. Oh. I should have stepped off on the platform. It's fine. We're not going to need it. Needs more orange. Oh, yeah. You should write to Nintendo. Let them know. Looks like I can maybe skip a step and just drop down. Skip this platform and go over here, but not worth it. Yeah. Oh. All right. Now to the right. Hello. No, 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 wait, 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 Stop it! Okay, alright, okay. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> Nailed it. This sucks. I I didn't remember it being this bad. Were they really making you time these jumps? Oh my god. What? Sir. Yo gaming! Was that what I meant to do? Absolutely not. Let's go! Gaming, gaming, gaming! Woohoo! Cross the mine way out. Uh, sure. I'm go to the mine. That's my gamer! It's me! I was your gamer all along, chat! Cross the mine is up! Ow. There's a door there. Sarius sucks! Um. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I just want to see if there's like a weather vane or something here. I guess I am your little pog champ. Let's go. Uh, doing this with a circle pad. Is this the right? I can go back. Okay. Oh, come on. Is he really? Goddamn Maya mice. Let's go. Oh, thank God. Never lose hope. You son of a... Okay. Right, okay. Eh, eh, eh. Okay, great. We made it. Let me check his little ore mine, though. Yeah, yeah. Well, that, that is the ore... This is the ore mine? Hello. Oh, that's the... Okay, so that's the ore mine. So then what's this store? Oh. I will soothe your wounds and provide comfort. Close your eyes and relax. Did you say wounds? Yes. The injuries you've sustained upon your body. It's pronounced wounds. Then why isn't why isn't it spelled W O O? I don't know how to read. Oh. Well, because you corrected me, I'm not providing you with healing. Good day, sir. Mm. The number of times you correct me is the number of hearts I don't heal. I corrected you once, then I won't heal you once. But that's not... Okay. Don't be me, dumbass, and once you get to the lower world, decide to hookshot over the bridge before you activate the save point? Yeah, no. In fact, I'm like, I kind of want to just do that before I even check out the ore cave. Like, I need to. I need to just kind of. Because once we have the. Hello? Once we get the save point here, we don't have to deal with Minecraft Lava Room. 
ever again, unless we really want to. Hi! Hey. Ah. Uh, welcome back to Laurel Kingdom, dudes. This is Death Mountain. Here it is always winter. Somewhere buried under the ice is a ruined hall. A sage with a soul as formidable as a boulder awaits your help there. You must hurry, though. His spirit will not last forever with such accursed ice everywhere. You, low rule. You, high rule. So say I, Hilda, of low rule. Wish Hilda got to be in Hyrule Warriors. She'd be neat. Hey, what's over this way? I almost, I almost pressed the button as a goof. And I was like, I don't know the range of the hookshot. Okay, we're good. <laughs> we're good. We don't have to do Minecraft room again. Ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, I'm going back. Show me that ore cave. Or what? Hilda of low rule. Oh. She's like both. Uh, eh? Was it? Was it? Is ore my? I ran past it. Didn't I? It's, it's uh, over. Is ore mine? Wait. Where's the ore mine? There for gore. And ore mine. Lol the Hyrule. Lol! I jumped it. Come on. Come on. Where's his ore mine? Is these rocks? The rocks are the mine? Ore mine is the lava room, nothing to see. It's not a cave. Oh. Well. There's also, um, they're like this way to the exit. I don't know if that's worth checking at all. If it's not worth, feel free to let me know. But I was curious. It's the friends of me alone. God damn it, Rosso. Play me like a goddamn fiddle. <laughs> This platform brings you back to the entrance. Oh. Where was this when I needed it? Will it go back? Will it, will it go back? Good. And we... Dead. You didn't wait for me to type it! No. I like to ask questions and then just go ahead and do it. Knowing full well that someone out there is going to be helpfully answering my question and is powerless to just watch me do the thing they're like, no, don't do it. It brings me joy. What we call a chat's nightmare. Yeah. Chat's nightmare special. All right. Um, so I could go that way, but that's a one way path. So let's venture onward. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah. He's got some good damage noises in this game, this Link. Whoa, spooky! Whoa, 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 whoa! Come here. Oh, you little shit. How'd you get up there? Alright, okay. I see. I see your tricks. Oh. I like that the Mai Mai's are not only incremental rewards for every 10 instead of needing to get all of them for a reward. I also like that the rewards are really substantial. And you get to choose. It's like good and it's in line with the other parts of the game. It's not like, oh, my first upgrade is the ice rod and you don't have that yet. So come back once you have that. It's just like, which one of the items you bought do you want to upgrade? It's just, it's just good. And if you hadn't, if you're like, oh, I'm just fine just renting them. It's like, here's a reason to buy them. It's good. A dire fate awaits those who approach the ice ruins atop the mountain's peak. Yeah, okay. I better not then. Anything cool up here? There's another one. God. I bet he's there. Uh, da, da, da. Okay. Better. Let's go have a, a, a fate. He'll, he'll met with the bad fate room. Let's go back in the lava room. Oh. This is way nicer to look at. Oh, I remember that. Oh, I remember. Oh, I remember. Oh, I remember. Oh, no. Oh, I remember. Oh, no. 
I have been met with a terrible fate, haven't I? No, 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 no. Hi. Give me a spin. Wee. Oh God. Oh God. Oh Jeebus. Okay. Good. Hey, how we doing? Um, hold on. Let me uh just quickly, for no particular reason. Uh, yeah, that's good. Hi. Yay. Oh. 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 I went to this one first. Why? Um, well, because I was like, I don't want to do the Thieves' Dungeon first, because it's the most obvious one to start with, and it's more fun than not. And then someone in chat was like, the Ice Dungeon gives you good reward. And I was like, sweet. Because I, I should mention, for anyone that hasn't seen the game, uh, the dungeons have good rewards. Um, they're just not key items like Hookshot, Boomerang, etc. There's the hardest dungeon in the game. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. We're getting out of the way first, then. Oh, ye fool! Did I just walk into an ice trap? Who seeketh the ice ruins travel north? Oh! Good timing on chapping like, why are you doing this? And the game's like, you're a fool! Yeah, well. I got an upgraded fire rod, so. Who's laughing now? If we can defeat this dungeon, there's nothing that can stop us. We don't have the compass yet. We're not I, we're not in the dungeon yet. This is just the lava cave, but in low rule. It's good to get early. I'm definitely down to play- Oh, you. I'm definitely down to play this game. This playthrough. In such a way. That. We, like, get the good upgrades. Earlier on. Hmm. You're there. Oh, you do come down. And then you go up. They want me to go north, so let's go south first. How can we go north? I always liked walking north. It feels like walking uphill. Going for optional stuff is actually pretty challenging. Mm -hmm. It's not just necessarily the optional stuff. It's like, I want to... Oh, oh, oh no! That was rude. I want to... No. Global timers. Uh, I'm cold. Good. Grab a blanket. Grab a fire rod. We want red rupee. I, mm -hmm. This still hurts to look at? Now it's just because of my gameplay. Um, plus, I'm not talking about getting all like the heart pieces and my eyes early on. I'm going to save those probably later. Um, but like, yeah, if the ice dungeon gives you a good reward early on, then that may be good to grab, for example, etc. Yeah, you fuckers. Get them. We're cold. Do a sword beam. I didn't have full HP. Okay, don't drop down. There you go. A goopy! Stop it. There he is. I did briefly look at um, uh, the Zelda dungeon walkthrough for this game. Just to see if they're like, here's a recommended order. And they're like, kind of, yeah. But I didn't really delve too deeply into it. Um, is this where you first come in? My man. That's fine. Oh, no, it's not. Huh. Um, and their guide does go through. Okay, you first now made it to low rule. You can now get 44 Mayamais. And I was like, yeah. That is a way you could play the game. It's not a way I would recommend playing the game. Because not only is that... I mean, you would unlock a lot of stuff doing that. Cover a lot of ground. Uh. <laughs> Damn. Uh, like you unlock a lot of, uh, save points and stuff. Um, he's fine. But, uh... You wouldn't be able to get the upgrades. You probably wouldn't have the rupees just from exploring and getting overworld stuff without dipping into caves and dungeons and stuff. You probably wouldn't have enough rupees. Like, just from running through here and fighting through, I'm almost at enough to... I mean, arguably some of them are 800, so probably good. Um, but, uh... Man. Wait, was it this way or was it left and then up that I hadn't done? The fairy safe. That's what they're there for. One dungeon you can't do first because you need an iron from Thieves Town. Yeah. Which is also maybe why, why they make you do Thieves Town first. Or nudge you to do Thieves Town. Mm -hmm. Dying before the dungeon. No? Wrong way? Left then up. 
cool. I was like, I think that there is a path this way, right? Those jumps always. This is the way we didn't go. But there's also a way to the north that way. Unless this is an optional guy. If this is an optional guy, then good. Because it's great to be done with this place and not have to come back. So it's funny. Aral? Hi. Where are we going? Oh, we're doing that, are we? Oh, no! <laughs> Damn it. I'm good at this. This is good. Is LM2 out on Switch yet? Luigi's Mansion? L La Mulana 2? Um, L Link's Mawakening? Tip of the hat. Mawakening. So I have to wait for the moment it starts to move back. Ugh. Oh, that feels really bad. Link's Moyhead? Bang, bang. Oh, you just have to rely on the camera moving? Because you don't have a good frame of reference? This sucks. E. Get him. Damn. Damn it. We're fine. I'm going to get a piece of heart, and I'll be in tip-top shape. Tip-top Banjo-Kazooie. Oh, now we're... Oh, now we're... He oh. This puzzle in 3D is still left. Definitely is nice with stereoscopic 3D. I definitely forgot... I mentioned before, this was a game I played with stereoscopic 3D a lot, because it looked neat. There's a lot of rooms in this game that you kind of benefit from being able to see in 3D. Definitely true. Um, let me get rid of the pin. You can change the color of the pin! And you can just delete. Okay, good. Neat. The angle for a second. Yeah, yeah, someone shared an image last stream. There's definitely some areas where it's more obvious than others. Um, can I just jump off like hip? No. No, you can't. Okay, why do we have to why is there no shortcut back to the middle platform? Okay. Lol, nope. At least this seems slightly easier, because you're going down, so I feel like I don't have to worry as much about the timing, but you can. You just won't go very far. Have I played Milan Milana? I don't think I've streamed it. I tried playing it. Didn't get very far. I find it fascinating, but it didn't quite grip me, but maybe I didn't get far enough. Played like maybe two hours of it. Oh, you. Play it on stream, it's a nightmare. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. Ew. Ew. Hello. Got him. Yeah. I do like the uh, kind of specular bump map, kind of normal map business there. With the little snowflakes. Why well, stream the Splatoon DLC? Um, maybe. Let me know if that's the thing you would like. Wait, do they have a release date for that? I do like the idea of a Splatoon-esque roguelike. Roguelite kind of thing. Things are hard and cryptic from what I remember. I think that's the whole point of the game. Oh. Oh. Hi. Yes. Hello. How are you? Okay. We're just gonna suffer, probably. Yeah. 22nd of this month? Oh, damn. That is soon. I mean... Oh, fuck you! Yeah, it's fine. We'll do... Yeah, no, it's good. It's okay. Every fall just takes a year off my life, but other than that, I'm fine for it. I'm all good about it. Oh, you fucking... Oh, yeah, yeah. No. Doing this with a circle pad is hell. <laughs> like, I can't express to you. You have a tiny little nubbin that just kind of slides around loosely. Like, playing a... Playing, playing this game with a Lenovo laptop little... Little nubbin thing. It's rough. Alright. I don't mind it when you're just moving around and running around. It's it's great, actually. I think it's very good for what it is. But it's like, okay, walk in a straight line horizontally. It's like... Huh? Oh, what fools dare to approach the dreaded ice ruins just ahead. 
with all the signs about how much of a fool I am for being here, it would be great if uh, you get up there and there's no dungeon. It's just the guy who's like, oh, well, here's the piece of heart. I didn't think anyone was actually going to follow the signs up here. Yeah. Oh, baby, a Drupal. Drupal. Why didn't you read the signs? Why? Two Tin Koopa from Paper Mario. Mm hmm. Duh. Hi. Hey. Have it. Look at this ice palace. Neat. Yay. The two ton Koopa. Pay Mario 1 and Thousand Door are both very fun, 100%. Thousand Your Door is this year, right? Didn't they say 2024? That'll be fun. Hi. May I? Thank you. In we go. All right, easiest dungeon in the game. Let's go. I love me some sliding block puzzles and ice physics, so I hope I'm in the right place for that. Yeah. Maybe I should blast it. Hmm. Eh. Oh, they spinning. Mm hmm. Oh, the fire also hurts me. That's good to know. I like this whole dungeon. Sheesh. It's pretty good. Wizards! Wiz wizards! Oh, got a locked door there. You gotta wait for the pillar to blast them. That'll teach you. These guys are very good. Kind of looks like Deku Link. From like, uh, Wind Waker. I mean, Majora. I don't know why I said Wind Waker. Uh, I think it would also made me think of the Re-Deads. A little bit. Because they're like purple. Whee! Shit! I'm not gonna die in here, I'm totally fine. That's what the fairies are for. And... Eh! Got a locked door there. Well, not even locked. Huh. How would how would I press up against the wall way up high here? Oh well. How would when you, of the Oh boy, a green rupee in a chest! It's worth one rupee. Hand you a rock. This is worth one rock. Wow. It is the way that it is. Hi. How you doing? Oh. Well. It's cool. It's chill. How you doing? Got him! How about this one? Monster horn! Delicious. Better than human horn. Alright. Oh, that's not the bottom. That's the... Uh, this does kind of feel like some kind of Dark Souls shenanigans. Hey, we got the big key! Alright, we can finish the dungeon. Let's go. What the hell is that back there? Probably nothing important. Um. Cool. Hmm. 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 What a weird dungeon. It's definitely not one I remember as much. There's a secret chest on the top floor. I don't have the compass yet. I guess I can... Yeah, here a mode where you don't get any heart drops would be quite rude. I guess I could hop off on that platform. There's a guy up here? Hidden somewhere? Hidden where? 
block on the wall. The shelf? Oh, like here? Uh, hey, look at you. Pretty sneaky. Okay, what if I... What if I um, get, hop on it here? And then... Ride it up. And then when they least expect it... Yeah! Shit. Um... I feel like the big key should open all small key doors, you know? Seems like... It would be... What did my miss? What did I miss on my little elevator action? Too big. I want a pole! A what? It has to fit. Which of these extremely vertical Zelda dungeons is your favorite? Ice Ruins in this game, Wind Temple and Wind Waker, Eagle Tower Link's Awakening, or Snowhead from Majora? Well, I want a pool. Well, okay. Well, I don't have a channel point redeemed for that now, do I? Any of you guys drop hearts or anything? Nope. Cool. Remember the small key? What small key? Was it? Oh, the one that was on the ledge? Can I... Can I... Hip? Hmm. What if I were to... Figure out a way to hop on a wall. Major, look. Shit. Thanks for the bits, Invader Zimmer. What if I... Eh. Hmm. Uh... What, what if... Wait, what if instead of any of that, you just... No, I'm good. No, I'm good, Chad. I'm good. Thanks for asking, though. Uh, is locked door... Bu no, is a... Bu go up. Let me upgrade a fire rod. Does the regular one not create a pillar? Yeah, I'm good. Wait. Let's go. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Whoa! Nice. They gave me some much needed healing. Mm. Whoa! Whoa, look at him go! I like his entire situation about it. Hey, you bad? I'm so, so bad. No, you wouldn't believe. You guys got any healing? In your... God, these guys have a great vibe. They're also in Link to the Past Ice Dungeon. Or in today. Uh, give me the... 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 Let's go. All right, chat. Now I know how to grab this. Guess I didn't have a good angle on it. Try that again. Oh man, that's so weird that didn't work. Oh man, chat, what am I gonna do? What am I, what am I gonna do? I'm boned. Hmm. What is the... Eh, I'll figure it out. All right. Gotta reset. Oh, I, I see it. Oh, good God. Uh-oh. I'm only lightly concerned about my imminent demise. Hey, a compass! Son of a... Can you just do your, do your business? Thank you. They're like, hey, we heard how much you enjoy walking in a straight line with the circle pad, so... We got you more of that. Cool. Da, 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 da. Yeah, woo. How many more? Do I have one fairy? I have one more fairy. Yeah, jeez. Ah, jeez. Well, oh, you... Okay, come on now. That's just absurd. Ugh, look at all that beneath us. Acting like those turrets are dogs trying to poop. Yeah, do your business. Hey. Hey! Watch it. We had a tie between Wind Temple from Wind Waker and Snowhead from Majora. Wow. What all be? We love a vertical tower, don't we? Hmm. So there's a cranky guy there. Let me get probably probably oh, just that. At the ready. Um. Hmm. 
what am I... There's a chest? So there is. Ho ho. What a find. Yes, yes, yes. Nom nom. Yes. There we go. Don't like the way that they just let it clip through the walls. Feel, feels it's a poor show. Come on, Nintendo, you can do better than that. Oh no. Um. Um. Yeah. You son of a. There's fairies next door. How do I get them? How do I add them to my collection? This is probably some in, in more good. I'm a fool. Sucks here. No, it's good. It's nice and friendly and everyone's nice and my friend and nothing's trying to harm me. Or my tender little bones. Of which I have an abundance. Overabundance of bones link, they calls them. Um... I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna capture him. I think, uh... Yeah. 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 I caught a fairy! Put in a ball! These guys respawn if I leave. That'd be really cool. Old bones of plenty, they calls them. Mm-hmm. What if I leave and then came back? How would we feel about that, fairies? <gasps> they actually do respawn. That is more generous than I thought this game was going to be. Yay. All right. That's all four of my bottles. Old Link full of bones. Some say bones would just fall out of him wherever he went. You can hear him coming from a mile away on account of all the bones falling out. Yeah, I'm back. Let's go. And give me the fire rod back. All right. Hello? Hello? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. No, I'm over here. Oh. Oh! 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 Well, that's fun. That's also- No! My bloopy! No! Hmm. Huh. Okay. Birth. <laughs> Happy birthday, bombs. That's where bombs come from, actually. In case you didn't know. Um. Huh. Ah, I might just... Hey, don't... I don't need you to. I have my own, thank you. Uh... Mm, eh. Yahoo! Nice of them to give you a source of bombs if you don't have bombs. And also nice that they can just go, Yeah, you have bombs? Alright. Do it yourself, then. Is good. I do remember a couple instances of things like that where you can use your own item if you have it, but then they have a built-in thing that lets you do that mechanic if you don't have the item at the ready. Uh, no, this is probably good. Yeah. No, this is really good. Uh-oh. Um, uh, huh? Uh, uh, I'm just gonna, nah. And then, eh. Didn't think using the fire rod would be a good idea on this ice platform. How would you? How would you? How would you? Darn it. Gotta wait for it to mic ride. The platform's melted if you use fire? Yeah. A little bit. Mike Tona. Let's tow away. Hello. Is this up above me? It isn't. Where this be? Oh. Guts. Guts. I am not having a single thought. Guts. I am not having a single thought. Hey yo, I just have some poo brain. I don't know what I'm saying. And I'm not having a single thought. Good timing of that hammy coming in on me going guts. Without another thought in my brain. Hey, thanks for the hammy, Levi. 
Have you seen the newest Death Stranding 2 trailer? Any thoughts? Hi. Um, yeah, I did. I did watch it. My thoughts are I'm so there. Oh, um, I, I, I watched it with Bath. My, my financy. Yep. And, um, we both agreed that, especially in the context of some of the other trailers during the little showcase, that, like, most AAA game trailers have just kind of been whatever, but also a lot of AAA video games have just kind of been a little bit whatever. The, the, there's a number of factors at play. Um, the expense that goes into a modern AAA game, the number of people, as well as just the investments, both figurative and literal, that go into a large AAA release these days, that for many, many years now, uh, the AAA industry has become extremely stale to me. And there's still AAA games that come out every year that I'm interested in. Um, and it's not like this is a new phenomenon by any stretch of the imagination. But we definitely live in a period where a lot of AAA games are like, it's a shooter with looting mechanics and a battle royale with the battle pass and we're showing off our microtransactions in the reveal trailer and it's like I don't care. Um and it's nice to watch a trailer like Death Stranding or Death Stranding 2 where you're just like I don't know what the fuck like the trailers for Death Stranding 1 is this just a throw another bomb up there? I don't see I don't know. Um Yeah. You know that's just the door. Hmm Unless I can't, unless I can, um, but yeah, so like all the Death Stranding 1 trailers were like, I don't know what this game is, I have no idea what this world is, I'm watching Norman Reedus, he's naked, there's a baby, he's got hands all over him, okay, second trailer, this one will start to explain things, right, and it's just more confusing, right, I forgot to do a full loop around, um, I'm, it's, is that Guillermo del Toro and he's running around with a baby, and Mads Mikkelsen is here and he's like, World War II, like what on earth is any of this, um, but then eventually the game came out, and I've played Death Stranding, and I made a video about it, and I have complicated feelings about it, but ultimately I like it a lot. Um, okay, I can't go in there. Um, but at the end of the day, it's like, okay, but now I know what Death Stranding is. And when they goes, okay, I'm making a Death Stranding sequel, I'm like, okay, I would imagine that it's going to involve walking around, right? It's going to involve... Eh. Yippee! So I have to go up? Where is... What is above me? Huh. I'll figure that out, I guess. Um, I can't go through there. This is a weird dungeon. Um, it's also like I I need to be thinking about where I am in the space and how these things connect. And I'm just like, how do I? How do I? How do I light this? How do I light this torch? Do I have to come back later, or can I actually light this now? I'm asking for me, my brain. Three helps a bunch of this. A little bit. I don't see a way that I could light this here. But also, I don't see how this connects to anything. Do not remember. Hmm. Uh, the joy guy, the crank belly, and railgun guitar is pretty good. Yeah, so that's ultimately my point. That, like, Death Str uh, uh, Kojima said I'm making a sequel called Death Stranding 2, or DS2 was the working title. Sure. How do I light this torch? Um... And, uh, it's like, okay, he's gonna reveal the game and show us trailers and stuff, and, like... Even with the initial Death Stranding 2 trailer, I was like, yeah, like, am I confused? Sure, I don't, I mean, but a lot of what we saw makes sense. Okay, uh, Leah Sado was running over the baby. I'm assuming I know who that baby is. Uh, 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 Norman Reedus looks older. I have reasons of why I would assume why he looks older. Um, there's a lot of stuff in that trailer where I was like, yeah, this is weird, but I have things I know that connect me to this. And then the most recent trailer is just like, oh, the fuck is going on? And that's extremely refreshing. Both as someone who now understands what Death Stranding the fuck is, and also because, man, that that's just a a wild trip. I can just run over here. Oh, um, I I I reject the. I don't like how a lot of people put Kojima up on a pedestal. Um, both just as a designer. Eh, leave me alone. I, I, I think he's a very smart man with a lot of smart ideas, and I adore a lot of his games. But people give him, I think, too much auteur theory credit, as if his games were born entirely out of his own brain, and he doesn't really shy away from that impression either, even though he has longtime collaborators that he's worked with on all of his games, like, like Yoji Shinkawa, who are very responsible for the look of a lot of his games. 
Um, and so it's like, I, I think he's got very smart ideas and sometimes he's able to execute on those ideas in a way that's interesting. But also people have a very weird... And also because these games are very flawed because they're video games and all the games are flawed, people are like, wow, this is the Kojima you love so much. Well, why are his games fucking weird? It's like, that's part of what I like about him. But the, like, cult of personality around him kind of does him more harm than good, I think. So anyway, I'm very excited for Death Stranding 2. I'll be there day one. Um, I'm gonna die here. But, yeah. You should go up here. I should probably try to not die here. Son of a- Fuck! No, 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 no. Oh, this is such a bad place for this. Hi. Why does he do a loop instead of just turning around? I thought he was just going to prep and then come at me. This string was alright. If you watch my video, if you've seen it, uh, you'll, you'll know that I didn't play it on stream. And I'm glad I didn't, because my experience with that game was very weird. I didn't know if I liked it or not for a very long time, until I was like, I want to keep playing more, but I don't know why. And I haven't had that feeling in a very, very, very long time. Uh, the hell is this for? Why, why is this? I don't think I want to drop down there. Um, okay. Um, hmm. There's gotta be a reason that's there. It's a nice view. It is. Hello. But also, uh, that game is filled with copyrighted music, which would be a rough time to fit. I w I'd be listening to a lot of Katamari if I played Death Stranding's narrative on stream. Um, I ended up playing a bunch on stream just to capture footage and stuff. And I did a stream of the director's cut when that came out. Because they had a bunch of silly new stuff. I got the stamina scroll! Your energy gauge is increased! Oh! Yay. That is a very nice reward. And reason to do this earlier in the game. Ten hours of that Mountain Dew sloshing. Uh, excuse you, it's monster energy drink sloshing. How do you feel about getting the boss key at the start of this dungeon? It's something I was talking about before, that different Zelda dungeons have different structures. I was uh, last stream, not today before. Um, and I, I like the way that linear dungeons in Zelda... I like the idea of seeing the boss door and then later getting the boss key and going, oh, now it's go mode. I'm ready to go get to the boss. I know where that door is. I'm going to head over there. And there's dungeons that flip on that idea. Um, I, it doesn't usually work for me as well when they give you the boss key early. Or there's, there's kind of three ways to do it. One is like this, where they give you the boss key immediately. And you're like, this seems way too early. And this is weird. And I'm going to basically forget that I have it. I'm not crazy about it, but it is kind of neat, I guess. The other way is, like I was saying, where you, you see the boss door, and then later on, you get the boss key. Either it's, like, deep in the dungeon somewhere, or it's, like, the hub of the middle of the dungeon has a big spooky door, and you're like, okay, I got the, the key, I'm ready to go. Um, or you just sort of, like, wait until the very end to be like, here's the boss key, here's the boss door, done. Which isn't as satisfying. I like when it's a buildup of anticipation. When they do the boss door really early or give you the boss key really early. I feel like it's not quite as effective for that moment uh, at which... But again, if every dungeon has the same structure, then that gets tiring. So... It is It is something. Uh, shit. Um... Can I... Whoa. Right. Go back down. Half dungeons behind the boss door. Yeah! So there's red rupee. I don't need it. I have 1,600. Um, so what, what am I doing now? There's that chest up above. I hope I'm, I'm, this is why I was like, I need to be paying attention because I'm unlocking things, but this dungeon is very confusing. Uh, so I can drop down here. Which looks like death. Cool. And then there's this guy here, which I can use... Fuck it. Now I'm back here. Oh, this is where I am. Okay. It's weird that that doesn't... open. 
Wee. <laughs> what a nice view from that tiny ledge. It is a nice view. Is there a reason for that view that I'm oblivious to? Can you drop down the ledge with a lantern? Maybe. Possibly. I'm just gonna do a little loop around back to the middle of the room. And use that vantage point to figure out what the hell I'm doing. Unless I'm going backwards in a way that's bad. I can see on the map that this is where the boss door is. Um, there's a whole section over there I haven't been to. B2 has a bunch of stuff and a big little chest there. There's not much of the dungeon left, but I'm like, where, where do I go? It's a weird guy. Right, I came here too. There's some platform that I have to spawn in there. The tiny ledge, there's a thing I can do from there. I think I have to go that way, because I think I dropped down to get to this. I think I have to go that way anyway. What can I do from Tiny Ledge? TM. My favorite indie publisher. Nice rupees. Thanks. Oh, Miyaga! Thanks for gifting a sub to Disco Inferno. Hope you enjoy the emotes. Thank you mucho. You can laugh at Ledge for being tiny. Hey! That Tiny Ledge is my friend! Take it back. Shit. Um. Uh, how do I get back up? Um. Isn't there a platform going up and down here? Did I already forgore? Did I already forgore? Uh, uh, you don't have to. Did, I only. Oh, it's over here. I don't want anyone posting any story spoilers in the chat, but I don't mind help. If you want to watch me suffer, I respect that, and that is your right. Um, let's go... No, not this way. Go back. He's fun. Yeah, I mean, also, Diddles is just a good emote. No! Nah! It's my fuel! Is for going to pay attention to remember? Well, I was trying to pay attention. I was just also trying to talk about Death Stranding, which is one of the hardest games to talk about. It's such a, a weird little guy. Um, anything cool over here? Yeah, it's pretty cool over there. So what could I do from Tiny Ledge TM? I don't see what I could do from Tiny Ledge TM. Besides maybe drop straight down from here? Eat? Nope. How about the other side? What other side? This side? Fuck! I was like, maybe I can land on top of where this is. Well, now we get to run all the way back around, I guess. For her. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I get it. I don't get it. But that's okay. Oh. There is this time. There is th that guy. That guy. Wait, no. How the Firefall in Love It found its perfect match? Jump through hoops to the monster part. Yeah, it's probably just the monster part, isn't it? Um, not here. I think. Wait, yes here? Yes. God. I am happy to have gotten this dungeon out of the way, because... Mmm! It's a good dungeon! It's a tasty dungeon. Okay, from here... Can I just, uh... Eh! First try. Figure it out right away. Good. Is there anything else I need to do up here? Fuck it. Bye. That just... Wait, no, it actually is good, because now I have access to this part of the dungeon again. I was like, wait. All it did was bring me back here, but I think that is good. Because... why? Why is that good? Um, I'll tell you why it's good. Uh, um, uh, 
Because over here? No. I still don't have the key I need for that. What was here again? Oh, because this... Okay, yeah. Wait, before I do that, there are some guys here. Don't know if there's any here. Don't look like it. Someone's out of the train while trying to solve this dungeon has not recovered since. No, we're back. We're still back. There you go. There you go. Um. How the hell? Where the... Hmm. Okay. Hi. Ah! Oh, Slippy. Hey. Get back here. Uh, so there's a thing that all that. Penguins! Penguins! Oh, he hits hard. Oh, he hits very hard. Sir? I was trying to get- I guess I could have merged into the wall. Thanks. I'm back. Don't bully me! I'm allowed to bully you, not the other way around. I missed. Oh, I got him. Dead. Watch out for the attacks. Okay, good. Okay, great. So now, now... Okay, oh. Um. Easy does it. And then that'll fill in the get. Oh, where the hell is that? Okay. Let's just say that that's a thing I knew I needed, and I'm like, yes, finally. Now that's been done. Uh. Oh no. Hello. It suddenly turns into a horror game. Hello. Ah! <laughs> Damn it. Uh, can I light this from underneath? Sure can. Yeah, the, the, the bing. Any Usher fans in the chat? Ooh! Yeah, I'm a big fan of his song where he's like, Creeper. Aw, oh, man. So we back in the... Hmm. I hardly know. You're also... You're chill? Okay, cool. Whoa! Demons! <laughs> you blasted your brother! You blasted your brother, you fool! Eh. Goodbye. Ow. I blasted myself. I shouldn't be talking. Hey, the right side's open now. Let's go. Anything cool here? Oh. I mean, yeah. The irony. Can I... You got... Y'all's got any hearts at all, ever? Anywhere in the... Okay, here. What if I... Eep. Oh, there's the small key. There she be. And we go. Yep. Nice. Good. Grand. Truly magnificent. Ah, Link. You must fetch me the Triforce Cube. There's the Harkinian Cube. I mean, he thinks it may be worth doing this again before I venture further. On account of me being bad at the game. Ow. You must try Force Link. The Trubix Cube Link. Link, you must recover my Rubix Cube. Stay a while and watch me solve it. Uh, we got need two more guys. Let's get two more guys real quick. That's one more guys. Put it in a bottle. And two guys. Put him in a bottle. Alright, uh, and then uh, and then wait, and then um, uh, that maybe. Mm -hmm. It'll take a while to solve. I'm very bad at them. Hmm. Oh, that's the room I was in. Uh, yeah. Um. Yeah. And yeah. Hmm. 
Now, what does that do for me? Do I want to drop into that? Yeah. There's nothing in there. Let's say yes. Oh. Now I'm up over here. Okay, now that's the open at the very bottom. Uh huh. How are we doing on map? Still that guy on the top of B2. And that's it. So I need to figure out how to get to that guy. Um, as well as, what was the way that connected? Is it just down? Do I go down from here? Because this connect, no, yeah, no. Can I get back there this way? No, I may not. Um, hey, Sunny Alice, thanks for the raid. Welcome. Hope you had a good stream. We're playing Link Between Worlds, and I'm trying to remember how the hell to get through this dungeon. It's going rad. Thanks for asking. Um, not here. Up here, and then over here. And then I think I dropped down here to do... So I've linked the past in this game, which is directly based on it. Is the tongue thing a trope in any other Zelda? These guys? I don't know. It's definitely a very Link to the Past kind of guy. Um, that'll get you there. Yeah! Yippee! <laughs> Good. Uh, oh. Oh no, oh no, oh god, oh Jesus. Yeah, no. It's cool, the platforms respawn, they do. Good. I knew they would. I knew they would. Damn it. Um, uh. Leave me alone. If I need bombs, I'll ask. Oh, this, oh, oh, this, oh, no. oh, oh, they crack. Okay, um, um, check this out. Uh, can I, can I just, like, stand, like, here and then just, eh? Oh, thank God. Get off, get off, get off, get off the thing. Oh, okay, ha. Ah. Phantom Hourglass. Yeah, I like. I like, uh... Phantom Hourglass and Spirit Tracks. I had a lot of fun revisiting them. I actually liked Spirit Tracks a lot more than I recalled from back in the day. Neither are my favorite Zeldas, or even favorite handheld Zeldas, but... They're fun. They're neat. They're weird. Good. Good. The wife told me to tell you, Shalom. Hello. A uh, shalom to you as well. Okay. So, that's the boss door. So how do I get that last goddamn chest? I need the bloopy that's in there. Or whatever. Um. So it's above me? Well, how the hell? Nothing connects to him. How do? Go left and up to B2. Okay. Up to be- okay, like, take the elevator. We can get back to that. Nope. This way? Yeah. Yeah. God, it is- uh Keep almost falling off. To be two. Yeah, if anyone remembers how to get this guy, I would appreciate your assistance in this trying time of mine. Um... Never been a top 10 Zelda other than Phantom Hourglass. Well, if you liked Phantom Hourglass, definitely check out Spirit Tracks. Is it from outside? No, wait, no. No, her name is 2B. Oh. The annoying Cyclops robots are, go there. How do I get that? They're around the outside, aren't they? Isn't that down another floor and then up? Mm. The place with the thing on it. The stuff with the guys. Wait, that's down. How do I go up from here? No, up that. Oh, the one that's right here. Yeah. This guy. Upward floor. Over these guys. Do I just do a loop? 
Surely that can't be right. I hate this game sometimes. Made it. God damn it. Thanks. Yay, Slorpy. Delicious. Anything this way? Nope. You gotta use the mechanic. You gotta remember. You need the stamina scroll to get there. Fair enough. Yeah. This this does feel like some from soft shit. Like, am I supposed to be here? Feels like I'm outside the level now. And they're like, nope, this was intended. Good job. Okay. Now we go back. Now we go back. Uh 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 uh. Uh, to could to go down to go down. Down seems correct. Ball stuff is great. It's very good. I like it a lot, even when I'm like, huh? When? Who? All right, good dungeon. Thanks for all the help. Uh, let me just double check. Yep, 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 yep. Looks good. Looking clear. Great. Let's jam. This dungeon or Turtle Rock is harder. Turtle Rock is turtles. So it's probably harder just because of the shells. Oh. Oh, you're very goopy. I wonder what I do to get to his tender interior. Oh no. Whoa! He's using triangles against me! Is that legal? Get back here. Shit. Hey! I'm already gonna die. Wait! Shit. The evilest of shapes. Triangles are ours! You fiend! Do these icicles have any hearts in them? That'd be really neat if they did. Oh! Seems that they don't, which makes me a little sad. No. Oh ho! No! I didn't mean to touch him. It was a goof. Hey! Get the back here! Purple! Who said you could be purple and cooler? More of them! He can make a hexagon! This isn't a drill! Whoa! 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 That's neat! He's significantly leveled up. Oh god! Oh! I think I almost got him. Sir? No, no, no. Ah, <laughs> damn it. I almost got him without having to use a fairy. Play his wet slaps on the ground. He's a very neat boss. The length of bass boss noises. Oh, yeah. Also, the damage noise when you attack them. It's classic. Oh, big triangle. E oh, missed. Shit. Oh. Shit.
Neil Gaiman. That's what we do here. We game. Veni vidi game me. Yahoo! Yippee! It should have been a hint that he's fighting me on a hexagon platform. They would get more of him. That's a neat guy. Oh my god! Our best friend! He looks good. I wish I could merge next to him so I could, like, take a peek at him. Look at him! Quick phase three to give him his own Triforce. Oh. It's part Sacred Realm, part crystals from Link to the Past. Well, just look at this. Who would have thought I'd see you here, dudes? Not all that surprised to see me here, though. I've known for a long time that I was a sage. Never told anyone, though. It wasn't really a secret. I was just too busy mining all the time to mention it. Dude was one of the legendary sage's ancestors. And he's like, I just like digging, so I didn't, didn't really come up in conversation much. Speaking of busy, you've still got some work to do here. Find the rest of the seven sages, okay? If you do, you'll be all the stronger, dudes. Thanks. Can't say I care much about all this Demon King business. I just want to get home and crack some rocks. With my chompers. Chew on them a bit. So find the rest of the seven sages already. I'm going to go nuts if I'm cooped up here for much longer. Is this, is this, this is, this, is, this guy is where Demon King? Secret stone. This is the, he, he gave birth to Gorons. He's the proto-Goron. The Ocarina of Time takes place after this in the timeline because he created the Gorons. He gave birth to a Goron in a mountain. That's why they're like hanging on rocks and eating rocks all the time. I've seen Prometheus. Yeah, that's what it's about. We. Hey, stop spinning me. I'm getting dizzy. Hey, dudes. Hey. Better quarter dudes or I'm going to have a word to say about that. Bye. He nutted a rock kidney stones. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, God. Yay. We did it. Yeah, let's shave. They spawned from rocks. This fellow romanced the rock. He did. That's what romancing the stone's about. Anybody know that movie? It's about a man who loves a rock very, very much. Uh. Eh, eh, eh. Meh. Eh, meh. Yeah. Okay, where to? Ah. Shit. Well, if I get, um... No, we have enough rupees to get another thing. We can go say hi to Ravio. Ravioli, Ravioli. Give me the formioli oli. Uh, is, there was a guy next to here, I think. Dark Temple? What, the Dark Temple give you a good thing? You don't gotta tell me what the thing is, but do you recommend we do that? I'm down for whatever. Whatever's gonna give us something that's neat. Let's go for defense. Let's go for defense, because yeah, you need a couple things to upgrade the sword, if memory serves. Hey! Wait it. Dog Temple! Isn't that the Silent Hill 2 ending? Uh, uh. Dark Temple. Swamp Temple? Was his face smooched to plot? Yeah, grabs him from the face. So what item do I need to do the defense temple then? Water Temp? Schwamp Temp? Defense. Defense. Clap, clap. Hookshot. Okay, well I can just buy it. A warm welcome to you, Mr. Hero. Hello. Um, should I, should I buy a hookshot? You're already renting the hookshot. Maybe you want to buy it, it's 800. Hmm. Could buy it, or I could invest. No, I don't. Interested boomerang? That's 800 rupees. Well, I could buy, I could buy two. Get out of my house, bunnyman. Full of Michael Douglas today. I really am, aren't I? Uh, it's just a Michael Douglas kind of Sunday. Invest in Link Coin. Hands you a rupee. Uh, yeah, let's buy this. I'm buying it. I'm buying it. Ants. <laughs> Ants. Damn it. Give me the boomerang. Or, or should I buy a thing that'll come in handy for a future dungeon, like a nice... Is there a boomerang lock dungeon? Actually, I think there is. There must be. Ants. Or should I rather? Should I rather? Should I? 
Would it be better to invest in Ice Rod? That's 12 hundo, so okay, I can't. Yeah, we'll get that next time. Give me a boomerang. Boy, in it. Boil. Got the boomerang. Thanks for being such a great customer. Thank you for being a squatter in my house. Um, let me think here. Probably don't need the, that as much. There you go. I like to keep the keep the the, the quick equip to a minimum. Because if you get too much, it takes too long to loop around, so. There you go. I could probably move the lantern too, but. Actually, yeah. I don't think I'll be in, in a situation where I'm like, I need the lantern right now! That's fine. Alright. Ants! Uh okay, bye. So the 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 the, the swamp is to the south? Is it my my time? How many my my's do I have a have? We have 28. So we don't have enough. We need 30 for next guy. It's not like Link is using his house much. I mean, that's basically Ravio's answer. He's like, I thought it was empty. You're not using it. Okay. Directly south. Let's go south. Oh, there's definitely some I mice here, though. Uh, eh. Yeah, that's a thing. Uh, meh, meh. Where is this nippy in the cave there? To the left. Schwarth Weast. <laughs> Cartographer is in the chat in shambles right now. E, I didn't do it, or maybe I did. Whatever. I'm just sorry either way. I just do. Who are you? Did my wife send you to find me? I sealed up the opening nice and tight. There wasn't even a crack, so how'd you get in here? You're not here to bring me back to the village, are you? Then how about helping me out with something? I mean, if it isn't too much trouble. Sure. Really? So here's the thing. I run the item shop in Kakariko Village. Or uh, I did, until I wasted almost all my profits on something dumb. Well, it didn't seem dumb at first. Did you buy some apes? I bought an ape from the street merchant. God! All my apes gone, Link. You stupid, stupid man. They're all gone. What did you do? My, I bought an apple from the street merchant outside my shop. Like an, like an iPhone? It looks so tasty. I gave him almost every rupee I had, but you'd do the same thing too, right? Sure. What? You would? I'd probably, if someone was like, I have an apple and it costs all of your rupees, they'd be like, that must be a good apple. And the chat's like, no, 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 no. I'm like, hold on. He wouldn't charge me all of his rupees unless it was worth all of my rupees. Anyway, about that apple, I ate it right away, right? And it was the best apple ever. Worth every rupee for sure. Unfortunately, my wife didn't see things that way. She really let me have it. And wow, how my wife can yell when she thinks she's right. <laughs> I guess she was right. It was most of our savings after all. So, uh, and I'm not proud of this. But when I took a lunch break, I just sort of didn't come back. See, that's my sad story. Could happen to anyone, right? Only you. Of course. Anyone. Really, to anyone. That makes me feel a little better. You really know what you're doing, don't you? I've been thinking that I've got to hide myself away until I really sort it all out. Maybe in some secluded dungeon. But I know those places are dangerous without the right gear. Like a scoot fruit. Yes, I need one of those before I go. Please get me one. Whoa, I see you've got yourself a scoot fruit. Woo-woo. Could you let me have that? I really need a scoot fruit. All right. Thank you so much. Here, take this as thanks. I was gonna hand me a half-eaten apple. How did you have a hundred rupees left? If the, your whole story was about how you spent all your rupees on an apple. With this, there's nothing to be afraid of. There's not, is there? Or is there? Uh, first, I need to gather up the courage to even go into a dungeon. Breathe in, breathe out. He found it. The last of his savings. All better. Uh, uh, maybe I should just stick around here, or maybe I'll go to a dungeon after all. I don't know, but at least I have that scoot fruit of yours now. That'll be my backup plan. I'm gonna have to buy another scoot fruit. Not that I'd use it, but, you know. I, I, I feel content knowing that when I look at this Link, just knowing that he's got a scoot fruit makes me feel better. So he can scoot. 
Now tell his wife and get a second reward. <laughs> That'd be good. Unless you actually can. Kaboom! Do you even ask for money and he gave you a hundred for it? Yeah, that's true. He's not very good, is he? Oh! Wait, I used a fairy, didn't I? Sure did. Mm -hmm. I caught a fairy. They put it in a bottle. Um, so where is this Maya Maya that keeps a yelling around here? Is that one of the statues? Is it on the rock? He's chirping some. Oh, there he is. Hey. There he is. Squeak, 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 squeak. One more. And we can do a thing. Oh, there's a piece of... Hmm. It's got to be some sort of underground cavern. I wonder if... Yep. Nice of them to leave the entrance nearby. Did you completely really miss the running boots for your entire playthrough and have to pass on all those Maya Mai's on top of things? Not speaking from personal experience. Well, uh, uh, hopefully you didn't do what the other person did and not get the bombs until late in the game. Meaning you didn't start the Maya Mai quest at all, which spawns the Maya Mai's. They don't even appear until you talk to Mother Maya Mai. And you didn't even have the option to pick them up until the end of the game. Hello. Grab him! There he is. We got 30. So before we go to the next dungeon, we can upgrade a thing. We can upgrade our bow. We can upgrade our boomerang. We could upgrade um, the hook shot. Number of things we could upgrade. I explained Death Stranding 2 for me. Hi, Killy. Hello. Mm-hmm. 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 Upgrade the net. Mm-hmm. Yep. So you, you got you got a little you got a little glove mask on, covering his face. What? You got a little guy on my shoulder and he's jamming on a guitar. And there's George Miller. He's hanging out, little cat thing. What the hell is going on? It's good. Thank you. It's correct. Thank you for your services, Kelly. Upgrade a prime sub, yeah, into like a foot long. You can upgrade prime sub. I don't know if did someone do that. I don't think so. But I mean, you can't in general, yeah. If you have a prime, you can turn into a regular sub. Yeah. yeah. In that it is one that is recurring and paid instead of prime, which is free asterisk. Hey, I got the thing. I got the thing. Be nice if they let you leave, but okay. That's the trailer. The thing. Keys! Rope! Keys and rope! Out of my way. I'm coming through. Um, I got the guys that I need, right? Yeah, I got the guys that I need. Alright, let's go say hi to Mother Maya. My... Mother Maya he, Mother Maya who... My... Mother Maya... Ha. Mother Maya ha ha. Mm-hmm. You know, there's a green spot like rocks around you, should I slash and restore them? Yeah. Yeah, someone said I could do that, and I was like, what? And then I didn't. Thank you. I will, I will keep that in mind. All right, what, what, what are we upgrading? What do you recommend? Hookshot, boomerang, bow. Couple different things we could upgrade. Hookshot. Bow is very good. Give it to Mother Maya. Bow, boomerang, hookshot. E. Bow, bombs. We already upgraded bombs. Boomerang first. Bow and boomerang upgrade are good. Bow, good value. Well, hookshot we're going to use in the next dungeon. If that sways the vote at all. Because I think that's the next dungeon. We're doing the, 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 the swamp, the water temple thing. Someone says, bombs again. <laughs> just hand it to her. She's like, I can't make it any stronger. And just silently pushes them forward. We can do all three. We can't. 30 is my total, not not, not not how many I have to turn in. 
No upgrade. Just climb in her mouth. <laughs> Why do I ask chat? Um, uh, uh, oof. I don't call hooks being all that good. But if it is good, it would be good for this dungeon, right? Right? Bo? Where's the... G we'll do Bo next. We'll do Bo next. Nice. Hook shot's more powerful now. Try to see its stronger effects. It does look cooler. It does look pretty rad. She just yeets her babies into the pool. Okay, bye. Can you upgrade my bombs again? Okay, it's fast as fuck now, is it? Let's take a look at him. Uh, whoa! And it seems to go further, maybe. See, that was worth it. Because if we get all the Maya Mayas, we're going to upgrade everything eventually. Might as well do it for a dungeon where we'll be using it a lot, right? And more damage. Also, I should try using the boomerang. Whoa. That sure is a boomerang. Get him. Ah! Wait, time out. Yeah. Got him. All right, back to the swamp. There's gotta be, we gotta find a way back to low rule from the swamp. Now imagine how cool the upgrade boomerang would be. Yeah, I can imagine a lot of things. Like how good this game is. But I don't have to imagine it. I had a second PC, but the MOBO died. So now this PC has 96 gigs of RAM? And coping three chrome tabs. <laughs> Whoa. Welcome back to Low Rule Kingdom, dudes. Hey. Not far from here is a maze built to contain the power of fire. You must find a way to control the flames. Really? Because I already did the fire rod dungeon. I also sense a strong presence in this vicinity. No doubt. It's a sage. Oh, I'm in the wrong place. That's why. Yeah, I'm at Turtle Rock. Only I, only you can help. So say I, Hilda of Low Rule. I'm very much in the wrong place. Um, but that's cool, cause, um, I can go over here. Oh my God, he chomping! Oh. Get item. Fraggle rock theme. And turtle rock. And turtle rock. Hello, welcome, welcome. Hello. How much for a bee? Sir, what can I tell you? Have impeccable taste. This is our famous golden bee. It costs 9999 rupees. It will fight alongside you with triple strength when freed from a bottle. Oh. Huh. Why not snap it up now and save? Okay. I'm sorry, mister. Unless you have an empty bottle, I can't sell this to you. Oh, that's the problem? My bottles are full. Not that I'm missing 9,600-something rupees. How much for a regular bee? Well, I tell you, from Packable Taste, it's our famous bee. It costs 88 rupees. Well, because the eight kind of looks like a bumblebee. If it had wings and a stinger and antenna, you know, because it's like a head and like a thorax kind of situation. It's a sale. Why not snap it up now? No, I'm good. Eight. Wait, what did he say? Huh? What did you say to me? I do need Temos Yub. Yub. Buy something, will ya? But backwards. <laughs> he said Yub Nub. Zelda shopkeep really said Yub Nub. My God. A man of taste. <laughs> ah! Eh, eh, eh. Oh, sweet. Eh, 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 eh. Why is this a gap I can jump across? Well, if you say so. Yep. I told me top beat cheat knee, gnope, dark fling, or ah. 
Eat chop yub nub. You got it. You got it, Gam. I should probably not be exploring here, but you know. Yeah, let's worry about the turtles later. That's a whole separate thing. Let's go back to Hyrule. We'll do Turtle Rock later. I don't know if that'll be today or not, but I'm doing, I'm doing. thanks for the bits. Hello. Save him. Nice fine. Where does he need saving from? He climbed up onto a wall. It's warm. He's comfy. Okay. So if I was a portal that would take me to Laurel from over here, it would it would probably be like right about here. How are we doing in general? Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Missing a ton to the east, of course. Oh, and the base of the mountains. We're doing pretty good. We got all the Mayamais down here, at least. That's pretty neat. I can't go in there until I have big hands. So there's that. What? What? I'll take care of the turtles later with sword in hand. It's true. I don't think I want to go this way. Or don't I? Let me, um... Eh. Wait, no. Wait, was I... I don't think I was supposed to delete that. That's fine. We'll go back there, probably. Fine. There's, like, a Mai Mai over here somewhere. Like there, I think. Um... Eh. Okay, yeah, that's the wrong area. Go back. How are we doing, chat? Take care of yourself. Grab a snack, be comfy. There's a chest up there. I think this is a guy you gotta do a long loop around. To grab. Which I can grab. So let's grab. I'm neglecting my health and not drinking water. Love to hear it. That's what it's all about, baby. Nice slorpy. Was I supposed to drop down? Probably. It's probably really chill and cool. I think it's up here. Uh, nope. Wait, yep. There he is. I want calzone, but no money for calzone. Sad day. What if, uh, what if, uh, what if you make a calzone out of items found around your house? Leftover calzone. You simply need everything you need to make a calzone. It's that easy. You can do that! And then can sell the calzone to buy a calzone. Now you're thinking. Now you're using your noggin. Have I been here? Yeah. Surprisingly easy to make. Yeah, it's just kind of smoosh some stuff together. Make it hot. Hey, hey. What if I... Eh. Stole your shield. Ow. He's poking me a lot. Oh, she didn't say anything because this is part of the same map. D sir! This is all one big area that includes Hyrule Castle and Kakariko. So we didn't, I didn't have to try to be fancy about getting here. But we're good. We made it. Elbmerg! Thanks for the bits. Upgrade Fire Rod usually one shots them. Oh, my Mimushka for no particular. There we go. Uh, yeah, if you didn't have the Pegasus boots, that would be very annoying. It's like running around without being able to pick up big rocks, which is like, damn it, I just keep seeing stuff everywhere that I can't interact with yet. I need Big Bomb! I need Big Bomb! Oh, oh, I, oh, I mem- oh, I remember, though. Oh, I mem- I, mmm. Um... This is gonna go great. <laughs> this, is, this is no, it's gonna be good. We're gonna be fine. Big Bob. Oh, can I not take him this way? Oh, I gotta go the long way around. Oh no. Oh, this. Oh, this is so bad. We did Water Temple. Sure are. Um, take the long. Yeah. Well, we can do some Big Bomb. Break Bob. Break Bong. Bring. Hey. Can you? 
I'd like to not... I would like to not... Eh. There's a fairy fountain near the lake southern swamp thing in, in Hyrule. I don't know if it's here in Lodor. I heard a gentleman. Eh. Where are you squeaking from, laddie? Are you in the rock? I think he's in the rock. He's probably in the rock. I right, did that. Eh. Big bomb slamming you the big bomb? Yeah. You got anything for a fan. Let me out of here. Hi. Eh. Uh, Big Bomb is out. Oh my god, there's a ton of dudes here, though. I mean, we got some good items, so maybe it'll be fine. Between the Rock Mai Mai? That's the one. Okay. Ow. Hmm, 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 hmm. Is that on this floor? Oh, it is right there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Wire Mouse. I'm remembering this and I'm like, oh no. Oh no. It'll be fine though. We're gonna be just fine. We're gonna get it first try nice and easy. 200 rupees, easy. And don't give me any flag. Big Bomb Flower always grows back. I think I have to pay 200 per usage of it though. So we do only have a very small number of times because I have to use one just to blow that up, which kind of sucks. Big bomb. Let's go. Or can I just... Oh, no, he does follow me. Okay, good. You don't have to pay each time. Thank God. Uh, No, it's good. Bombs can't hurt you if you're a pain thing. Just ask Dorian Gray. That's what that's about. Oh. Throw rupees into the fountain? No, I need them. May good fortune find you, I guess. Hi, game. Thank you. Is that because of my very good Dorian Gray joke? Thank you. I thought it was good, too. Save your money, yeah. Jokes about Dorian Gray never get old. <laughs> uh, 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 all right. Okay. All right. All right. That's pretty good. I hear some squeaking. Ah! Mm. Boo! Hiss. Are you in here? Are you in here? Are you in there? Are you in this one? He's to the right somewhere. Where are, are you in the grass? Where the... Sir? They can't be in wall trees. That's good to know. Maybe he's in... It's probably underneath the rock that's right here. Probably the... He must be. Okay, good. Man, once I can pick up big rocks, we're gonna go on a... Removing pin spree. Okay. Let's have some fun. So, it, uh, the, the way that this works, uh, in case it didn't, it didn't immediately click, is that if anyone touches the bomb, or if I accidentally attack it, then uh, it explodes and we have to go all the way back. And we have quite a ways to go to get to the very bottom of this swamp. Because I can't take that path. That'd be too easy. No. Don't forget to get, uh, the closer bo- Fucking! What- What closer bomble spot? That's not your fault. That's my fault. For deciding to read chat while I'm carrying a bomb that I know I'm going to hit. Uh, the, the, the one under the chest. You're right. You're right. Might as well grab that. Mistake number one, reading chat. Mistake number two, reading this message about reading chat. You think that big bomb could blow up this rock, right? Also, good thing it 
respawns quickly. Imagine you have to wait like 10 seconds for it to go back. God forbid. I already fucked up. Why must I suffer further? Mistake number three. Ignoring chat when chat's right, which is all the time. Another ruby. Good. I might as well mark down that this guy is here too. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get fancy. Yellow means that I gotta use the other world or something. I'm not gonna remember that. Don't read this. You got it. Shit. Bye rule. Hello rule. Stream title. I could have. But I'm a coward. Don't don't perceive me. Going through. Just got a big bomb. Got a big big bomb. He's cranky. Don't disturb him. Yeah. Cramp. Just go around the perimeter. Like this. Get him. Careful. All right. Let's go, Dandori. That was effectively well, second try. I can't I can't in good conscience say that was first try when it wasn't. Yay! We did it. That wasn't so bad. A new weather vein's been added. All right, let's head into the swamp. Drop me into the swamp. Oh. Are you bad at Pikmin? Does that make you a Dandoofus? Correct. Dandori issue equals Dandoofus. It's a bit dim in here. Yeah, I'm not talking about me. For him. Oh. Well, that's nice. Eh. Then doofus is a good word. Can we go back to last year? It's when I was playing Pikmin. Wonder what we need here. I don't know. Something. There's just no way to know. I wish the A button was swim and the B button was dive. I don't know why, but that just feels better in my brain. Also, how do you get these guys? I guess because B is attack, so I don't know. Feels like an alternate option. There's these rupees here, but I don't see how you can get them. Drop on. Oh, that's that's sneaky. Dive equals merge with water. <laughs> that might help me remember, actually. Shit. Nope. Merge with water. B for batak. Mm -hmm. Whoa, little guys. They're like little snail seals. They're neat. Oh, I, I think this dungeon's coming back to me. There's different doors here. Yeah, all these, all the, all the water levels. Oh, and then, oh, on the pla- Okay, yep, yep, nope, now I'm remembering. I'm remembering. And then you gotta... Well, maybe not as much. Hey! Hey! Get him! No! I was merging with the water! That's a line from, um, Avatar 2, actually. Yeah, these little bomb guys. If you don't have bombs, they provide. Hmm. How do I get there? Oh, well. Hang out with the Zora in here? Yeah, it's their temple. They're all about it. Hmm. Mm hmm. Yep. Sliding block puzzle. Sliding block puzzle. Just, just get him. Yeah, hit the latent music. Eh. 
Eh. Ow. Eh. Why'd he drop a tail? Maybe his tentacles are tails. Leave me alone. Now I'm over here. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Whoa. Hmm. Oh, it's a bit goopy, isn't it? And there's that guy there. Hello. Wait, is that the thing? It was a thing. Don't judge them for their drops. I'm judging. I'm allowed to judge. I'm the protagonist. It, well, you can diagonally with it. Hmm. And, eh. Oh, I can't quite reach it. No! E come on, come on. Yeah! Oh, damn it! No! <laughs> Fine. That could have been really cool. Eh, eh. It was worth it for the guts. It was worth for the goods. Swing and a mish. You're fine. Uh, there's a lock thing above me. Which I don't see a way up onto. And then there's a door south and a door east. Neast. But it's a bit damp in here. Hey! There you go. He's gonna keep spawning? These guys are just gonna keep on spawning? Fine. Can I, that's not a door. No! I'm okay. has the same joke. I, a bit dampy in here. A bit dampy in here. A bit dampy in here. I wonder if it's wet in here. Or perhaps otherwise humid. The babies! Okay. Uh, yeah. I don't know if Thumper. I know. I kind of wish Dampy could follow you around the dungeon. Offer you like little, little puns in each room. Kind of like a Goombario kind of helper in a game where you can just kind of like ask them every room in the game and they have a little line of dialogue about it. We're good. The babies with the power. What power? The power of babies. Babies? Babies. That's too high up. Um. Her, her. Hey! Hey! Say that to my face! Ow. Okay. Say it less than my face. You- What the- <laughs> mm. I love video game. I love video game. Favorite video game. Go. This. All. Mm. Okay. Now I'm back here. Great. Let's go- You? Are my favorite. Thank you. Mm. At all. What's at all actually short for? I, I, I'm, I know it's Latin for this and others, such as... I just don't know any Latin. And the rest. It's like etc. you know? And Al. Love Al. He's a good guy. Eek, Al. Eek. Eekum. Eekum bokum. Nope. Et alia. Et alia. Etrian Odyssey. Gotcha. Good to know. Thank you. Is that not the right... Um... Eh. Okay. What, if, what about, um... What about like this? Didn't see this coming, did you? Easy. How was I supposed to solve that? I don't know. Did I solve it? Sure did. 
That works too. You can toss the shell. Ah, oh, that makes sense. <laughs> That's way easier. Uh, okay, so I can't get up there, so that's where I came in. All right, let's let's try. Let's see what's here. Hello. This game just kind of goes, hey, if it works. Oh, uh, rerouting water. Mm -hmm. One tenth the way to a golden bee. Oh, we do have nine 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 rupees. That's good. Um, can I merge here? Why, why stair- why stairway to nowhere? Why is- why four? Um... Hmm... Four, okay. This dungeon theme is very good. Uh, that's probably good, right? Because before I wouldn't have been able to. Whereas now I can. Oh. Oh, right, the way that water works. I'll, I was a fool to forget the way that water is. Boom. Yahoo! Yeah, water can, Water only jumps when it's scared. It's not cute when water jumps. They only do that when they're in, under distress. Some motherfucking Avatar 2, the way of water reference? Always, every day. You know that everything I say is just a quote from Avatar 2, The Way of Water. Right? Who's painting money on the walls? Uh, you know, me. Or maybe Gam. Was that you, Gam? Probably Gam. Yes, my brother, James Cameron. Huh? He's cranky about something. Oh, babies! I'm gonna have to spin attack to be efficient in murdering the babies. Or not. Good fight. Good fight. Apparently we're halfway through the dungeon. Oh, oh. Neat. That probably looked very cool in stereoscopic 3D. I'm watching it emerge from the ground. Every time I'm like, this would be a rad place for a hidden rupee or heart. There's nothing there. Seems like they don't really use it as often. Which does mean when there's something, it's like, whoa, there's a thing. But, like, that seems like a pretty good spot for a little guy. Yeah, well. Merge. This game is very neat in stereoscopic 3D. If you haven't, if you have the means and have not played this game, oh, leave me alone. Definitely recommend. Yeah, they infinitely respawn. Um, how do you open this chest? Because don't think. Come on. You can't just. Hook shot to it. Water thing later. Oh, once water up. Yeah, did. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We. We're gonna have to raise the water level. Yeah. Like with that. But later. In a better way. Even Barry, good luck at flat length. Thanks, Wokey. It's no minish cap, of course, but this seems pretty good. He was above me the whole time. Uh, can I... Oh, oh. Okay, the depth here is messing with me a bit. No spinach cap. For real, for real, no cap. I feel so old saying things like that. Uh, maybe we should do a little whoop. And then it eh. And then it eh. Am I okay?
Can I explore this room really well? There's a treasure here. There sure is one to the north. Oh. Don't want to miss this. Blue mail! This mail cuts damage by half. My shirt is now blue. The blue nick. The blue nick that was blomst. Blawless and blomid. New clothes. And guess what? When we merge, he now blue. Deet, 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 deet. <laughs> Maximum is blue things are sturdier. It's true. Well, you know, blue is a, a longer wavelength than um than green. So when it impacts you, the um it's shorter. Is it? Go on. <laughs> No, I thought, no, I thought blue is, isn't blue longer? Isn't it red, then green, then blue? Smurfs are famously tenacious. They really are. So green is longer. Wait, green's longer than blue? Red's the longest. I thought red was the shortest. I famously don't know what I'm talking about, so. Why do you have to press it twice? Blue's the color, not a measurement of length. <laughs> I'm talking about the wavelength of the color. Yeah. Red is longest? Oh. My bad. Now, what if water was all the way up? What does that do for me? Um, that only impacts the water in this room? Shit. Where's the lowest frequency, which inverse to the life wavelength? It's the longest wavelength and shortest frequency. So I was wrong. But if you were, if you had the if you, the question was different, I'd be right about it. So red's not very wiggly. It's true. Uh, what else am I doing? I I need more. Huh. Red's chill. Red's chilly. Like chilies. What am I missing? I have confused myself. It seems. What was else was in here? This big old silly room. Hmm. Red's more bass heavy. A lot of monster drops for these guys. Okay. Will I ever make a potion with these monster drops? I don't know. Probably not. But it's satisfying to watch the number go up. I, if I was smart, I'd be using these potions. But I'm not. I'd rather be stubborn and bad. Uh, did I go this way? Yay. No. No, I did not. Ow. Eh. Did I go through this? I did go through here. Isn't this just gonna draw me down? Now I'm over here. And I can't open that door, which is fine, because that's the room I was in. So what? What have I done? I can adjust the water levels. But that... That doesn't affect the water levels above it. Can I reach the... Thingo? Good. These stairs go down. Um... Was that fire there before? Um... I can't reach this guy because he's up too high. A type of blue dye is the safest in the body, so it's being developed to make cancer cells more visible on scans. Oh, that's neat. Uh... How... I... I... I am... Confused. I don't think there's more I can do on this floor yet until I'm able to adjust the water levels. And I can't adjust the water levels down here. But what else can I do here? If I moves to the bottom room, what happens in the water out here? It, when the water when the water of the come on. We just have to hold it. Don't press the twice. 
So drain the water out. There sure is a door to the bottom left, isn't there? I went to the bottom right and it was locked. But bottom left is not. All right, we're back. We're so back. That didn't feel intuitive to me, and I don't know why. Uh, it makes sense. I love the the Dark World snakes that have little skulls. Bemos. He doesn't know that I'm here. Surprise! Eh. They're invulnerable! Left is always correct. Yeah. No, 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 no. Go back. So many blue facts in the chat. Hey, chat, do any words rhyme with the word blue? I don't think, th I don't, I think it's like orange. Oh, the snake lever! Let's go! You, you, those are half rhymes, chat. I said a rhyme. Nope, rhymes with blue. That's true. Orange. Orange does rhyme with blue. Shoot. Blue. Yeah. Uh, okay. Past part two. That is the only word that rhymes with blue. We did it. Um, from here, simply out of there. It is really nice having the Extendo purple gauge here. Uh, more water. Hey, garbage. Welcome back. Thanks for six. Bluetooth is not named for the color of its wavelength. The fact it was inspired by the creator's conversation with Sven Madison, her latest Scandinavian history through the tales from Franz G. Bergenstein's The Long Ships, a historical novel about Vikings, and 10th century Danish king Harold Bluetooth. Well, yeah, and isn't the Bluetooth logo? The, the Viking sigil for him, or just it's some Norse sigil thing. Key! Poo! You can't say that. Gonna have to lifetime ban you, sorry about that. Oop. It's Norse runes for B and T. Oh, it's both of them. Didn't know they were big fans of K-pop, but that's pretty cool. The Vikings are really ahead of their time, eh? It's Norse rune for headphones. <laughs> It's the Norse rune for wireless communication. Uh, so now I can go back this, uh, this. Down one more. I see. No, no. Just get out of here. Fuck it. Viking was originally a verb? As in to, to go Viking? Let's go Viking. Na, 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 na. Let's go Viking. You're Viking around the ocean. Like raiding. Wait, is this where I want to go? Uh, this is where I was in. Viking these nuts. Oh, well. Wait, I didn't hit the button. I gotta hit the button. I missed the button. I gotta hit the button. Uh, um, uh, le Lefty Lucy? Yes. I love Lucy less water later. There you go. There you go. Shit. Darn. Okay, go, go back. Okay, hit that again. Righty, Heidi. But height applies to up and down. Hey, come. Lefty, lower, righty, raise. There you go. There you There it is. Eh. Activates my right or flight. It does show you on the ground if the water goes up or down. Does it? Oh, it does show an up or a down. I don't think I ever noticed that. I think I just saw it was the hookshot icon. Huh. Oh. Alliteration, my beloved. Yeah, but you didn't use alliteration when you said that, so how do I know how you really feel? Maybe you're just an alliteration poser. You don't actually like alliteration, do you? Huh. 
sorry to be so combative. Um, okay, yay. Now I can, yay, now, now this one. Yay. Got monster goods. Uh, um, and then let's go to the other side. Alliteration Maya Moore. There you go. Now, see, now that's an alliteration adorer right there. I just got back and he blew. He blew. Well, it's because he's been in the water for a long time. That just happens naturally. I got a small key. I put it in my pocket. Um, and then with the way that the water level is, I can, um, uh, uh, what is this? I can go to the bottom right. That's a room I haven't been to. That's probably open to me now, right? Definitely. Definitely open to me now. Shit. So I need a way to raise the water one more. But I cannot reach. But if I was here, I still couldn't reach. And I think that that's pretty neat. Hmm. I have a key. Yes. But am I not just throwing it away? I mean, surely there's enough keys. Like, what does this what does this do for me? Hmm. I didn't fuck it, did I? I guess there's that one there. Um. Did I? No, I have another one. I have two keys. Righty, raise. Good. Bungled. No, we're good. Everything's fine. You cannot hack a dungeon. It would be pretty rad if you could. Uh, one more. It's always the water temple. It's not too bad. I think the, the thing I think the thing that is weird about this is that water level is not a global stat in the dungeon. You can't raise the water here and then go up to the top floor, which makes sense. What if I just did like this? Oh, pretty tricksy. Um. Hey. Get him. Eh, eh. Hey, hey. Hey, get you. When you hit them, there's a lot of knockback. So if you pull them and then hit them, they just go right back into their shell or they're like partially covered up. So I'm trying to get distance on them. Uh, yay. Oh boy. Uh, uh. Uh, there's nothing else here. Wait, there's a room to the north. Hold on, go back. Shit. Son of a... God, this fucking game. Uh, <laughs> okay. I'm fine. That's above me. I can't reach it. Hi. Can you? Can I? Yeah, you're fine. Um. Uh, that was a torch to be. There probably was all kinds of wonders. If only. Uh, yeah, that's fine. It's cool. We'll go back. It's just gonna make me sad for a bit. Uh, I want the water down. So I can reach that guy at the bottom for some reason. Makes sense to me, at least. Hello. Me, it's me, Major Bungle. At your service. Hit the button, probably, before raising the water. That would help. How about the door I came in on? Is that open? Okay. Raise it back up. Huh? Hit the bungle before you do the... Hit the bungle sounds like a Fortnite dance. And not a good one. Like one they stole from a better source and then didn't pay. For the rights. Until they were sued about it. Uh, no, I gotta... No, you really... Yeah. Maybe bridge the water level on the way. That's all of them? Oh. Damn. Sounds like they really bungled it. Hit the bungle. Now I'm over here, which means I can do this. Finally. 
Hey! Oh! Nice! And now I can lower the water. Walter, you gotta lower the water level, Walter. I don't know what to do in the dungeon. You gotta lower the water level. And then you can access other parts of the dungeon. It's very blue in here. Walter. Okay, now I gotta go to the right and drop down. I need the monster part, whatever the hell it is. I needs it. Oh, I, I actually do want the water. Actually, no, I can just take the stairs. Where am I going? I think I do want... Because I want to get in there. Yeah, I need the water. We had a good thing, Link. Uh, raise it up. The room I missed is the fairy fountain. Oh. Well, it's going to be unsatisfying unless I put it on the map. There's so many games where I'm like, it's fine, chat. And chat's like, no! And then I'm like, hold on. When it's the last thing I'm missing, I think that's also part of it. I don't know. Is this worth it? Probably not. Hi. How are you? Eh. I appreciate the heads up. That And you're right, there's not even a chest icon there, which there would be. If it was. Um. Hooray! Ba -da -ba -ba. I can beam! Yeah, we got all our fairies. Tell my story. No, I don't. Oh. Okay. Well, let's bounce. Nope. I wonder if the boss of the hookshot dungeon is going to be a guy where I have to hookshot stuff off of him and then slash my sword a bunch. Oh, how I wonder what new and exciting thing they may do. I forgot to press the button. More like, buy rule! I can't say. I mean, maybe if Zelda was by, and she might be, we don't know. Uh, raise it up one more. Arch! What if water hurt you while you were merged with the wall? What, cause it like eroded your little crayon scribbles? That'd be fun. Hey! Quit it! Have you seen Midna? I have. And I've seen chat looking at Midna. Hey! Put me in! Ooh! Oh my god! What do I do? I figured out what I do! He kind of makes... It's like a combination of like a duck and the noise that the miners make in SteamWorld build. Hey, get back. He turned the fantoon! Oh. Is that how you're gonna play it? Whoa! Neat! This guy's neat! He leveled up! I'm ranking the Royal Jumble tier list. It's pretty good. It's not. It's not my. It's far from my least favorite. Water Temple. Which is like a six way tie. 
quest pretty good. Oh, the lady of the water is the water lady. Yeah, makes sense. Hi, it's pretty funny. It's not bad. Hello. More still in Breath of the Wild. It's a very good game. This game makes me happy. It This game feels like... This is a really apples and oranges comparison, but it kind of feels like, like Metroid Zero Mission to me. Or something. Where it just like the experience of going through it and just like getting all the stuff just feels real good. Just like really tightly designed. Just good. Put together. Just neat. Uh, once more, you have come to my rescue, dudes. Are you wearing a banana, ma'am? How I wish I could again reward you with a gift. Big fan of Hey Arnold, eh? Something that would calm the troubled waters of your journey. Just getting some boss baby vibes from it? Yeah. Little boss baby, little marriage story. I can offer you only my deepest gratitude and yet another task, I'm afraid. Here's your reward, another job to do. You must rescue every one of the seven sages. I... I know. I, what, I thought I, I I thought I was the most important sage, and I got no. You're one of the seven. I thought I was like on, a, on like a tier above them, and I was like the head sage, and I was like, the, remember like Raru in Ocarina? Okay, he's like the one who gives you the quest, and, and no, no, Oren, you're just one of the bunch. The banana bunch. Only together can we help you defeat this great evil. You're now ready to hear what happened. One hundred years ago. Spin. Hey, I'm still here. I just want to crack some rocks. I will be glad to be eternally in your debt, if only we'll all survive this flood of evil. Please now rescue every one of the seven sages, my young hero. I hope that this evil will be defeated, so I must return to my people. They must be frantic without their queen. Oh yeah, I haven't been. I should probably ask how they're doing. The Planet Call. <laughs> So, no. Dudes. Grog from Ocarina to... Oh, lovely Zelda, what is it like to be a princess from a kingdom blessed by so many happy endings? What are you, what are you doing with that painting, Elda? I needs that. Once upon a time, Low Rule was such a place. Once, but no longer. Low Rule was just like Hyrule, but low. So very beautiful, so very promising. We have need of a hero, and your dudes is superb. Superb dudes. We all deserve a happy ending, don't we? I can only hope that dudes is victorious. Hmm. It's probably fine. Yay! Two dungeons down. Like, like zero left to go. We're done with the game. That's why they showed us that cutscene with Hilda. You've been playing for a while. I know! Leave me alone! No, no, I didn't mean. Yay, um, I'm blue now. Uh, eh, ba Look at all the stuff we have. Oh, that's the steam that's going on there. We're still missing a uh, one MacGuffin down here. One little collectible guy. Yeah. Yeah, we can see how the Zoras are doing. That might be fun. Get a life, nerd. What are you, a gamer? Ew. Uh... You, uh... Um... Okay. What next? Where next? Mayhaps we do a dungeon that will... bring us closer to upgrading our sword. Because we need a, a couple of guys. That must be what the empty slot is for. It's for the thing that we need. Does Steve's Town give you one of those? Yeah, butter sword. We also have... Almost enough money for another guy. Dark Palace or Thief's Town? We could do Thief's Town. We're nearby. What item do I need to be a thief? I mean, I know I need the, the password. Which I probably remember. They told it to me. Thief's Town, Dark Palace, Skullwoods. Have one of the sword items. Nice. Thank you. And the sanctuary. Oh, we haven't been to the sanctuary here. Not that there's a sanctuary here, but that spot. Do you have all you need? Sweet. 
We could also do Octo Baseball. Later. Do it later. Who said banana bread? Don't require them. That's nice. Especially because, yeah, it's like one of the closest ones. I remember Thieves Down being kind of neat. And I hope it still feels kind of neat. Uh, hi. Hello. How you doing? Who's there? Um, a smart thief fears the boss's wrath. I'd rather be on a cliff walking a narrow path. Sometimes it hurts too much to carry the knowledge power, but it's really despair. Every time I say I'm leaving, this cursed life sets me right back to thieving. Wow, what a fetching voice. Come on in, buddy. You could probably just guess that and not go around town. They kind of, they could have made it harder, but... Hello. Never seen you around here before. Name's Spear Boy. You're one of the new recruits, eh? Perfect timing. You can take over here on guard duty for me. Have fun. Don't do nothing that'll get me in trouble. Fresh meat. I'm gonna go get me some fresh air. Fresh meat, fresh air. <laughs> That's kind of catchy. Maybe I'll see if the bard can put a tune to that. Fresh meat, fresh air. Fresh meat, fresh air. I'm out of control. Who's that? Hey, look. It's like the way I was talking about. That the dungeon can do. You're like, oh, man. I know the boss door is like right next to the, the way in, so... I have context for what I'm doing. Hmm. We got person in prison. Big chest. Some kind of contraption. It doesn't work. If my name was Spearboy, I would will the scimitar. Just to spite them. Supposed to be on guard duty. Yeah, this is what being on guard duty looks like. Wandering around and breaking stuff. Oh. Um, I don't know if you if if I've mentioned it, but um the uh Oh the soundtrack in this game is um how do I put it? Good. It's good. It's nice. A porpy and some skulls. Hello. Maybe these guys are friends. Oh yeah, look at that lean they're doing. Well, let me. Yeah. Come on. Show. There you go. Yeah. They're leaning. What's up? Hmm. Is there more that I'm supposed to do in there that I'm being oblivious to? Or am I just simply fucking off? Works for me. Or is it? Damn it! Okay, there's something in the room I'm missing. Surely. There is a thing. Eh. I think there's a puzzle in there. Yeah, it did kind of seem like it then. Let's check it out. Oh man, I've never been in this room before. What are we doing here? Maybe step one, you gotta do that, and then step. Oh, that lowers the. Th oh. It sure does, doesn't it? Water, we do it. We're done with the water dungeon. This one's all about thieving and statue pushing. Also, this is fun. You're like, how do I get out? You gotta emerge. Uh, and then that guy's probably got to weigh down the other one. Seems a likely scenario. Hey. You solved the puzzle. I have not, but I will. I fear. Yeah, also you can see here that the walls aren't parallel. Like the wall right here. Like this one seems to go straight up and this one's more of a lean. I think, or maybe it's just the... Uh, no, they're both kind of angled that way. It's so weird. Yeah. But now this looks like it's straight up. What is... What is how are they... What is this... It's gonna be while they work, but it, it looks like it's 
leaning the other way a little? I don't know. Yeah, Isometric. Isometric exercise. The concrete texture. Oh, yeah. They got some good mileage out of normal maps in this game. They didn't go ham with it. But where they did, it's pretty good. Um, do I got to uh, hit this one? They can leave if they want to. Oh, they absolutely can. Okay, stays open. Good. All three options are leaning away. It's not actually bird's eye view. Right. No, I get that. What I don't understand is that from above, it's looking like they are parallel with the ground, but then when I go to the side, it's like this looks parallel, but the one to the right looks like it's going off at a weird angle. And then I go to this one, and now this one looks like it's straight. That's why I'm like, it works based on like, it, that's why I'm trying to figure out if it actually is, are they pivoting the actual geometry based off of where it is? Is that what is giving it that really deep parallax effect? Is that they're actually moving stuff? They scienced it out. I mean, they must have. Is it corrected by stereoscopic 3D? I mean, it just is the same. It looks the same. It just has more depth to it. I wonder if it actually is moving. Or if it is just the camera trick. I don't know. I mean, I know that like things like this are leaning back. That's how you're able to see the entire front of him. When you're looking down on him. But yeah, I don't know. Uh, anyway. Uh... Whoa! Get back. Stay back! Back, fiend! He's a beefy boy. Oh, he's dead. It's purely a camera effect. Where? Oh my god, the rats have leveled up. They're piss rats now. Uh. So there is a guy here. I got the bobby. Or her. Uh. Yeah. Oh. Do I want to take the stairs? Or do I want to keep going this way? Yeah. Eh. That's just a Kremlin. Yeah, it kind of looked like it. Taking the stairs is healthier. Yeah, I'll just try to. <laughs> yeah. Kremlin scream dot wav. All I got got. They they got me. They, you know the thieves got me. There's a heart on that one. It was just a prank. Hi. Hey, I'm over here. Who are you supposed to be? And how'd you get in here? Hang on a second. You wouldn't happen to be looking for some kind of painting, would you? I knew it. That thing must be pretty valuable if the boss went all that trouble just to hide it. And now folks are searching for it. Well, I may have accidentally learned where the boss hid it. Maybe. That's why the creep locked me in here. Can you believe that? Say, we could help each other out here. If you could get me out of here, then maybe I could help you find what you're looking for. Maybe. So get going. I don't want to spend any more time than I have to down here. No maybes about that one. Maybe. Why do you have a switch in your cell that opens a different door? Madam. Yeah. How come she gets pink hair, right? Oh, 3DS can't render pink hair. That's what everyone in chat kept saying. I was like, why doesn't pink Link have pink hair? They're like, 3DS can't render pink. Boom. She's got pink hair. Riddle me this, chat. Riddle me piss. Gerudo me this. She pretty. It's true, but that's not the question. Um, huh? What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Bull. 
Uh-huh. Now I'm over here. Hello? Are you turning into a painting? Maybe? That's pretty cool. No, it isn't. Okay, yeah, it's kind of cool. Ah, I do gotta go. Ah, I. Oh, man. We gotta loop. Maybe tote them. No? This is, am I mistaken? Or aren't I? Or am not I? Looks like I got it. Uh oh. Well, that's terrifying. Um, plug in my DS. I took the long way. I did it. Wait. Wait. Shit. Wait. He could have walked, but that works too. I thought that I couldn't go through because that was a little tunnel there. It seemed like there was collision in there. Maybe there was an in a way through. Um, uh, but, yeah. Eh! Eh! Whew! That was a close call. Whoa! Eh! Can I just attack them? But I had to use the arrow. Oh. Well, that makes it way less scary. Eh, eh, eh. There you go. That's better. Ah! No. Fight me! Not like that! Fight me, you coward! Fight me! Ah! Yatta! You can just sword them. So they say. Not nearly as annoying as Link to the Past, but they hit way harder. Mm -hmm. In Link to the Past, can you hit them with a sword? I, I thought you had to hit them with... ...thing in place. Yeah, I don't think you... I have to... Well... Oh, you're right. You can't... You can't just... ...walk instead... I don't... Yeah. I see how I was... Okay, so I was right about that. Hey, I let you out. How you doing? Oh, thank you very much. You saved my life. Please take me outside. That painting you're looking for is hidden on the outskirts of town. I'll take you to it. By the way, where'd you learn how to slide in and out of the walls like that? That's a little bit creepy. Maybe you can teach me how to do it. Ha 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 ha. No. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Take me outside. Follow me. We're locked in. Check that northern door. See if we can get out that way. <laughs> eh, just <laughs> stop moving. Link, quickly, catch me outside. How about that? Let's go. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Stay back! No, no, no. Leave her alone. The game suddenly turned into eco. There's more where that came from. I'd help you fight, but they took all my gear and armor and, and you know, all my other stuff. Plus, I'd just be getting in the way. I'm so hungry, starving, actually. Some weak and feeble and so on, you know? What are you, chat? Link! Link, I'm hungry, I'm cold, Link! Link! Alright, follow me. Just turn into a painting. <laughs> okay, fine. Hi. Hello. Um, oh, rat. Powerful rat. Oh my god, look at him. Um, hey. Mwah. 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 Okay, I'm done.
That's how the lip marks got into the wall in the other house. Oh no. I need a granola bar. Hungary. Mm hmm. Now I'm over here. That's really cute that they put a rupee on the wall around the corner. Like, that's kind of neat. Hi. It sort of clues you into what the solution might be. So now, can you swim? You cannot. All right. It's fine. I got it. They don't call me the hero of being flat for nothing. You know, Ocarina is the hero of time, and Wind Waker is the hero of winds, and this one's the hero of Flat Fuck Friday. Everyone's got their talents. Hmm. <laughs> He's a hero? He's a hero to me. Like a hero sandwich. I thought he bought Bitcoin. No. No, that was the other guy. Who pissed off his wife. For buying apes. Okay, stay here. Um, what if I, uh, what if I, uh, 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 like that? Good thing I have bombs. Oh! Okay, just, uh, stay there. Hey, ow, what? That's with half health, man. Come on. Chill. Or half damage. Oh, hi. Get over here. The Euro of Time? Hmm. Could go for a Euro. Oh, boy, rupees! Looks like the thieves are getting thieved. And this one. And, uh, there is a thing. You wait here. I'll be... Bat hmm. One of these is gonna be a like like. Really? Huh. I got some master ore. The blacksmith can use it to improve the master sword. That's kind of a lie, though, because you need two. <laughs> that kind of implies that you're ready to go. I mean, I guess you bring it to him. He's like, I need two. And it's like, okay, but. They could tell you, like, when you get a piece of heart. They, they tell you, you know, you need four of these. So that could be nice. Sworded. It's a sordid affair. You can tell, like, last because the shadows are bigger than normal rupee? My word. I never noticed that. I'll just keep an eye out for that. Uh, there's a chest over there. Why don't you stand on this button? Hey, on the button. There you go. Yeah, you wait there. I'm gonna do this. Dude said, hey. Hey. No! No! Leave her alone! She's got cool pink hair. Leave her alone. Phew. I'll wrap it me! Nice. What? What happened, Blastburn? What happened? You just drop off. I was ran back around, panicky. Uh, yep. That seems way more stressful. It does kind of look like those are walls, don't they? Did I get lucky there? Well, now I'm wanting to see. Yeah, because these look like walls. You can just jump down the bot. I just dropped down. I didn't even think about it. But yeah, those are walls, and you can just... Huh. Well. It's nice that you have enough time if you... Take that. Um, hey. 
Hey. Hey, Link. Hey. 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 Uh. This is where you were. Lo okay. Good. Oh, hearts. That's a good sign. Uh oh. I'm just gonna leave you over here. Oops. Oh, that. That's one way to do it. Never mind. Uh, do they wait? Okay. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Come back. This is a good dungeon. This is a very good dungeon. It's a neat structure, but also there's stuff like that where they know you probably got got on the way in. Yes, there's a chance that if you hit it from the side, you won't fall in, but you get to... Uh... It's a neat escort quest. It's an escort quest that rarely feels bad. Yeah, bye. Like, when you're fighting a bunch of dudes and you're having to keep an eye on her, because I think if they grab her, they do grab her and put her back in her little jail cell. Why don't you wait here? Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. I'm fine. Uh, probably just want to go up. Probably just want to go up. Seems overly punishing. Well, you... You do got to start over. Right, but as you saw, the southern door is open, so you... I'm pretty sure you can just go south instead of having to go north from this floor. This this floor. Yeah. Instead of having to go in the middle there and loop all the way clockwise, I think you can just go south and then get back to where we are now. But regardless, they do. Um, I think you want to wait here. Conspicuously in front of the fan, probably. Yeah, that was a good idea. Whoa, I'm also over here now. Um, why don't you, why don't you go over here? Eh, wait, right, oh wait, over, is that good enough? Hey, go. Hello. It's nice that they automatically have her follow when you do that. It, it's, it's part of what makes it less tedious as an escort quest is that she automatically stops following if you merge or go somewhere she can't go. And then they have her automatically follow for like things like that. It's just like tiny things that you would obviously want her to not follow you off a ledge or something. Wait there. Ho ho. Glad that from soft taught everyone else how to make shortcuts through the world as you progress. Mm -hmm. Uh. Stealing from the thieveses. There's also a thing to the right from here. Hey. Oh no. Oh no. Wait here. Okay, yeah, they're stupid. Great. Good. Ow. Steal from the rich, give it to the me. Give it to my me I made of the Monopoly Man. We're cut off! That big door is our only way out of here! Hope you got a key for that, kid! Uh, what if I didn't? Guess we have to go down here, eh? Uh, yeah. Hup. Hmm. It got hit by the arrow. And then I immediately got hit by the arrow. Listen, don't judge me. Sure, I've been thinking map design for a long time, but yeah, it's real good. I believe, um, from Soft, we're the first. Meeny, 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 meeny. Silently judges. Yeah, well, you can. We have emotes for that. For judging. Like Judgment Day. Uh, all right. I just gotta defeat the boss, and then the two of us. Uh oh. Yeah, what gives? <laughs> hey, Happy Capster, thanks for the raid. Hope you had a good stream. Welcome, everyone. We're playing Link Between Worlds. 
We are in low rule, running around doing dungeons. We are about to fight the boss of the Thieves' Den. Hello. Dark Souls is the first video game. Everything before that was just mass hysteria and Pac-Man, which caused the mass hysteria. What do you think Pac-Man fever was? Silly girl, do you actually think I'd let you escape with your little hero? We just had an escort quest where we brought a little girl out of the dungeon. A little girl? I don't know who she is. She's a thief, so I think she's older. Little girls can't be thieves. Oh! Oh my god! Eh. This guy's neat! That's just the malnutrition. No. How the boss uses a wall mechanic. I love how throughout the dungeon they give you these weird things to merge with. And then this boss, you're like, huh? <laughs> he doesn't know. He doesn't know that I'm over here now. He doesn't. He doesn't. He doesn't know. He, I'm over. I'm over here. I'm over here. He 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 he. Ah! I fell out. Oh! Oh no! Oh ball! Ball! Yeah. Oh. It's really cool. You know what's neat about this too is he doesn't even attack you until you figure out his mechanic. Because it's such a weird idea for a boss that you hop into his shield to slash his butt. Whoa, that's gross, sir. No, thank you. And now he can attack. Yeah, well, I'm shielding with my little tiny little shield. Oh, am I supposed to... There you go. It's so good! I... This is one of my favorite bosses in, like, a video game. Full stop. It's such a fun little idea. Oh, double of them. And it just feels so s stupid every time. He keeps falling for it. Like, it's so satisfying. This is what Oh, no! Now I can't! Oh, no! Now it's just the normal fight. Oh, he's spinning. Hey, come on. That was a neat trick. Okay, that's alarming. Slash his butt! Quit it. His heart was stored in his butt. Give me after my third tequila sunrise. Yeah, that'll do it. We did it! Wow, looks like you got him. Good riddance. Let's go. That door will lead us out of this place. It's also a fun inversion on what they do with the Thieves Den and Link to the Past. But they're like, oh my god, thank you so much. He he hoo 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 hoo. Let go. This person was actually just telling the truth. You're looking for that painting, yeah. That one the the kind of younger elder looking fella. Younger elder looking? Yes. I'll show you where it's hidden. Come on, follow me. It was right here. Oh. I didn't have to do the whole dungeon. Okay. He feared you were using his shield. What if he threw it in the pit while you were on it? See, that would be smart. This is the one, right? Don't see what the big deal is. What's so special about this painting? Uh, actually, now that I look at it, it's kind of interesting. I like the whole flat kind of look going on there. It almost looks like he just walked right into the painting and got trapped there, you know? But he was really flat and ugly. Listen to me. Getting all wrapped up in a painting. Anyway, thanks for getting me out of that dungeon. See ya. Bye, thief girl. The hidden Mickey. Where? Who? When did? Help. Bra 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 bra. It'd be really good if this door wasn't locked and you could just skip the whole dungeon and just hop in here. Hi. In the painting. Oh. We did. Fala, Osvala. He's one of the seven sages. Where am I? You, the blacksmith's apprentice. 
What are you doing? Why are you blue now? And with the master sword, no less. And that can only mean that you have rescued me? But I always thought that I was the hero of our day, that I was the one who'd be there for Princess Zelda. It seems that I am only a sage and not the hero. How very odd. Yet now I know my place in all this. So I pledge my support to your quest, little hero. Thank you for saving me, dudes. Now please, find the rest of the seven sages before it's too late. And I, I suppose if you're the hero, then you have more need of this sand rod than I. I wish I could give it to you as a gift, but truth be told, it's not mine. It belongs to a merchant named Ravio. I rented it, and the deal was that if I fell in battle, well, never mind. I need to get it back to him, but I seem to be stuck he Where are we? So, return this for me, would you? You got the sand rod, but you'll have to return it to Ravio. At least then you can find it at his shop. This fucking game? Who could have guessed that this would be my fate, to stand here while you save the world? Still, I have my place, you have yours, you must rescue the Seven Sages, dudes! So, they don't... You know, I always kind of felt like the sages, when you free them, and they're like, Oh, we're hanging on the sacred realm. They're like gaining... They're like gathering power, you know? They're doing some, like, shit with the deities. But he's like, nope, we're just gonna kind of stand here. Good luck doing all the hard work. Thanks. I love that they do a little cheer when you leave. And the more sages you have, the more of a cheer. Oh, hi. Yeah. Oh, okay. I believe that is the effect that happens when you fall with a rented item. Again, I, I don't know if I've ever died in this game. Game over. I have I have used fairies, but I think I think the little little fairy guy flies over to you. Um let's let's mm, let's do it. Let's do it. The sooner the better. It's not even my least favorite mini game. There's there's one in particular that I'm dreading other than this one in addition to this one He's a guy GPS in those little hats. That's what the little rabbit has for him. Let's do some baseball I mean, you know, it is Super Bowl Sunday chat So it seems only fitting that we should play the great American pastime of baseball with octopi can I finally send you Octoball Derby strats? Please do. Move the circle pad up and down to change your batting stance. Your dist distance depends on your stance. Thanks. I can say all kinds of words in any kind of order. Think you can handle the heat I bring? Then step on up to my kitchen plate. Still working on that one. He does have a hat. Hey, bada bada bada. Welcome to the Octoball Derby. One part of Zelda games is dislike the mini games. Some Zelda games have some mini games that are okay. But they're, they, they usually are either boring or bullshit. And sometimes both. Um, do the thing. Long message incoming. I'm prepared. Emotionally. 50 rupees per game. How about, okay, you want to give it a swing? That one has the accursed crank game. You mean trendy game? Hey, streamer, streamer, streamer. Swing and a miss. Streamer, streamer, man. There's Oracle Ages whose minigames suck. Yeah. Well, if you first tried, I highly doubt it. If playing Sploosh Kaboom isn't top tier, um, I mean, they literally just put Battleship in there. Thank you for that, bits. Gonna put Poob on it. Do you wanna? Someone can redeem a prediction. How many tries will take? Jesus. Just need to get 100 points. Easy. We'll get it first try. I'm waiting for that wall of text. Sploosh Kaboom is unique because it's top tier entirely because Sploosh Kaboom guy. Sploosh Kaboom guy carries that game. The game itself is it's a battleship. You're just kind of stabbing at a board and going, did I hit? Uh, it's not great. Trending game is peak gaming. Ugh, God. I'm trying to think what other mini games from Zelda's are okay. This game has a bunch that I just... <laughs> what if it never comes? I mean, regardless, maybe I should just try it without any external strats and just see... There we go. Oh, there it is. Let me just copy paste this so I have it. Um, are there any mods around? At the mo. Because we do have a prediction request. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's more. Let me just, okay, hold on. Let me grab that too. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, oh. Keep up. Let me grab that. Thank you. You got it, Viz. Thank you, Viz. 
Okay, I'm not gonna read your wallet text until after I've failed it. Um, but I'll wait till we get that, that, uh, not the poll, the prediction. Hit gold pot when you can. Yeah, 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 yeah. Will I first try it? Oh, it's just a single, okay. Will I first try it, yes or no? Someone else did it? I don't think so. I think it's on you, Viz, if you want to knock it out. It says games in chat, but he might be AFK. That's all, thank you. Thank you! Subworld dancing for one of the Oracle games? Mm-hmm. There's also some mini games in like Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. They're just kind of like, yeah, okay. All right. A stream relevant doodle. All right, there's your prediction. Do it quick. Well, I'm going to first try it. Yeah or nah? Oh, yeah. Bar levers and shambles, right? Now. <laughs> hey, listen, the bar levers are going to get a solid payout if I get it first try. It's it, it. What I remember of the minigame is that A, it sucks because, uh, for one, it's... I'm going to be playing this without the stereoscopic 3D, so it's going to be that much harder to time the ball. The, you're the, the, the camera's behind Link, and when you time it, determines, you know, where it goes in in, the, in an x-axis. But there's also tiers to it, and you can tilt the stick forward and back to angle it. So it's also the timing as well as the height. And, uh, yeah, I remember it being rough. Oh my goodness gracious. This is... A round lizard link lad. This is, this is, this is incredible work, Pickles. Thank you, Pickles. It's one of the few things I've never done in this game. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna get a first try. Barry Principal, let's go. The hero of Flat Fuck Friday that we all deserve. <laughs> let's go. 50 rupees. Atta boy, bada boy, you're on deck. Here we go. 30 pitches coming at you. Just gotta earn 100 points. I want that golden pot. There we go. Ah. Yes. There's one way the fuck to the left. Fuck. Shit. Come on. God. Fuck you! Fuck you! Yes? Ah. <laughs> 48 points! Ugh. Okay, let's see, you got 48 rupees. You wanna play again? Well, that's the end of that prediction. Easy monies, yep. All right, we'll go again. How much would have been first try? I don't know. Quite a bit. Okay. No more predictions. I'm just gonna sit here for the next hour and grind this out. No! I'm sorry. Fuck. Damn it. Son of a... Come on! I swear to... I swear to fuck God, you... I'm going to snap the DS in half. This is my trendy game. This is one of the things I was like, oh man, I'm looking forward to playing Link Between Worlds again. And then this flashed through my brain. 
Like the Akira meme? God damn it! I earned one rupee! I'm gonna close a 2DS. <laughs> Uh, 51 rupees. Uh, record, congrats. You have to get- oh, okay, okay, I'm gonna look at the wall of text that was sent to me. Controls are hitting early sends the ball to the right, late to the left, tilting stick forward sends the ball on the ground towards the front pots, hit tilting back sends towards the ones at the back. Yes. Hitting right on time, or while not touching the stick, is obviously the middle for the respective controls. Might want to check for yourself, make sure. Regular pots are one point, golden are five, birds are twenty. Uh, birds appear for every three pots that you hit in a row and always fly across the screen at no stick tilt level. Ideal strat is to aim for any three pots, ideally golds for the added wiggle room, with how tight the timing can be if they spawn a bad place, like on the very edge of the screen. Better to go for plain pots, then hit the bird. The bird always flies from the same direction at the same speed. Okay, that is good to know. I knew everything except for the fact that the bird spawns when you hit three consecutive pots. I thought it was just like random. Okay, so that is the strat then, is hit any three pots, then hit the bird, and go for golds when you can. And then hitting the crabs resets the pots. Um, off to a good start. Ow. Oh, got him! Let's go. Shit. Fuck it. Not worth it. Fuck. That would have been it. That would have been it. No. <laughs> RIP the dream. Oh, that would have been it. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, we got it. We got it. I'm feeling way more confident, though. Just just knowing how to spawn the bird is huge. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. You were close. Thanks, Oak. I wish I could express to y'all how narrow this timing is through video. I would hope it comes across that I'm like, no, I see where the timing is for that. I'm trying to hit it one to the left of that. And it's such a narrow fucking window. There he is. Damn it. Damn it. What? Foul ball! Nice. Fuck! Why can I not? Squandered it. Fucking beefed it. That's why we don't go for the edge. You're right. No, you're right. I didn't realize you could actually hit it out of bounds or foul ball. I don't think out of bounds really is a term in baseball. Bungled it up. At least I turned a profit. All right, all right, all right, yeah, yeah, okay, all right. I know it's me again after having some dude in Rand explain to me. You just need someone to tell you about the bird. Thank God hitting the bird is kind of generous timing. Shit. 
Come on. Fuck you. Fuck it. What? Why, why the fuck did it go out at that angle? Jesus Christ, this fucking game. Mm, I... Mmm. 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 Nice. Fucking nice! Oh! Okay. This is the one. This is the one. Yeah, nice. Hey, well done. Thanks. Yeah, I know. You're pretty good. No, I'm not. Come on. All right. I hate this mini game. It is for a piece of heart, though. Nice. Thanks for the bits. Fuck! Wait. Fuck! <laughs> just give me a reset button. Just, just, can I, I just, like, end, end it? And my suffering. Fuck. Sure. Damn it. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Just threading the fucking needle. <laughs> 1967. Uh, yep. Yep. All right. This is the one. This is the one. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> okay. Perfect. Two, two sweet pitches out. Four sweet pitches out of the way. For zero points. I cannot possibly express through the vehicle of words how much I'm in, in mad. How much I'm in mad right now. I am in maximum rage mode. Despite all my rage. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just. How about we get some amount of points? That'd be good, thanks. Fuck. 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 I'm just looking at where the ball is in relation to its, like, position on the ground and trying to judge accordingly where I have to hit it. And it's so fucking, the timing is so narrow for how precise they're asking you to be, to be like, no, that one, no, that frame. Oh. You got 125, nice. Okay, all right, here we go. Just, I just need to hit some at the beginning instead of, um, just immediately throwing away four or five balls. That'd yeah, be good. Okay, I guess we're never getting a golden pot. <laughs> we're just the, for the entire. Okay, I'm I'm free. I, I care not for golden pots. I'm only here for the birds. Okay, I'm. Yep. Sure. Absolutely. Perfect. Good. 
We're free. We're free. We're free. No more Octo Derby. No more. Hooey. Nice job. I'll grab you something special. A free pass to play Octo Derby whenever you want. I'm fresh out of prizes. Come back and play whatever you want. No, never again. Where's the save point? Let me out. Let me out. Where's the save point? I can't exhale until I save the game. Leave me alone. Leave me. No one talk to me. Everyone leave me be. And we're fine. And we're safe. Ah. <sighs> They put it through and up the other patch of the game. <laughs> Gotta get 125. What was it, like 15 minutes? Oh, it felt way longer. Okay, great. There's another mini game we could do to try to get that out of the way and then do another dungeon. Do we want, do we want to get out of the way the other one that I've been dreading having to revisit? Which one? Oh, it's over here. Oh, it's over this one. It's just a little, little walk over here. Um, I think it's over here. Yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Hi, hi, ma'am. They aren't too bad. I remember struggling with it. Welcome to the Kuko Ranch. Come to play with our cutesy little Kukos. Sure, you have. Want to play right away? Of course. I just knew you wanted to play. The Kukos will be pleased as punch. Now the rules are shrimp. You go into that enclosure up there and then try to dodge the Kukos that come flying at you for 30 seconds. Since you're still wet behind the ears, let's start you at egg level. Egg level's 20 rupees. Want to play? Yeah. Egg. All right. Try your best. Thank you. You ready? In that case, go. Good music time. Holy shit. This is egg level. Can the brown ones that are up higher not hit you? They're just there to distract you? Okay. It's a bullet hell. Nicely done. Here's your prize. 40 rupees. Yay. The Kukos say thank you for playing. Come again sometime. Put me back. Put me back. I'm ready for chick level. Chick level's 30 levels. L rupees want to play? Yes. Yes, I do. All right. Try your best. Thank you. Turn up the volume. We got to jam out. In that case, go. Big boy! Nice. Name of the bits. I made it four seconds. Let's go again! <clears throat> mm hmm. Ready. Oh no. Oh. Oh, oh, that was close. <laughs> Point six seconds. No. Yeah, put me back in. Put me back in. Put me back in. Put me back in. Throw me in with the chickens. Let them peck at my flesh. Yeah. Don't worry, chat. This isn't the hardest level. The redeeming factor is that the music is really good. Oh, ho! And there weren't any chickens for like last three seconds. You're no fledgling, that's for sure. The cuckoos are hop hopping happy 
Here's your prize, 60 rupees. The clapping had so much The clapping lets you know that you're close. Yep. The Kuko say thanks for playing. Coming in some time. Thanks. Pull me back in! Here we go. Rooster. Ma set the set the chicken mini game to maximum cock. Rooster level is much trickier. Wanna play 50 rupees? Yes. Cockle doodle, don't. In that case. 30 seconds. This is fine. This is immediately fine. This is very chill and relaxing for me again. Uh, whoa. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. First try. Good gosh! That sure was some serious dodging there. I guess even rooster level is too easy. Well, then I'll prepare a special challenge next time. I forget. 150 rupees. Right, that's not that... And since you made them so happy about playing with them, here's a special thank you gift. I was like, that that was for the... Okay, good. Good. I was like, that was for the root, the, pe the piece of heart, right? Thanks for playing. Come again sometime. All right. Well, now we can go endless. The one where you keep dodging and dodging to see how long you can keep going for? Got 10 rupees to spare? Yep. All right. Let's go for 9999 seconds, chat. Get comfy. Fuck you and all your birds. Ain't none of these cocks gonna touch me. Leave me alone. Oh, they are very fast. Yep, yep. This is a big chicken. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Mm hmm. This is just like Billy Hatcher. No! Oh! <laughs> no! Oh! Oh! Stop right there. Damn. 67.77 seconds. Lucky sevens. Kinda. That was a powerful display. Still! So you can go for a hundred seconds, I'll be keeping the prize. No, I'm good. I think it's just rupees. I don't think there's actually a reward for that. Not 69, do over. Absolutely not. We did it. I have to save. Has anyone made the 999? I, I mean, maybe someone. I've seen it done. What a mad, mad lad. That was a trophy or something? Maybe. I'm good. I'm just happy if I can have gotten... I got the... piece of heart and got away with my soul, so I'll take it. I wasn't watching the Superb Owl, but hi. Hi! If you were looking at a Superb Owl, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh... Where to? Where now? Uh, well, we should get another... thing. Another thingo. Another guy. Another such as. Can we save goalie? We can. Uh, let's grab... There's another ore at the sanctuary, someone said. How's that priest doing? Unhand me, priest. You good, man? Oh. After the second quake, strange cracks appeared. It must have some connection to what happened. I can do nothing, I'm afraid, but hope for peace to be restored to us. He looks like a finger puppet. The way he's just kind of warbling around like that. Okay, well, bye. I missed the chicken song. It's the minigame song in this game is definitely one of the best parts of it. Oh, this is, oh. Evil priest. Be like, ha have more sin. Ha ha ha. Uh, right, I don't have it on my quick equip. 
quick, 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 quick. The light! Ah, how long has it been since I knew such a comfort? Three years or an eternity? The world outside is long darkened with the menace of the mast. Oh, what is a little light against the rising dark? No one honors the gods anymore, so beware, child, the end is at hand. Okay, well, good to see you too. Nobody bothers even coming to this place anymore, but even I must wonder, have we abandoned the gods? What if they abandoned us? Well, maybe you should, um... I'm gonna steal your money. Oh, I can't! Hmm. Hmm. What if I... Yeah. Try to be sneaky and prevent me from stealing your money, but I, you know, I can find a way. Hey, thanks. All right, bye. Bum, 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 bum. Hey. Welcome back to Low Rule Kingdom, dudes. Where you stand now was once a holy place. Now it cannot be further away from. Well, there are a lot of holes. However, nearby sleeps something that will help you on your journey. A thorough search will behoove you. There was a thing in there? I mean, I thought I have to loop in from somewhere else. So say I, Hildo of Lodal. I hear someone chirping. Is he, is he in the... Oh. There was a bee in there. He's probably under the rock. He's gotta be under the rock. Yeah. Uh... B fight. He's doing it. Let him go. You can help out. Ow. More like behoove. So I know there's more stuff in here, but is there stuff I can get from here? Or do I need to go elsewhere? Foist. Um. Uh, or can can you cross this? No. So I think my assumption was right. Oh, how many years of the light? Oh. Need big rock glove where you can get the thing here. Wow. How do I get big rock glove? Anybody know, anybody happen or want to do a Google? If I could get big rock glove, oh baby. We'd be cooking the desert. Oh. But I do, I do have access. <gasps> Double Damp Dampy from the Dark World! There he is! So maybe we should do Desert Palace next. There he is! Dampy? Question mark? Can it be? You can see Dampy? Not a soul has spoken to Dampy for so long. Dampy's old bones are near to falling apart. It's been so long. Dampy used to be the gravekeeper here, but now there aren't any graves to keep. Was there something the graves were protecting? Dampy can't even remember. I'm gonna talk to you from this angle for no reason. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, baby. You're gonna join Dampy here on the other side. It's not so bad. Monsters never bother Dampy. Uh, you know Dampy's just pulling your leg. Stop pulling my leg. Ow what? Ow what? I'm pulling it. Hey, stop it. Stop it. Eh, eh. Everyone's too intimidated by his looks. I know. The curse of being just unimaginably sexy. Just like, I can't even approach you. How do I even talk to someone that I don't even think I'm worthy to look upon? Did Stampy's heartless? Hmm. Oh, I need I need to get that to get in there. Oh, oh hey, nice. Dampy's so good. The Lord version is just him. Mm-hmm. It's not like Dampy but angry or Dampy but he's like the opposite of a grave digger. He just like works in a maternity ward or something. I don't know. He's just like he's just the same guy, but he's purple. He made him purple. He builds bassinets. Mm. Uh, wait, well, hold on. What's in here first before I go dropping off? Don't tempt me with that. Thank you. God damn it, devs. They're like, oh, oh don't you want the buy my? It's right there. Just hop on. 
Go on. Go on, then. Do a flip. Meh. Yes. Good. Uh, okay, to the desert. Okay, first to... First to the guy. Oh, hey, bud. People are up and vanishing, damn we heard. Take care you don't get caught up in all this. No, I'm good. I am deeply tied to the events here, but don't worry about it. I'm good. Nobody's their bodies and less is their hearts, so spirits separate everyone's body with more heartless adjacent, I think. Don't Don't use your brain, use your heart. And by heart, I mean you're nobody. Hello. Oh Mr. Hero, one of my other customers finally returned his rental item. That's because he fell in battle and got turned to a painting. You fiend. Here it is. The sand rod. Ba -ba -da -ba. Wondering what it does? Well, you'd better snatch it up quickly then before someone else gets it first. I'm your technically second customer, but only one who's actually around now. God damn it. How much? Interested in the sand rod? Oh, look at him go. Look at him do it. Look at him doing it. He's building bales of hay. And I said, hey. It's 550 rupees, or if you want to buy it, it's 800. I'm buying it. You're going to buy it. Done deal, no returns. <laughs> Thanks for being such a great customer. Um, Should I buy the... Buy the... the ice rod. Yeah, buy it. So other than the ones I'm still renting and need to purchase, we got them all! The whole bundle. Thanks for being a great customer. Thanks to you for living in my house. Ah. Uh, let me, let me do a little, move these guys there. And I still just have all my key items. I should replenish my scoot fruit situation, but if I don't, we're still looking pretty good in terms of the items. I mean, I could also take like things like the, the tornado rod, which aren't as commonly used and move them over. But it's fine for now. Um, eh. I could just preemptively do what I just said makes sense to do, and then keep it to these. Yeah, that seems good. For quick equip. Okay. Does he pay us rent? No, we pay him. Correct. You should upgrade your same rod ASAP before it's useless again. <laughs> uh, how many MIMIs am I at? We need 40 for the next upgrade. Uh, and we are at 37. So that's, you know... Pretty good. Sand rod. Eh. Uh, yep. Yeah. Well, it's only still the next dungeon, so we better get three more guys. Well, I know where one guy is. I kept thinking I needed a shovel for the one in Kakariko, but it's not. It's, it's, we don't need a shovel. We needed the rod. Hey yo. Hey Neo dudes. Hey, welcome. Hope you had a good stream. We're playing Link Between Worlds. One of the best Zelda games. And we named our Link Dudes. So it seems like an appropriate raid. How you doing? Hope you had a good. Uh, we are... How many dungeons deep? Three of the... Seven-ish. Or whatever. Um, we're about to enter into the sand... Dungeon thing in a bit. We use the sand rod. It's amazing, but it's only used for when there's sand. Well, I mean, yeah. And there's not a lot of- the, the main point is that there's not that much sand in the game. Unlike here! Hey, bud. How do I- Eh. Yeah, there he is. And them dudes! Coincidence. There he is. Headed to the sun gym. Um... Bah, bah. So there's... We need two more Mayamais. I think as we just travel over to the desert area, we'll probably find two more. And then I can work back to Ravio. Should be fine. The squeak fanfare. It's the only thing about the Maya Mai's I like. Because I find their little squeaks pretty annoying. But when they go beep, 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 beep I'm like, yeah, all right, okay, you won me over. Nah, I suppose you're fine. Uh, so that's the thing. It's kind of my first time playing this game. I'm not as familiar with the 2D Zelda games. It was lovely. Nice. Yeah, this is this is a very good entry IMO. I think I think I think this experience is enhanced 
Leave me alone. If you've played the um, original Link to the Past. But it's not at all necessary. But it's good. It's very good. I suppose... Hey. Um, I think I can just loop over here. There he is. I got him. Get rid of that pin. Thank you. And then... Back we go, I guess? There's another by the Derby? There's one here, isn't there? God! I need the mitts. I need the mitts. What's this? We can go back to the Derby. Back to the Derby. Under the skulls. Okay, I can go back there. Now, how's all this gonna work? Maybe jump off the ledge. Oh, better be holding a cuckoo, too. Right, that part's important. Yep, then that treasure will be mine. I don't know why I gave him, like, Fort Color voice a little bit. Oh, God. Now, that's a psychor. He can use that, Raz, to something. I forget. Even that's in character form. Ooh. I wish I had the 3D. Mmm, now. Mmm, now. Mmm, now. Mmm, now. Okay, just thread the needle. No! The chicken's okay! <laughs> What's more important than my safety is that the chicken's alright. Um, how in the hell? Where in the heck? What if I just head down here and then wait till I'm beneath that one that knocked me and then head all the way over real quick? Like, ew? Oh, it's, oh, it's up, oh, it's up. Mm. The thing is, I don't need this Sloopy, but I can't in good conscience leave this castle, and by castle I mean cave, without knowing that I've gotten the reward here. Okay, I wasn't, okay. That chicken's also fine. They call my ass out and they did. Yeah, this this is really tricky without stereoscopic 3D. Maybe for, uh, down from the top, you know. Shit! No! Hmm. Hmm. They're fine. This is one Slurpee I almost just left there. This is tricky with the 3D. That's also the thing. Playing an actual hardware. Yeah, I have a captured DS that was sent in by a viewer. Shout out to the Jake Doodle. Because I've gotten a lot of mileage out of this puppy. Fuck you! God damn it. Can't. Okay, last chicken. Get over here. The captured wild DS. That did seem pretty good, but not good enough. What if I just kind of side to side it? And then, when the moment's right, get in there! How's this gonna work? It's not, is the answer. You lost your 3DS charge cable, there's a bunch of games I have to play. I'm sure you could get one pretty cheap off eBay. Or something of the like. Anybody know if there's actually a strat to this? The chickens aren't lonely. No, they're fine. No! Try force. Oh! Snap. Crunch in an F. Land on the thing. Simply win. Have depth perception. Alright. Easy. Easy love out. Fuck. Squeeze between the fans and the sloopy? Now I'm just trying to go for the porpy. I bribed the chickens so they wouldn't help me? What if I stay near the wall, and then that'll help me gauge where I am? Oh. Get the blue one to feel like I accomplished something? You're not wrong. I just kind of want to get that one last. Okay, so go down the wall, and then a little beneath it there. Nailed it. Perfect. 
as it was meant to be. And now. It's easy, really. Just do that. Ah! Damn it. Okay, I still have to get the Porpy. Which doesn't look too bad, but I think it's right beneath that fan right there, and I don't think I can just drop onto it. Let's see. Huh? <laughs> hey, Nintendo. Hey, hey, Nintendo. Hey, hey. Hey, Nintendo. May I have? Cool, so if you eat shit, then you get that, but if you actually land on it, they're like, mm -mm. No, try again. Yay! You're real B. I got it with my butt. Yep, you gotta grab it with your cheeks. Hey, I did it. Where'd the thief go? <laughs> he just fucked off. Sir? Are you not impressed? Or is he mad? I get, he just left. Okay, bye. Okay. Uh, back to the Octo Derby. Wow. <laughs> How do I get up there? From the there? Oh. Okay, first things first. Back to more- I know how much chat was like, Please, Mr. Streamer, can we do Octo Derby for another hour? And I was like, Yeah, you know, chat's been pretty good. I suppose. Is this not? Where is he? Did I already get him? I already got that one. Well, I suppose- Hey. Man, football's over, we got baseball. Okay, uh, and then, and then to, to, to this. And then, and then over to, and then, and then, yeah. We're in the money. Um, okay. Back to Hyrule. To the south, hop into a little portal thingy, and we're gonna run around the desert. Neow. Nee. Damn it. Neow. A whoopee. Is the space between worlds slide rule? I mean, it's just makes me think of a slide ruler. Hey, how you doing, man? How's the divorce coming? Oh, he's doing pretty good. Uh, maybe I should stick around here. Give me my scoot fruit back if you're not gonna use it! The nerve of some people. The nerve of these Hillians, man. Uh, hey. Have I been over here? Is that they just it just it just loops? Okay. Oh. Uh. Let's not hook onto him. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. You get him. You get him. Um. Stuff up here. Stuff down here. Hello. Oh. Huh. I will soothe your wounds. Uh, did you know that it's not pronounced wounds? It's pronounced wounds. Thanks, I feel better. I feel the same. One of these guys is squeaking. Yeah, 
somewhere in here is a guy. Okay. Um, I think I previously did the loop around. Where is this connect? I guess I could. Hey. Uh, 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 huh. Eh. Eh. Yahoo! This is... I did it. Um... How do I get to that bit? May I get to the other bit? How do you... How do you get... Are you just supposed to... You're just supposed to grapple him. Or boomerang. Yeah. Either way. I'm like, how do I... I want to get over there. Let's go. Yippee. We've made it. Hey. hey. Welcome back, dudes. You find yourself near a swamp that is a dread and rotting place. Exits are weast and sweast. Within it, I sense the very faint presence of a sage. And how odd, I sense also desert sand near this sage. But there is no desert in Laurel. Furthermore, I foresee that you must bring an item into a temple there that will give you control over sand. I say again that there is no desert in Low Rule. I do sense the start of your path is here, though. How baffling. So say I, you live, Low Rule. So say I. Yeah. Yes, yes, I'm a professional treasure hunter. I can't go anywhere without being recognized. Having a tough time here, though. If only I could manipulate sand and wind, then I... Well, let's just say I'd be able to secure myself a nice little piece of treasure here. Don't you worry about it, though, kid. Just leave it to the professionals. I'll figure this one out soon enough. Oh, man. If only I had an upgraded sand rod. Well, we'll make do. And then, uh, uh wind? Wind, you say? Power of wind? Okay. Um. This looks pretty good. Yeah. Um. This is chest. Um. Okay. Well. Oh uh ho. -huh. Sandra is neat. Hmm. Actually, it doesn't say that it's low precipitation. Hey, quiet, you! Is that not? Hmm. Eh. Samrod fun. How do, what? How do, hmm. What am I... What am I miss? Buns are neat. They sure are. Wait, it stays? It stays buttoned? Huh? What? Huh? What? Huh? Huh? Is that just a... Okay, now you've seen the layout of the room, now go back? Why do they make you do that? I'm just curious. Well... Back we go. Listen, Aonuma was cooking. He was like, I want them to walk around in a circle. And I'm not gonna take a no for an answer. Um, ah, but I could. Now I'm over here. I get it. And, uh, that, that's not on. But now it is. But now it is. And where... Hmm. But if I if I do the 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 I can't do the sand where there's no sand. So what am I to do? Other than do a little loop. Nope. Hmm. Her. Anything on this side? Her. Her. Um. Eh. And then. Hmm. Will that catch me? 
Can I get there fast enough? I'm always in my Minecraft villager arc. Run! Ooh! Made it. Hey, Goopy! Nice. Uh, cool. Yeah, I did it. If only I could control sand of what? Come on. <laughs> All right. Um, how many? We still need one more Maya Mai. Because I very much would like to upgrade the sand rod before it becomes useless, as you said. Chat. I'm happy as long as my feathered friends are with me. Well, that is before they got turned into monsters. In which case, I should have been changed along with them, I thought, so I put on a mask and chanted. A lot. I tried to admire the yellow-winged monsters that live nearby, but as soon as they land, they spit out these bomb-like things and I can't get anywhere near them. I think I might be able to get closer to one if I had a shield. Like this? All right, bye. Hmm, 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 So there was a guy over here-ish somewhere. Oh, and there's a my my perfect. <laughs> hmm. Kaker's going to know if there's some here too. Yep. I had a feeling. Yeah, no. I'm good. You shouldn't play games too long. They'll turn you into a gamer. Okay. Let's upgrade that thing. Let's upgrade that thing. Let's upgrade the thing and make it a slightly better version of that thing. Is there... Whoa! I forgot they brought back the silly little sand men. Hey. Just like Spider-Man. Um... Yeah, whatever. Uh, I was like, I, I could run around here and look for a, a weather vane, but... Probably better I could just... Do this! A gamer? Bull! No son of mine's gonna be a gamer! But, Dad, I wanna get the battle pass! Blocking? It's still like the funniest thing game has ever fucking said, and that's saying something. Blocking engenders passivity, Bobby. Uh, I hit the wrong button. No. Thank God. Um, sand rod. Yeah. Yeah. Make make me control more sand. Speaking of how they mentioned another kingdom where you being another kingdom century. Huh? What? Hmm? Nice. It's more powerful now. Sploosh. My babies are so shy. Good. I didn't pay $30 to block in this game. I did not. Not yet, at least. And back we go... Here. <laughs> now I can do more sand! It stuns them? Huh. Okay. Neat. Alright. You pay a black, pay lose. Turn it. Now the eShop is down, so it's free. Finally. Back to the Maya! I miss Irene. When I ring for Irene and she doesn't arrive, I get sad. Uh, okay. What we got? <laughs> sand. We got sand. Nope. So this is where I was. I came in. Yep. Look at that pig on that bridge. He's having a good time. Oh, you little stinker. Hey. The bridge pig. Uh, I think there's a thing up there. How would I do? 
If I were interested, or are they just saying, what are you doing here? Go to the light world. Yeah, I guess I can't there. Okay. Wait. Oh, uh, mm, mm, okay. Okay. Right. Okay. Okay. If you insist. Swamps tend to be pretty stinky. I'm getting the swamp water in the desert, and I'm getting sand in the mire. It's really a mess all around. No one wins here. So not that one. But I would like to up here. Over meow. Hey. So what does better sand rod give me? Is it just faster? Mm -hmm. Who's squeaking? Is he is he in the sand? The pillars don't despawn. Oh. That's that's actually very nice for this dungeon. Eh, eh. I hear some squeaking, but I don't see them. Those are very fun noises. It's probably in the sand somewhere, right? Longer range outside sand. Nice. Nothing major, but again, if you got it after the dungeon, where it gets 99% of its usage. Where the hell is he? Does he have a bottle? Doesn't sound like it. Sandrod the Sandman, you can do that? Where the... Where the... There he is! Sheesh! I will use the rod on the gentleman. You have my word. Don't sand rod Sandman, I don't need nightmares. Too bad. It's gonna happen. Uh, oh good. Neat. Uh, was there anything up here? Don't think so. Ah. Do Sandrod say, man, I need nightmares. I've been sleeping too soundly lately. Please. What can you do for me? Huh. Huh. Now that's retroactively canon for Link to the Past, right? Wow. I, I don't know if I did that when I played this game 10 years ago. Fascinating. There's another guy squeaking. Where is he? It must be further north. Okay. And back. Does he give you rupees when you hit him? Because he's running... Huh. Incredible. Um... I guess they're this way, eh? Proves Diglett's a buff guy. Oh, yeah. That's definitely canon. Oh, I can't reach! Unless I had some kind of a... Hook shot? Is that reachable there? Uh... Um, um but, 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 eh. Seems kind of far. Yeah, I don't know. Some kind of a shot put? Yeah, it's not reaching. Um. Hmm. This is just gonna spit me back out, and then I'll fall in the water and be like, oh no. Ah, it's just right here. What do you want, you stinking vultures? Buzz off, buzzer! Do you think he listened? Okay. And back we go. 
I, I, I do like when they do this, when they have you hopping back and forth between the two worlds. It's like a link between worlds. Um, definitely, there's something lacking compared to Link to the Past, where you basically choose where you are warping between these worlds. You have to, you, ha you yourself have to go, oh, okay, so this is, I want to stand here and then use the thing, so now I'm up on a higher platform. And here it's more just like, I need to get to that spot and I don't know why. I just see it and I know I want to get there. Um, which has a different kind of, it puts your puzzle brain in a different place, which is not a bad place, it's a different place. That said, if it was just the same as Link to the Past, it'd be like, well, I've already done this. So it is a kind of different wrinkle on a similar idea, which I like. I'm just saying in terms of, like, puzzle complexity or, or requirement to pay attention to your surroundings. This has a different vibe. It still requires you thinking about stuff, which is good. Because you also have to consider, okay, if I'm... If I need to get up that level, I need to find a wall that I can travel along to get there. There's some stuff with that that they do. It's pretty neat. Um, so I can't get there. They, they, like, this is what I'm talking about. Exactly right here. Like, the platform... The ground down here, I can't put sand on, but they clearly put some breadcrumbs there to be like, hey, you can get there. Oh, but actually, I can't. Never mind. It was even simpler than that. You just go over to this side. But I want to see what's over here first. If I can indeed get... Or I might have to loop around. Yeah, we'll just loop around. Liking ages more than seasons. They, I play them back to back pretty much, so they kind of blend together in my brains. Oh, you. Mm. Hello? You squeaking? Yeah, you squeaking. Right, age is a little more puzzly. Um. There are times where I want the. the sand pillars to fall apart. It kind of would be nice. Maybe there's a button. Or, like, hold it to destroy them. Weather vane. They see their mouths when they're upside down. Who and what? Who and they? Oh. Mm. Um. I guess we are ready to go in. Okay. The my mice. Oh. Mm. Let's do the desert palace. More good jams. Uh, sure. Oh, I can't... Rats! I heard the rat and my brain was like, my, my. But I'm in a dungeon. Don't fall for the ruse. Don't believe their lies. It's just a rat. Yahoo. Yeah, the sand rod is, is probably one of the least useful items outside of its very specific context. But man, the context is really good though. Like, yes, they only go, you can use this here and not wherever you want. It only works where there's sand. But just the fact that it's a simple enough idea. It just creates geometry, right? It creates a pillar wherever there's sand. But they use that both to rise stuff like my Mai's out of the sand, like effectively the shovel. But it's a platform. It's a bridge. Oh no! <laughs> you didn't know I was back there. Um, and also, it's a merge thing, depending on the height of where you're at and stuff. Like it, it, they, they get a lot of mileage out of the idea, considering it's like you hit a button and it makes a pillar that you can't move. And uh, I think it's good. And I think because a lot of the other items in this game are just quite strong in general. I don't necessarily mind. I try not to give this game a free pass just because I like it, but it's like, well, why do I like it? I was going to try to do a spin, but I guess I didn't need to. Uh, eh? Meh. Um. Lasers can't go through sand. Everyone knows that. Whoa! Whoa! Come Sims kind of necessary to limit it? Oh, for sure. If they didn't put a limitation on it, it would make... 
I mean, it, it's kind of like Tears of the Kingdom. Like, because the tools they give you are so broken, their approach to puzzles are way different. They're more of like, here's a problem, and here's sort of an intended solution. This is much more the strict kind of like, there is a solution. Um... And I like both. They're just... They, they use your brain in different ways. Yeah, I guess one of the 2023 highlights will be live. Um, Soon-ish. Next couple of days. Um, uh, Gam has everything he needs, but he is a bit under the weather at the mo. And it's way more important to me. And I'm sure you would agree. That he... Um, oh, this is really nice not having a time limit before that breaks. I mean, you could just be up here and do it, but... Um, they're rendering now. Whoa. But yeah, it's more important to me that Gam take his time and especially when he's especially when he's under the weather, but also when he's not under the weather. I'd rather it be a sustainable process than a hey, they gotta be done. I know that wasn't your point. But yeah, they'll be out soon, especially if they're rendering now. Then hopefully next two days or so. Because I need time to upload it on my end. I mean I suppose I could give Gam access to the VOD channel so he could upload them directly. I guess we could figure that out. Because he's... Uh, arguably, the VODs are being... The, the highlights are getting uploaded twice. Once when he sends it to me, and then again when I upload it. But... Hashtag render tree. I'm back! We did a loop! Um... What did I accomplish from... I hit a button. And now I gotta go over... Oh, but now I can... over here. Over the way that this... Did. I also really like the effect of the sand, the way that they have the, like, particles coming off them and stuff. When they pop up. Oh! A gentleman! Get him! Hey. Did I get him? Hey. Stand south of me. That's not south of me. Where are you? S I said south. South. Yeah. Oh, he's a stack of guys! Ow. <laughs> well done, Link. You've braved the trial. Um, let's say yes. Let's say I did do that. Let's say I was successful in vanquishing my foe. Ah, but, ah, beans. Yeah, nuts. Dr. Goomba Tower, is that you? I wonder if I get some way to pick up big rocks soon. Hmm. Ugh, I forgot about these guys. Gross. I am mildly upset by this. Hey. Okay. Hello, Mr. Gibdo. Me when someone else has the dough. And I want it. Gibdo. Good one. Thank you. Thank you so much. I live for the positive reinforcement from chat. It's everything. It's why I stream. It's so strangers can tell me, hey. Not the worst thing you've said. Technically, it's a low bar to clear, but you know. No, oh, that's the wrong button. Eh, eh. Camping on the Mario Underworld theme with that thing of Dr. Goomba Tower. Yeah. Dr. Goomba Tower. Dr. Goomba Tower. Um, hmm. Then you get up on the wall there. I think? Huh? What? When I, huh? I am a me. It's all, it's all I know. Um, hmm. How would that? What is the situation here? What it what? Oh, I think I think I think that's a sand chute, and that this is gonna fill up with sand. I think yeah. Hey, is the shadow different? Doesn't look different. Yay! I got a compass. Good. Good. Paging Dr. Boomba Tower. 
Whoa, before you hunt when you win. Can I get that as like a live, laugh, love thing, like installation in my home? Like an affirmation above the mirror as you're getting ready. We're like, yeah, I am going to hunt when I hunt when the fun. Um, hmm. There we go. Dr. Goomba Tower. Uh, so can I go back down into here? I may, but I still don't have a way to lift big rock. So let's continue. Paging Dr. Goomba Tower, we, we need a surgeon in the ER or in the OR soon to perform surgery on a pokey, but they can't lie down. So we need the tallest doctor in the whole hospital. Only you can do it, Dr. Goomba Tower. We need your help. And he just kind of starts wobbling in that direction. Oh, sand. I love sand. It's smooth and comfortable, and I love how omnipresent it is. Big chest in the corner, too. Great chest ahead. Uh, hmm. Doesn't compa mean friend? Compass. Means compass. Four Niners didn't win, so they still need to win 20 more Super Bowls before they can win football forever. They're getting there. I believe. Uh huh. Oh ho. All right. Don't. Don't blast with lasers. We've done Water Palace? Yeah. We have done the Water Palace, the Thieves' Den, and another one. Shit. Um, whichever ones these are associated with. We got Asfala, Oren, and Rosso. Ice. We did Ice Palace. Sand radiates smoothness. That's why sandpaper works. <laughs> exactly. It's so smooth. Um... Where's a wall I could grab onto over here? That's at a height that I want. Oh, may maybe if I... Perhaps if I were to. And then, furthermore, following that juncture, did this. Behind the sand. Hi. The Titans mitt. Now hoisting large boulders will be a snap. Let's go. Hey. Hey, quit it. Stop. Stop it. Uh, okay. Now we can go back. Thieves Den's so good. Thieves Den. Such a great dungeon. I just remember fighting that boss for the first time being like, oh my god. What a genius concept for... Is it that difficult? No. Is this the most difficult Zelda? No. Do I give a fuck? No. It doesn't overstay its welcome. It gives you a silly idea and then does a couple variations of it and goes, alright, he's dead. Just for a game where you turn flat like a little painting guy, it seems very inspired to me. To, to say you're fighting a boss whose shield is a surface. And I feel like they do a decent job of establishing the idea so you don't, you're not dropped in the boss chamber and you're like, what do I do? You, you should, at that point, recognize... Now, also, right before... So, they have that hallway where there's a couple uh, shields before the room where the pink thief hair girl is. Um, you know, the thief hair. Um, and uh, there's a couple there which, are, like, establish the idea. But then in order to get the boss key, which is the last thing you do before doing the boss room, it, it has the, the shield going back and forth. Which goes, this is a shield and it's moving. But without spoiling what the twist on that boss is going to be. So I still feel like you get the moment of like, oh, I can grab on there. The game doesn't go, they don't stop you. And then like Navi pops out and is like, oh, Link, you can grab onto the shield with merge ability. They let you have that moment, but they set you up. So you're not like, what do I do? And it's just, I, I, I love it. I loves it. It's good. Oh, chompy room. Where's Pink Link? I know. I miss him. Ba boop ba boo. You mean they convey the information to you? They convey it. You know. Oh. Try and get me now. Try and get me now. What are you gonna do about it? I'm just a little guy. Oh me? Oh, I'm so vulnerable. Yeah, get me. Oh no, I've been damaged. Oh look out! Ryan the Boin loins, huh? 
Now. Haha. -ha. High frames. Could also just probably run in a circle around this. How is he dodging them? Ow. He's only been hit zero times. It's all that cuckoo training. At work. Ow. Ow. Can you... I mean, Ryan the Boin Loins. Ryan the Boin Loins. The Boin Loins. I also like a dungeon that's kind of segmented like this. We have this separate area. Is this even the same dungeon map? It is, but they just call it a different floor. It's kind of nice. Uh, -huh. uh, left or right? Left is lucky. Right is... Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
get rid of that. He fell. Oh. Um. Yeah, that does... I'm still not sure how to get to this guy, though. So I see how I can get the, the, the gargoyle, like, up over here, I guess, but... Maybe I don't... Maybe we'll just keep running around, and then it'll eventually it'll make sense. Smarky. But I want big chest! Let me have... Hmm. Didn't want to go back to old school Zeldas. But they also said that, I think, uh, that following Tears of the Kingdom, they're like, we don't expect to make another game just like this. Big chest. You, you don't know what's in there. Could be a smaller chest. Huh. What am I missing? Oh, what's this guy for? Why is there why is there a gargoyle guy that I can push around? I'm gonna go over here. Huh. Can't, you can't just hook onto it. That would be silly. He was blocking the switch. Now he's not. Oh, because he was down there. Oh. So am I done with this room? Well, I'm not because I need to get that chest. But he's not part of the puzzle to get this. Come back for big chest. You come back for it? Oh. Because that's what this sliver on the top is. More sand. Okay. I, yeah, I did not piece it together. That moving him was what was preventing the air. Yeah, okay. All right. Thank you. We're good. Everything's fine. Can't hook shot big chest. This ain't Ocarina of Time. What do you think this is? A game where you can stuff? Got a sloopy. No. Hey. Hey. Quit it. Stop it. How can you say this game is mid? Ow. This game sucks. It's so having lots of games from Zelda I love because of the sequel to Link the Past, which I played the hell in back. That's also fair. Yeah, I'm not I'm not the biggest diehard Link to the Past fan. But I am glad that I played it before these. Kaboom! Was there like a puzzle I was supposed to do there if I didn't have bombs? Probably. Or just blow them up. I found the hidden room and I don't know because I hid it for myself. There's a hidden room. Oh. Um, uh, what did I do? What did I do here? Is it was a menu? That's where I came in. No. I came in over there. Huh. Hey, thanks. Yay. This is gonna be better if Link got power washed. It's good. I don't know if that's picking up my microphone, but there's a guy doing donuts outside and it's very loud for me. I think my microphone will probably do a decent job cutting it out though. Anyway, uh, over here? No, I can't. What was that, Drew Real Bluff? It picked up, probably when I was talking. Might have picked up a bit. No, not over there. Okay, let's head back up. Um, so how am I supposed to break this if I, oh. <laughs> with, probably with the mechanic from the way that the game is. That makes a lot of sense. Oh no. Yeah. It's just like, uh, like a Bob on Battlefield. 
Watch out for rolling rocks. Shit. Oh, oh, okay. Damn it, I didn't mean to drop down. But it's fine. Just means off the head. The next cycle. Hey, Peanut. How are you? Thanks for 20 months. Still in Vodland. Have fun with the remainder of the Thank you. Hope you're having a good. Kaboom. Has bomb valve go? It goes. Just like this song. That's the way it goes. It goes the way that it is. How do I get them rupees that are what on the thing? Ah, uh, just, just, just here. It's just like Pac-Man. All right, now we can go back. Now we got sand. Now we got what we need. Sand, my beloved. I got a big old key. There's also a room to the south, apparently. Which I can now access because there's sand. Or maybe there was always a way in here. How am I doing on fairies? We good on fairies. Help. Help. They're crunchy. Uh, and back over from whence we came. Because now I have a small key and a big key. So that I might venture onward. Tastes like magic. Delicious. No, 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 no. Him with sand. Got him. He wasn't expecting the pocket sand. Move the beam us all the way. Yeah, it's cute. He's like, oh no! Whoop. <laughs> oh. 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 I probably got. Yeah, that's locked door right there. Let's go shelf. Hello? Ooh. Hello? Hey. Darn it. Making my way uptown. Moving slow. Right. Need that. Alright. We okay, chat? We're doing good, game. How you doing? How you doing? Uh-huh. Oh. Hope you guys have been enjoying the sand rod because we're almost done using it forever. I think there's probably a couple pieces of heart or something, my mice that use them, but they definitely get most of their mileage out in this dungeon. Uh, hmm. Wonder if I need some sand in here. Maybe one or two my mice, maybe a couple. Who's one or two my mice as a treat? Who am I kidding, but a mama? You can have a hundred babies if you want. Oh, he was evil! What a ruse! What an absolute ruse! 
I thought you were puzzle pieces. Beautiful. Um, now then, with the things that I have, there was a locked door. Let's just say no. There we go. You want to stop arguing about video games? We're arguing about video games? I've just been running through the dungeon. Chat. No talking about video games in my chat. Oops. Uh. Gamers arguing. I mean, I'm fine with a healthy debate. But if we're getting heated or personal about it, you better cut it out. Uh, and then, boop. This is a game-free zone. Right. I'm here to talk about football, which is not a game. It's a sport. This is probably much slower if you don't just have bombs to just <laughs> go around and blow everything up. Pardon me. Hey. Diggins Riggins, change my mind. Can't be done. Ow. Rude. Hey. Okay, so then with with my newfound knowledge of being where I am. Where's the switch in here? Stop. Stop it. It's up there. How do I get there? Hmm. Hmm. God, I love the way that he is. Hey. Leave me alone. Oh. Maybe if I use the core mechanic. Shit. There we go. Hey, look. Although I maybe don't need them. I can just do it myself. I don't need you. I don't need any of you. There we go. Now we're good. Yeah, I know. I did that. Thank you. Although I shouldn't be cranky about it because how many times this dungeon have been like, huh? When I what? Chat's like, you did that. I'm like, I what? Nice. Hey, Buster. Get low, 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 low. Low rule. Who's ready for a bounce? Video games are no longer video games. Oh. Was that announced today? I missed that. Huh. Let's go. Oh. Maybe we should <laughs> be a little smarter about it. Good. Idea next uh, I need approval as president of Zelda MGS3 style survival espionage. I think it should be an open world game with survival and crafting mechanics. Wait, shit. Never mind. I tried to do a meme and it didn't work out. Uh, let's go. Let's fight the guy. It may work if you fall in again twice. That'll never work. An open world Zelda game where you make things? Coast is clear. Hup. Uh oh. Those are fun noises. Hello. Um. I'm, I couldn't remember, I'm like, is there something I have to do to make you vulnerable, or do I just run up and attack you? I think I just run up and attack you. Beat the dingle. I'm allowed to, uh, well, that may, that might be TOS, but... Hey. I love his noises. <laughs> These are very silly noises. Oh no. Punch him in the don't look, don't chat, don't look. No one look at stream. Stop staring.
No one tell Twitch staff what happened here. Oh, yeah, more sand will fill in the sand so we can walk on it. Yeah, no, that makes sense. Just add some more sand to it. Hey, Irene! Irene! It's you! Hey, this is what you look like. Did you know that's what you look like? You look like this. It's kind of silly. Hey. Come on, Irene. I swear on painting. At this moment, you are Irene. You seem unimpressed. Well, that is a nice dress. Oh, Irene. Your name's Irene. You came to rescue me. Well, I don't know what to say, dudes. You want a Big Mac from Wendy's? That's impossible. But, uh, hey, my fortune came true after all. Uh, well, why are you wearing blue? My fortune was about green. You took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? I was in big trouble. I've got to get back to my Graham. That's all right. I forgive you. Just don't take that long to rescue me next time. Do you plan on getting captured? And don't make any of the other sages wait that long either. Come on. Get to saving the rest. We got four. What? Want more thanks? Tell you what, dudes. Save all seven of us sages, then I'll write a big, long thank you letter. But for now, just be careful, okay? I like that she's sassy, but she cares. You know? It's not just, eh, hey, man, man. She's like, also like, stay safe out there. Let me, uh, let me hit him with the old, uh... Oh. Oh. There you go. It gets confused. It's just the light that makes it look blue. Mm -hmm. We're actually, we're actually still green. Okay, bye. Blue link to, yeah, blue makes them go faster. Because it's got the shortest wavelength of the visible light of RG. God damn it. I, 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 I forgot that they all go like here when you leave and that when there's more, you're like, I'm doing it. It just, it feels more impactful than like in Ocarina or something where you save that sage and they're like, thank you. And there maybe are other sages T-posing in the background, but you don't really get the same sense of progression of just having them all being there being like, yeah, it's such a nice little simple thing, but I feel like it goes a long way. Oh, lovely Zelda. Can you begin to comprehend how lucky you are? Such legends, such heroes, such of. We had legends, we had heroes. Low rule, had hope. Violet shorter, red's fat. It's, it's, listen. think with your heart, not with your, but all that is gone. Low rule has only me now, and your hero, of course. And if the hero of Hyrule fails me, oh, but I must have courage. He will succeed or all is lost. It's probably fine about the way that is. <laughs> what are you yelling about? What are you yelling about? Yeah, I'll save, fine. It's only like I did a whole ass dungeon. It's fine if my save gets corrupted and I have to do it again. You've been playing for a while, I want to take a break. Game game of the pause menu. Yeah. It is, it is, it is been, it has been a stream. Hmm. Hmm. Should check out the sanctuary here now. Oh. Did I get the big chest in there? Sure did. I can pick up big rocks. With relative ease. Um, we could do it now or we could do it at the start of next time. There he is. The second big chest. There's a second one? Did I get second big chest in there? It... Hydra after all that sand. Thank you. Did I? You did? You got the mitts. Yeah, but they said there's a second one. The mitts was the, would have been the first one. I remember you were like, how do I get that chest? That was the big key, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. You had me scared for a second. We're good. Good call, though. Because I was like, what is that? And I gotta get the Mets, baby! 
the Mets. Um, okay, screw it. Let's let's do it real quick. Uh, back to here, to graveyard. Back to Dampy. Hey, Irene here. Did I scare you? Boo. She's a broom. So, uh, thanks for helping me. And this whole thing about me being a sage, some kind of special girl. Wow, big surprise. Wish I could leave where I am now, but I'll have to keep sending my broom. You know, I really miss my gram. Can't wait to see her again. The broom. The broom. That was scary, I know. You doing okay, chat? This is a safe space to discuss if that was really spooky for you. Eh. Um, I can remove this pin. Yeah. Let's go. Irene Broom Pose. Huh. Um, I don't when the lamp turn. Lamp turn. Y'all got any of them torches? That's good. The skulls are just... Just to... Just to lull me into a false sense of spooky. But actually, everything's fine in here. Yo, we got a groupie! Let's go! Whoa! Big bats! Those guys aren't keys. There's something else, but I don't know what they're called. They're good. Yeah. Hey. Bang, 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 bang. There's a key up there. One dollar. It's more like a penny. I suppose it depends on the high rule. You know, rupeeflation and all that. Hey! <laughs> you were hiding behind my UI. Very rude. This is a big room. Um, stop it. Quit it. Yeah. Damn it. No. Wait, is there is there a thing? Mm, yeah. This thing. Sure is. Back in the day, you could buy a whole burger for a single green rupee. And they'd give you a shake. For the price of a single penny! Uh, 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 uh. Yeah. A ruby. Ruby, 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 ruby. I do you, do you, do you, do you. I want you do it, do it to me. I didn't get the key. Isn't it up here somewhere? Where the hell? Where are you? And we've reached the part of stream where I'm just like, you know, time to play the free association game. I forgot that this was like a whole little go through the sanctuary again thing. But it's gonna be worth. The reward is well worth. Should I pull the snake lever or the other lever? Oh! Oh! That's such a neat... The way that, that that they glow with the little shoot in front of them. Go. Oh. Pull the lever. Which one? Recklessness instead of wisdom. The Triforce of Recklessness. So this one was the right one. And this one brought in a bunch of snakes. So let's go with the one that's correct. That was the noise of good things happening. Because I wanted snakes! Okay, at least this one spawns in a bunch. I was complaining about how in Hyrule, it only spawned in like two or three little, little ropes. I'm like, that's not enough. Wrong lever! At least then, Laurel still gets it, like Link to the Past. If you have a snake lever in your dungeon, drop a bunch of snakes, not just like two. They get it. The Laurel, they're the OGs. They, they, they understand what's important. And hop. 
There's the second mask door we needed. We can bring it to the blacksmith. Oh, that was just here. Oh, that's what that chest. Oh, um, hey, don't mind me. I'm just gonna whoop. rock candy. Get crunching, chat. It's tasty. More sworder. It's a sordid affair. E. Get your bar stings at the ready, if you want. Um, back to uh, yeah, Kakariko. Close enough. Hey, have you met Mother Maya Maya yet? Hope so. Heard that you've helped her. She'll do nice things for you. I'm a little jealous how much she can help you out. She's got power. My broom will have to do. Off you go. Yeah, that wouldn't really be a helpful hint at this point. If you hadn't met Mother Maya Maya, you'd be like, huh? No, what? Where is, where is that? I mean, I'm glad they don't spell it out, but on the other hand, I'm just, I feel really bad for anyone that didn't start the Maya Maya quest until really late in the game. Because they're everywhere. Everywhere. Where? In the tree? You guys want to run around from chickens? You are in the tree. How are you? Jumping. Also, I did go the wrong way, didn't I? Hiya. Hello. Kali, where are you? He's got to be all right, dudes. Yeah, he's fine. Got turned into a painting. Funniest thing I've ever seen. Hey. May I share an emote? A Batatava emote? Do you need a permit? Can you lose exactly one dollar? I don't think that's possible, but... I, I see it at 2025 rupees. Good. Uh, here. Yeah. Were there no mods at the ready? I gotcha. Hey, how you doing? Oh, dudes! The wife and I. We've searched everywhere for Gully. The crunch. It's the cat crunching. The Mads went to bed. Good. I'm gonna not. But it is very good. I do like that cat. But thank you. Uh, but he's nowhere to be found. What if monsters got... No, there's no way. He's not our little boy. Tell me he's gonna be all right, dudes. He's a uh, painting. Nothing bad can happen to him. Sorry, give me a second here, dudes. Hey, there. You have two pieces of master ore, don't you? How about I temper that sword? All right. All right, let's get started. Can't wait to see how this beauty's gonna turn out. One moment. Can't do it. Hmm, impressive if I do say so myself. I doubt I'll ever temper a blade so fine again in my life. But I did all the work. I made this. I know there are a lot of things you've got to do. Maybe this will help you out some. You've increased the power of the Master's Sword, you can really feel the difference! Your sword is now red. I'm not asking for payments or anything, but do you think you could find Gully? Please? Now? Yesterday? Well then, I guess I should get back to work too. Boop, 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 boop. He really took the Master Sword, the legendary Blade of Evil's Bane, and just kind of glued some rocks onto it. This game predicted Tears of the Kingdom. Hi. That sword's my masterpiece. That blade couldn't get any sharper. No way, no how. Well, maybe if there was someone better at this than me, but I'm the best blacksmith in the world. So that's that. What, you found Rosso? That means, well, sure, it means he's safe. More importantly, we can start getting his ore again. He'll be gone a while longer. I suppose we can wait till, we can still take it easy. It's been a tough time lately. Yeah, he's fine. The only world that exists, he's the best one. It's faster. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Now I'm gonna wrap up for the day. But we got a lot done today. We got a lot of a lot of things. Got a bunch of my mys, got a bunch of hearts, even though I'm not really going on my way for him. Going out of my way for him. But now I think we have everything we need to get all the stuff. So we got we got a handful more dungeons to do next time. Three more sages to save 
and a bunch more Mayamais and stuff. Made through a whole stream. Hey, thanks. Appreciate y'all hanging and stuff. Let me uh, go save somewhere. Save in town. Uh, but let me get cop alerts and uh, send you off somewhere for a raid. Thank y'all for hanging. Hope you had a good time. If you were dipping it out because of Superb Owl or whatever. Hope you had a good, nice, chill Sunday. Saving complete. Dame dane, dame yo, dame nando yo. Ataka suki de suki suki de yo. Dore dake tsuyo i o sake de mo. You gama na yo, oi de ga. Baga me tai. Pay for the hammy! Track rock. Ugh. Ugh. I won the owl. Oh, Gam caught the owl! Congratulations, Gam. Look at that 3D Triforce, and then look at that. <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. Oh, cause I saved in the in in Hyrule again. Everything's good again. Look, everything's nice. Anyway, uh, what? Well, thank you for that, Track Rock. Um, let me get to that in one moment. Doctor Verb, thanks for 28 months. Sorry, I missed us meeting Hilda. I love her theme so much. Sounds instantly tragic and makes me cry within seconds. It's good. Dato TTV, thanks for 26 months. Yeet. Smash Mix on 96 bits. Uh, watching the big game on, uh, switched it to Nickelodeon, who's doing a Super Bowl from Bikini Bottom event. SpongeBob. Uh, Bailty, thanks for soup. The Owl of Athena or the Owl of Minerva has always been used as a symbol of knowledge, wisdom, and per perspicacity. On this day of the Super Bowl, the gift of non poo brain has been given. Use it well. Uh, I used it up in about three seconds and then immediately got poo brain back. It was like opening up the dam. And then just flooded back in with the poo. But thank you. Xander Cans, thanks for the prime. Welcome. Cave, thanks for 69 bits. Say quick equip five times. No. I can't say it once. Sis, thanks for 20, uh, 49. Woo hoo, Zelda. War Kingdoms of Zero, thanks for 33. That's like twice as good as three. Daft Boy Trunks, thanks for 63. Let's chat on Battle.net sometime. Sorceress Warcraft 3. Such an iconic line. Excessive censorship, thanks for 100 bits. The only Super Bowl I'll be watching is the one that holds the four Lord Souls. Put them in the bowl. Tornado Owl, thanks for 80 months. Now the GDQ is over, my Twitch sub moves back to the house. Thanks for the prime. I appreciate it. Smash thanks for 10 bits. Uh, look for the, looking forward to the food with the Super Bowl. Hell yeah. You got you, If you're gonna do a Super Bowl, you gotta have some munching. Bumble Bianca, thanks for 28 months. Can't think of a funny joke, so I have a question. Thank you for the 95 bits. I accidentally ended my sub message early, not like this. What I was gonna ask is, have you played much of the Mario Luigi series? What'd you think? Uh, yeah. I played Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. I have my, my I still have my box copy of it back there. Um, I have a bunch of GBA boxes that have survived somehow. They're a lot sturdier than like N64 boxes from my experience. Um, I adored S S uh, Superstar Saga and I, I keep thinking that when I'm like, okay, I have a big block of time in the stream schedule. I've been on an RPG kick lately, so maybe, I don't know about this month, but maybe, maybe this year um, we might do Superstar Saga. It's also on um, the Switch Online, so that'd be an easy way for me to stream it. Um, I remember liking it a lot. It, it's it's not a short game, so I'm like worried about streaming it, but people have expressed interest in it. It might be fun. Um, and then I played through Dream Team. No, I didn't play. I saw Dream Team in the chat. I played through Partners in Time, and I beat the game, and I went, eh. It didn't really click with me, and I don't remember exactly why. Just it, it, it didn't. Mario and Luigi, the first one, was just such a fresh, fun idea. And going, now there's babies, too, just didn't really add enough for me to be like, that was great. Uh, I didn't find the characters to be as memorable. I didn't think the overall plot and structure. Because the plot of Superstar Saga, the the inciting incident, is a witch came from the Bean Kingdom and replaced Princess Peach's words with explosives. That's insane that you can't do that. And they did, and it's great. And it feels like nothing else has lived up to that insanity in that franchise. So, um, yeah, I didn't really get into part of this time. Didn't play Bowser's Inside Story, which I know people have said very good things about. I'm interested, but also I know it's also not a short game. Uh, and then I didn't play Paper Jam because everyone said this one sucks. Um, and then I picked up Dream Team and got five or six hours in and it just didn't really grab me. Um, part of it's also that I'm just not a big fan. She, she swears a lot. Uh, I'm not a big fan of... I love the Mario Luigi pixel art style. I don't like that art when it's smooth sprites like in Dream Team and like in the Mario Luigi Superstar Saga remake they did. Something about it where it just, it doesn't quite jump out to me in the same way. Um, so, 
Yeah, I don't know. But yeah, that, 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 that is my history with those games. I But they're great, uh, even if I, they don't... I, I, I'm sad that... Uh, what was it? Alpha Dream? Alpha Team? Whatever the... Or is that Intelligent? I forget the developer. They they exploded. They went bankrupt. They got shut down, and I'm sad about it. Because uh, I still think their games were neat, even if they didn't, weren't all for me. Um, it's a downgrade. Yeah, it just doesn't quite do it for me. Alpha Dream, that was the one. Yeah. I always get them confused with uh, Intelligent System Works or whatever the hell their name is. Um, but yeah, yeah. Um, but I, I, was, I always found it baffling that to me, Paper Mario and Mario and Luigi had very distinct identities and mechanics as... Mario themed RPGs and then Nintendo went only Mario and Luigi is allowed to be an RPG Paper Mario has to be its own thing That's not quite an RPG and now we don't have either <laughs> So hopefully thousand year door sells well enough that they're like, okay, maybe we should make I mean Mario RPG Hopefully sold well. I don't know. Hopefully Mario RPG remake and thousand year door remake. is just like Give us more RPGs for Mario that have RPG mechanics. We're fine with it. Don't be scared Nintendo. It's okay. Um, Invaders and everything's running a bit. I haven't played this game in years. Something is very memorable about that ice elevator. It's just such a weird thing that doesn't really show up in other Zelda games. Of just this weird, like, it reminds me of Demon's Souls, where there's that kind of a contraption. Um, thank you. Jake and Bacon, thanks for 64 bits, uh, soup. Barry's face came up on the Super Bowl. You saw it, you caught the one frame where I just jump scared. Uh, Levi, thanks for the hammy. Have you seen the newest Death Stranding 2 trailer? Yeah, we talked about it for a bit. And I got confused in the dungeon, but thank you so much for the hammy. Gamer Dylan, thanks for 71 months. Lubin Dubin, thanks for 28. Popping in, avoiding the Swifty halftime show. Is it Swifty? Picaro Persona, thanks for 13 months. Yay. Bumble Bianca, gift the sub to Disco Inferno for their fourth month. Sunny Alice, thanks for the raid. Screaming Flamingo, thanks for 31 months. Glad to catch up. Catch this live. One of my fave Zeldas. It's a very good one. Bagel Thief, thanks for soup. Scoot Soup. Alcahest, thanks for soup. Smash Wings for 10 bits. Managed to sneak away from the thing. Hopefully I didn't miss too much. Yeah, I'm just running around stabbing stuff. It's all good. Uh, and thank you for the 10 bits and the clip as well. Banjo of Time gets it a sub to Calzone. Hungry for a Calzone now. Rex Rath, thanks for the raid. Smash Flicks for 10 bits. Uh, Mojo Nixon, who played Toad in the 93 live action Mario Bros. movie, passed away. I didn't hear about that. I'm sorry to hear about that. Uh, Garbage Nirvana, thanks for six months. Uh, talking about Bluetooth. Yeah, we got all that. Thank you again. Enjoy your golden key. Igorse, thanks for 65 months. That's a lot of months. Venus Runners, thank you for the dollar you do. Happy Valentine's Day. It's coming up. Hope everyone has a good one. I won't be streaming because it's uh, Wednesday, if I am not mistaken. But I hope people have a good or chill day. Uh, GM Sack, thanks for two years. Enjoy your house key. Two years in this accursed house, and I still have not found where my room is. The hallway floor is getting cold. Should I make like a blanket key and a hot cocoa key? And then you don't need to find a room. Smash thanks for 10 bits. And thank you for another clip. Uh, Happy Capster, thanks for the raid. And also 96 bits. After Porky ran off in time, his brother, Picky, decided to run away and become a derby boy. Kevlar, thanks for 71 months. Lonnie Lama, thanks for 69 bits. Smash for 69 bits. Kuko game reminds me, uh, apparently Flappy Bird turned 10 years old recently. Yowza. Neo Doodles and Soul Wolf, thank you both for the raids. Hope you had good streams. Unimaginative Peanut, thanks for 20 months. Buster Rubo, thanks for 69 bits. Track Rock, thank you for the hammy. Balotro is amazing. I beat the demo, quote unquote, which was a really good time. Right now, uh, but Z Between is an excellent game to listen to while grinding in Yakuza 0. Thanks for streams. I'm glad you enjoyed the Balotro demo. I really enjoyed it as well when I remembered how the game worked. Uh, Buster Rubo, give it a sub to Rafi Zar. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm going to wrap up. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Can you turn the Flappy Bird difficulty to maximum cock too? That's what he was gonna add. And then the Apple Store, I had to shut him down. That's how it happened. Um, uh, let's... Oh, a lot of people are streaming a lot of good stuff. Uh, let's raid Dan. It's, I, I'm assuming Dan finished Persona 3. I know he was grinding that for a while. Um, but he's doing some Sekiro now. I didn't want to raid him while he was doing Persona because I'm like, I don't want to see spoilers. But he's running, he's doing a Sekiro item and enemy randomizer. And he's currently fighting Headless Shigekichi, who's just a big old guy. Um, beat it last night. Oh my god. He was doing some long streams. That's a beefy game. Shadows die thrice. Go throw, yeah, if you're subbed to Dan, oh my god, to throw some dampy dumpers in his chat. Uh, otherwise, uh, I don't know. If you're subbed to me, you could throw out some bar stings and be like, look at this cool sword I found. Or, uh, the Dan Jones. Yeah. We got another Dan Jones and Dragons 
on the calendar for end of the month, I think? I don't remember. Game, do you remember? Do I have it in my calendar? I do. The 28th. The last Wednesday of the month. We're going to do another D&D session. Um, thank you. Good stream is fun to lurk. Thanks for lurking. And thanks again, thanks again, Silver Sugar, for, for the amazing dudes. Uh, next stream, VOD Watchers will be able, be able to see it in the chat. Um, thanks. This game, I'm having a lot of fun revisiting this game. It's really nice. Uh, I got nothing else to say about it for now. But see you next time. I don't know if we'll finish it next time. It might be possible, but regardless. Uh, maybe see you then. If not, have a going or whatever. You're rendering. No worries. Goodbye. Get out of here. Thanks for watching, Bob Watchers. Hope you are enjoying The Legend of Zelda, A Link Between Worlds. It is a link. I always talk, I always talk about it and I call it Link Between Worlds. Something about that, uh. Yeah, you know, it's pretty good. Anyway, hope you're watching and, and enjoying. I hope you're watching. I mean, if you're here, if you weren't, well, I mean, you could be listening, I suppose. I mean, watching in, in the not necessarily visual sense. What? I gotta go. Goodbye. Ugh.